Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Here at Hobbymaker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and checkout and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the combine order button. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? Welcome to Hobby Maker. I'm Sherilyn Lavery, kicking off the show with Debbie. Um, we have got a phenomenal brand new collection that is about to launch in a moment. Now, just before we talk about this, you're getting a little sneak peek right now. I will just give you a quick rundown of what's coming up today. Um, so, of course, kicking off the show here with Crafters Companion. Um, then two o'clock and also four o'clock, we have got Sandra joining us from Santangle. At three o'clock, I'll be on with Maria from Old May new we've got some brand new releases in that show um five o'clock and six o'clock you're back aren't I you i am for a double <laughs> yeah yes. absolutely I, like, I love a double hour show i you like know. a I double like hour, a yeah. hour you get to take a bit of pace don't you can get off earlier there you go even better <laughs> and then at seven o'clock sandra will be back with santangle as well so it's a lovely lovely show for you to be able to to watch today right up until eight o'clock now I am so excited about this. Well, we've, we've had a lot of buzz going off uh -huh. around this collection. Um, so and um, something a little bit different yes. from us mm -hmm. uh, at Crafters Companion. So this is our cosmic collection. And it really is, pardon the pun, out of this world. It is. <laughs> it is stunning from uh -huh. every single element. Mm -hmm. And don't worry, because we've got yeah. Lots of different mm -hmm. deals for lots of different exactly. pockets. Exactly, yes, which is From the, the best. full collection to a breakdown yeah. to things, so we've got mm -hmm. loads to cover. And, and I will just say, there's some individuals as well. And I'm just going to say, Shelley, yeah. there was one guy in particular uh -huh. that went strat is it stratospheric? Is yeah, that yeah, the right yeah. word? Yeah, that's right. But literally, yeah. literally mm -hmm. melted our internet last like, week. Wow. So okay. I'm just going to tell yes. you right now, one of those dies in there, which mm -hmm. we'll talk about later. We've got um, some available, which yes, is exciting. It's super exciting. Yeah. But this is a fabulous collection, Isn't it, Jess? And I knew you. You've been oh, in an hour in the I, know. I can't even believe yeah. they've actually captured what they have in the papers that you're going to get to see in a moment because yes, you've got all your boards, yeah. got all the papers out. Now, um, we just wanted to give you a little look at this, but what we're going to do is bring you this brand new launch and we'll be doing it, like we say, for everybody's price pocket as well. Mm -hmm. We'll see you in a second with this. to get to our own desk like we must be moving off and it was like no 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 get back here um <laughs> you you even saw like jimmy in the background there thinking there is no way that that we can fully get cope with all of this like what are we for you mine were easy mine was super easy but for you it were a little bit harder and, uh, let me come back and, in and let I'm, me come back in <laughs> see i i literally i'm just two seconds away Sherilyn were like what the i've got to get over there I'm going five four i'm not a runner i'm not a runner um i was like oh goodness me <laughs> anyway there we are <laughs> great start to the afternoon that's exactly. what I'm we got our steps in there didn't we it's a bit, <laughs> a bit of fitness kick for us 
<laughs> Brilliant. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to launch everything individually yes. onto the website. Yeah. So if you go to the website right now and you press on Watch Live, you will be able to see everything that's coming up on today's show. And like Debbie said, we know there are certain dyes, particularly one, which will probably sell out in a matter of seconds. It then will not be able to be available individually. But look at the size of this collection. You know, the amount of dyes, the paper yeah, pads we've that got, we've got. We've got stencils, mm -hmm. we've got stamps, yeah. we've got um, embossing folders. Mm -hmm. um, there's the dyes and stamp sets in there. We've got foil transfers in this one. We've got glitter paste. Mm -hmm. We've got, oh, honestly, it just goes on and on. But I think we'll break it down. Yes. I think yes. we'll break it down Definitely. a little bit. And yeah. I'll show you more detailed boards because I always yeah, think, I think the packaging so. looks beautiful. Yeah. And it really does. It's got that lovely it has, yeah, feel yeah. to this one, um, that cosmic mm -hmm. feel. Uh, but I will break it down yeah. so that you can see them individually. Well, you want to what see what's inside, like. don't yeah, you? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so yes. Do you want to pop the, over so you've got the ball? Well, we'll kick I'm, off I'm with happy. The... Yes, okay. I'm happy to talk so about this. Yeah. We'll kick off with what you can see here at the top row, which is your essential bundle, okay? So this is where you're getting your stamps, you're getting your dyes, you're getting your stencils, your embossing folders as well. This is yeah. something you're going to use forever. The, I think this, because this is what we call the hardware mm -hmm. of a collection. Yes. So it's the things that are going to last forever. Nothing in here is going to ever, and it's never going to date. No, it's so, It's never so going to date this one. Yeah. And it is that one that's, I mean, from the lovely sentiments that are on there, mm -hmm. um, they're going to cover and cater for lots of different occasions as well mm -hmm. uh, but like I said metal dye stencils embossing yeah. folders um, there's tons of things and, and with things like stamps you can be doing things like your heat embossing techniques mm -hmm. things like your stencils you're gonna be putting your pastes your inks your sprays yeah. mm -hmm. absolutely all sorts through there and of exactly. course you can emboss with them as well mm -hmm. so there's so much you're gonna be able to do with that hardware of that collection yeah definitely now you can see there is a lot isn't there that is there now this should be 92 pounds 88 as always if you decide to buy it as a bundle you'll always get an additional saving with this so we will take this straight down for you and instead we're going to bring that to you under 80 pounds so a fabulous saving there and i think it's when you see the images on these yeah. i just feel like with the stars you know yeah. with the moons it, it's really magical it's something as well that i think would cross over for all ages yes. and on all different yeah. kind of occasions all different occasions absolutely and it's that it's it, it for me like i said this is not your butterflies this is not no. your flowers this mm -hmm. is something different yeah exactly and um, which is why it's already proved to be a runaway success um, and I'm so excited to be bringing it here to Hobby Maker for the first time. Mm -hmm. um, so a really, really beautiful set. And like I said, I'll break it down for you in a moment. Yes, You'll see every individual item so that you can see what you've got. Yeah. And get it on split pay. That's yeah. what I'd say as well. You've got that there for £40 if you want to take advantage of it yeah. on split pay, which is fabulous. Now that means you are looking at £6.66 per packet. Oh, that's very good. It's really good, isn't it? Absolutely, mm -hmm. yeah. I like, I like a deal like that. I know, that, I do as well, yeah. I like yeah. Like You're that. sitting there thinking, oh, what for the dyes? For the embossing folders, for the stamps? Yep, all of them. £6.66 <laughs> for you to be able to get that. Now, the second way to buy this is to buy it as the paper pad bundle. So you can see the second row that we've got just down there. There is a lot in There's this. There's a lot there. in this. And again, I'm going to break it down for you yeah. so you can see absolutely everything. Mm -hmm. But we've got a little patch. I love a little patch. I know, I know. Um, mm -hmm. But you know what? I don't know who that young man is on the camera. I've this not is met Levi. him before. Oh, you've um, not met him before. No, I've yet. not met him before. So there's a new face. Yes, he's quite new. Um, uh, I'm an old face, but he's a new face. <laughs> Exactly. Uh, so, hello, Levi. Thank you very much. Foil <laughs> transfers, six by six paper pad. We've got a beautiful 12 by 12 mm. pearlescent paper pad. We've got printed, wait till you see them, 12 uh -huh. by 12 papers in there. We have got a mix of glitter cardstock and uh, mirror card in a 12 by mm -hmm. 12. And then lastly, oh my mm -hmm. goodness, <laughs> glitter ombre A4 oh, sheets. And you're going to yeah. be, oh, well, you're just going to love uh -huh. them. Encapsulated uh, glitter them. cardstock. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to show you. Yes. Because while ever it looks lovely in the packaging, I know. you can't see yeah. what it looks like in yeah. flesh. So and and we were that. literally just like looking through it just before the show, wasn't we? We were like, oh my gosh, look at this, look at this. It is absolutely divine. We'll give you another saving. Of course we will if you want to get all of those. Um, I personally feel like it's so great that we're actually doing a paper pad collection yes. as well. Because yeah. I know that usually you'll buy, say, like one of the full bundle, and then you'll think, well, I'll have an extra paper pad. You could now get all of them in all another bundle, them, which yeah. is nice. And for me, it's the consumable part of a collection. Yes, exactly. Um, and mm -hmm. like I said, what a what a consumable yeah. part. Uh -huh. This is something absolutely beautiful. And it may be that you don't want all of them, like we said, this yeah, is yeah. How many do you want to? But you yeah. want the papers. Yes. You, uh, honestly, wait mm -hmm. till you see them, and I'll, I'm going to show yeah. you it again in a second. Just price straight down on are. that, seventy nine ninety nine, and of course you have got that on a two way split pay as well. So you're looking at thirteen. £13.33 per pound if you wanted to look at it like that. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because let me just tell you, 
ombre glitter card, uh -huh. encapsulated glitter yes. card at the top to get that for that price. Uh, 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 12 by 12, 12 pads yeah, uh -huh. to get at that price. That really yeah. is a great Isn't deal it? when you break it down mm -hmm. like that. Absolutely. Absolutely phenomenal. Then we've got a third bundle that we're going to give you a chance to see as well, um, which of course is on the third row. So another look at the card that we can see there. And then we'll be offering you everything as well. So don't worry, there's lots yeah. of different ways to um, be And I this. think, because it, it, looks little, it looks a little sad, lost and lonely all on its own. <laughs> can I just tell you? But this is the embellishment uh -huh. part yes. of the collection. So we have got in this one, you've got a lovely glitter, um, mm -hmm. sorry, gilding flakes and glitter. Uh, I say, start it again. <laughs> Here we go. A gilding flakes yep. set with your uh -huh. glue in there, your buffers and your dry stamp yep. pad. You've got a big tub of beautiful sequins that match mm -hmm. the colour tones in all of this collection. You've got two of our shimmer sprays in there, so that's that lovely mica yep. fine uh, mm -hmm. mica that's in there. Yes. You've got two as well, and because of the cosmic feel, we've given you the silver and the gold. Mm -hmm. So we've Perfect. got the. Um, uh, um, Oh, I'll get it right in a minute. The metallic pens in there. Yeah, uh -huh. I think you said something else then. <laughs> and then lastly, um, in that collection, and I'm just trying to open Levi, I'll go back down for you so I can remind me, because I'm... Um, glitter paste, yes. Debbie. Yeah. How could there you forget are. your glitter paste? <laughs> I've even done a demo with the glitter paste. I can't believe I forgot. Uh, but you're absolutely stunning. This is the embellishment mm. part, mm -hmm. which, again, um, will work with all of it yeah, if exactly. you want to, you know, bets. And all your other collections as well, yeah. which is what I love absolutely. about that. Absolutely. Bets, bets, mm -hmm. bets. We've got an even better Yeah, deal, we have. We? Yeah. The best way, as always, is to get it as one big bundle because that is always where you will get your biggest saving. We will let you know that we are limited on mm. this big bundle. I'd love to be sitting here and saying, yeah. I've got, you know, I've got 100, I've and got I'll, 300. I'll, yeah, but I'll tell you why. We, we just couldn't because there's certain elements yeah. so that we yeah. just got, we haven't got enough stock mm -hmm. of. So it's a very limited yeah. uh, quantity in what we've got in terms of exactly. the whole collection. Yes. Yeah. Um, the cosmic collection in whole. Yes. Now, it should be £230.77. You can see you are getting so much with that. So from your stamps to your dyes to your embossing folders, your stencils that are there, um, your papers as well from your 12 by 12 to your 6 by 6, your cardstock, that ombre, the glitter card, yeah. all of the essential, the gilding flakes that we're seeing there, the glitter paste, the, 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 the paint, the markers. It just it just goes it, it, on and on, it's doesn't it? It's the ultimate uh -huh. collection. It's absolutely. absolutely everything. There isn't anything else mm -hmm. in there that we can add to it. Yeah. It's the full kick mm -hmm. is everything yes. um, in there. And I really can't wait for people to actually see it because like yeah. you say, it looks great here set up, but actually I'm going, I want you to see <laughs> those papers because I've seen them, I've seen how amazing they are. I want you to see, you know, there's some gorgeous samples over there you'll be able to see and it's kind of getting to start working with this that you go, yeah. oh, yes, I see how this all builds up and how yeah. it all works together. I actually did a Facebook Live last night. Did you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. from my craft room. Did a little Facebook last night using this collection. Love that, yeah. Um, only two hours long this time, uh -huh. the first one. <laughs> uh, but you could go back and watch that as well. But I am going to get some demos in today yep. as well mm -hmm. um, that's just a little small selection of what you can be creating uh, with that uh, beautiful mm -hmm. beautiful collection and it really is it's, it's just it? out of this world. It's gorgeous. And we are under £200, so you're getting over £30 saving if you'd like to get it all. And don't worry, split pay comes in for way today, so you oh. can actually, I know, like for take week. it home for £50. So if you want to take it home for that, um, you absolutely can. It'll arrive after one payment, and then you can pay your others across the next few months as well, which is fabulous. Um, so, yeah, a really, really stunning brand, brand new collection. All of the individuals on the website, if you're sitting there and you're thinking, wow, there's a particular one I want to see, give us a little message as well and we can always come to anything directly for you should we go and have a look at the boards yes, yes. shall we yeah, yeah, shall we I shall so. now we've got oh let, let's let's move this way i can go this go way on. yeah because i'm there at me firstly mm -hmm. um and um I'll, do you know what, I'll tell you what, shall we, yes. I, I'll take you through, yes. I'll take you through the essential collection. Yeah, yeah, fabulous. So yeah. if I just move this to one side mm -hmm. i'm going to start with the dies now i'm going to start with can i just say start with a die mm -hmm. that we don't have at head office. This is sold out. This is sold yeah. out. So you yeah. can't get this on our website. Mm -hmm. It's completely sold out. So I'm going to show you it. And it is honestly, it's just beautiful. Yeah. Um, this is the Stardust die. I adore this die. Wow. Um, it's that lovely swirling of stars, mm -hmm. that lovely galactic feel to it. Um, and it really is absolutely beautiful, this die set. This is the one that sold out, which is why we can no longer wow, offer it as a full that. collection anymore. Um, and that's why we've got a very limited mm -hmm. um, for the ultimate collection. So if you want the full lot absolutely make sure but this is individual and you can get it right now if for those people that missed out this is absolutely stunning and when you've cut into your cardstock what you've actually got there is all of that stars that you class as waste 
it's not waste because it's cut out all those beautiful stars for you. Um, and when I come to show you the papers, this is the kind of thing that you can be cutting into as well. We're oversubscribed, I will let you know. Oh. We've actually got, oh, yeah, four times as amount it, of people yeah. looking at that compared to availability. So first come, first serve on that. It will be available, of course, in the Essential Collection and the Full Collection, but if you want it on its own, 9 99 but very, very, I think we've got two or three left, that's it. So the rest, I'm going to take you through the rest of the Essentials. Yeah. One of my favourites, mm -hmm. I can't stop using this dye. And I just, I absolutely love it. It's those gorgeous superstar dyes, <laughs> and it really is. And, and the fact that of matter is that you're getting all of these dyes for, for the price that you're seeing. And again, this is an individual yeah, that you can it? get hold of if it's just one of them that you want to get hold mm -hmm. of. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, do you want to see some more dyes? Yes, please. <coughs> Excuse yeah. me. Planet Shaker. Amazing. Make a nice shaker card. Wouldn't it? You want yeah, to. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. But again, lots and lots of lovely stars. And none of those stars are duplicated from the other ones. Mm -hmm. So if you get in the whole of it, that looks, I just love that. Mm -hmm. And it's actually going to work with something else. So I'm going to bring this in just for a second so you can see the over the moon. Oh, I love that. Wow. <coughs> just look as well, actually, how that has created Absolutely. the world in that yeah. sense. Do you want a drink? Uh, okay. Yes, please. If yeah, I could, you a nice bit of water, water would, um, it would tickle the... Tickle the <laughs> Tickle the tonsils. Tickle the tonsils, Tickle that the makes tonsils. sense. Soon as you come in the aircon, <laughs> isn't it? It's, it's all the talking I did last night on my live, that's what it is. <laughs> uh, but no, this is a beautiful one as well. Yeah. And again, you can buy this individually if you mm -hmm. want. So this is called Over the Moon. Um, it's got its stamps, and then you've got the corresponding die to be able to mm -hmm. cut out your two moons, your half crescent moon. I always think of the, um, do you know the biscuit advert? Jaffa yes. cakes. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Every time I look at that die, I think of the Jaffa cake. Yeah. Oh, it has already, already sold? sold out. Yeah, a lot of people are jumping on the web in advance, so do this get involved thing, if yeah. you want to so get these bits individually. This is, this is yeah. it. We're giving everybody a chance to be able to get hold of, yes. whether they just want one or two items mm -hmm. from the collection, or whether you want to go for like certain bundles, but that complete collection means you get everything that I'm going to yes, show you exactly. um, in the next few minutes. Mm -hmm. And we'll move on to some of our stamps and dies. I love this one. It's called Love is in the Stars. Oh. I mean, to be fair, Valentine's is around the corner. It is. This really is going to work beautifully. So you've got that gorgeous yeah. stamp, then you've got the die set so you can either yep. use it as a stamp independently on its own or you can use mm -hmm. the die independently on its own or combine them together you're going to create your full cutout. I just pieces. love that geometric you know. Yeah the, that lovely that. dotted and it's actually a little bit of a theme running through some of the foil transfers which I'll show oh, you okay. at the moment. Mm -hmm. yep. Some more of the beautiful stamps that are in oh, this. Wow. This is the Milky Way mm -hmm. stamps there. I love this. Oh, it's almost like that gorgeous that mm. swirling pattern of yes. stars which is just stunning. Wow. Yeah cats i'm going to agree with you on that one fairy tale yeah, looking. yeah. it's got a lovely fairy as cool of course it's cosmic yeah. but of course you've got that lovely fairy tale to it as well oh, gorgeous. Uh, do you want to see some more stamps i'm, I'm, I'm just got to by the 5.99 it's a it's a big oh, yeah. one i'm like what yeah Great absolutely price. yeah um now the next in the stamps uh -huh. is the orbit collection okay this love is cool. this one as well yeah i love that swirling orbit mm -hmm. with those small little planets and again some stamp size at uh, stamp start Oh, my days. <laughs> Star stamps on there as well. I would get it out right in the end. Um, and they're all individual. Can I just tell you, these are individual. That's not like a Brilliant. one yep. stamp plate. It's all individual mm -hmm. ones. So for creating all your background pieces, Definitely. that's going to look lovely. Yeah, love we that. need some sentiments in our life. Yes. Look at these sentiments. These are gorgeous. Mm -hmm. um, you're a superstar. Love yeah. that one. Always going to use that, aren't oh, you? Oh, absolutely. Um, you've got You well. Are Out of This World. Mm -hmm. Love that one as well. Yeah. Um, I love you to the moon and back. Mm -hmm. Tell my grandkids that every single yes. time I yeah. see them because I absolutely do. And Reach for the um, Stars. Reach for the, the Stars. Sort of uh, we've got Friends are Like Stars. You can't always see them, but they are always there. Uh, that's a lovely sentiment. Gets to it? me every time, that mm -hmm. sentiment. Mm -hmm. And then Shoot for the Moon. Even if you miss, mm -hmm. you'll land among the stars. Yeah. Isn't that lovely? Yeah. So uh, some really lovely And what's so nice? about them again is like we were saying that is going to work on so many different levels so many different occasions look at that beautiful sample you did thank you very much well. that's the one i made yeah i made night. that last night on my facebook live really <laughs> thank good. you very much Sally, <laughs> give me a little plug there with me yes, uh, exactly. <laughs> now do you want to see some more di uh, more dies now this is a die set okay. and a stencil set okay. and it's actually I'll, and i'll show you again right. that close-up which is what i used last night yeah, yeah. um you've got the mystical moon mm -hmm. two-part die set so you've got a nice circular 
dye, which means yeah. you can cut out that complete that a complete collection mm -hmm. there. Um, or you can just cut into your cardstock by removing the outer part. Now, the other part of that is, and in, this is in your packet, you will get this gorgeous okay. stencil as well. We were having such a giggle last night because, of course, it's your mystical moon clouds. Mm -hmm. However, people were telling me they can see humper lumpers <laughs> if they put it in orange. People said they could see a little moustache. I was thinking there. that moustache. Yeah, <laughs> little moustache in there. Uh, so we were having a right little giggle last night with her because they were coming up with all sorts of things. Brilliant. But of course it works beautifully in combination yes, yeah. with that as well, which is what I actually did there. This was the make oh, that I used. Yeah. I told you I love those stars, I can't help myself. Yeah. But can you see the background using some inks uh -huh. and then that piece that sits onto the top? I mean, this is a beautiful, wow. beautiful um, dice, uh, dice yeah. set with that stencil. Yeah, both those so that's your mystical moon. Yeah. And again, you can get that on its own. Mm -hmm. um, ready to see some more? Yeah. It's like oh, more, more, more. Stencils galore. We've got stencils galore now. Uh, Starry Night, mm -hmm. beautiful stencil. And this is coming in a two pack. Okay. So you're getting your Starry Night mm -hmm. and this gorgeous oh, wow. cosmic with the planets. Gosh. Absolutely stunning. So that's a two pack that co oh, it's gone. Sold uh, out. I was going to say four pounds. Was that the price that I just saw on that? Four yeah, pounds. Yeah. So the only way you can get this now is in the essential in the collection essential or, the or the full collection. bundle. Yeah. yeah, a lot have sold out now. To be I'm not. I'm not surprised. I said to you, yeah. I think the individuals would go first. Yeah. Embossy folders. Love an embossy oh, folder. Great. And this one is your Cosmic Constellation, yeah. a 2D embossy folder that is absolutely stunning. Mm -hmm. um, Absolutely beautiful. How is Six that by four? Again? I know, it's honestly, <laughs> so crazy. But look at that beautiful. Um, yeah. You can always imagine, like taking your great big telescope, looking a bit to the oh, sky and seeing these stars, yeah. constellation. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm fascinated by all of that. I but well, yeah. I just think that is absolutely stunning. Yeah. Now there's one more embossing folder, okay. but it's an embossing folder with a difference. Go on then. Because it's the moon and stars, okay. and it is this beautiful 3D embossing yeah, folder. Yeah, yeah with a die now we launched something pretty similar in a collection and we've brought it into the cosmic collection yeah. so you've got two choices that you can use this okay. use as a 3d folder yeah use as a die that you then pop it into your 3d folder to create this uh -huh. and i'm just going to bring a sample in just to show you what i mean yeah because um this beauty that kerry noon did for us oh, wow. is showing that off to perfection isn't it it is mm -hmm. absolutely beautiful it gives you extra sculpture extra dimension take your inks mm. take your colors whatever it is that you want to use but i can promise you you will love that die and um, embossing. That's the first set. time I've seen a die set with an embossing folder coming together. It's such a good idea. It is, it? absolutely. So all of that that you've just seen, which is a lot, isn't it? That is your essentials collection. So if you're thinking, well, I want all of them, loads of them are sold out individually, you can get it as part of the essentials collection. £79.99, so you do get an extra saving. We also have that available on a two-way split pay. So, of course, you can take this home for £39.99 today if you would like to get it because Stardust has sold out on its own. Over the Moon has also sold out on its own. Um, so there isn't Starry Night has also sold out on its own. So there's quite a few bits that have already sold out. So you're not able to get this full collection now unless you buy it this way because you can't get those individuals. So and plus you're getting a few savings aren't you as well so it's like getting a few chucked in for free also um so well well done if you get it. it's a huge huge amount or of course they're available in the full bundle but we're gonna look oh wait until you see these we're gonna look oh, the paper pads i, I know and I'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna save your papers i'm gonna show you in a second yeah uh -huh. uh, this is the paper pad so this is where you can either go for them now have we got these on individual cap yeah we have so yeah. you've got individual options you've got the yep. uh, paper pad bundle as an option yeah. and then of course you've got the full co complete yeah, collection fab, isn't it? i love foil transfers Mm -hmm. These are out of this world. They're absolutely beautiful. Now I'm going to show you the board because yes. this is all the designs you're getting. Wow. You're actually getting six designs. You're getting two of each. Oh my God, I love this. So cool. Honestly, it's absolutely beautiful. You can cut into them yeah. if you want to. Use little uh, areas of them, oh, but look, look. look. Oh. And and you're also getting so you're getting twelve sheets. Uh, sorry, twelve sheets of the transfers okay. and twelve sheets of your silver foil that you need for it as, as well. well. Okay, and brilliant. we've kept it silver yep. because of course it's cosmic, and that's yeah. the kind of thing when you look up at the sky at mm -hmm. night. That's the kind of thing you see: yes, yeah, yeah. white, twinkly, it silverish is, yeah. kind uh -huh. of feel. Um, so that is your foil transfers. Mm -hmm. Everything's in there, but that's it yep. stripped back so you can see it. And like I said, you're getting twelve of yeah. each in there. Brilliant. So I'm going to pop them back underneath. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to do. I'm going to do on break. Go on, do it. I have to because I absolutely <laughs> love this. Now I'm going to get this out. Mm -hmm. Five of each in these colours. Okay. Wait till you see them. They are, oh, wow. oh my God, ombre 
encapsulated yes, glitter yeah, uh, yeah. stock, a card stock. Debbie, get your words out. <laughs> uh, there's only one other place that I know that do ombre, and this is absolutely stunning. I love the colour The ombre is just these. perfection, though, it's, isn't it? it honestly, it it's it. just absolutely beautiful. I'll try and do it that way. Oh, look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, he's good. Where have you got him from? Yeah, you can really see the Is that way? Oh my God, oh my God, look at that uh -huh. one, I love that. The colourways are stunning. Oh, and like yeah. I said, you're gonna get uh, 25 mm -hmm. of these. Mm -hmm. So you've got five colourways and five of each. And you can see these beautiful, oh my God. Oh, it's just captivating, stunning. isn't it, yeah. Honestly, Sherilyn, I mm -hmm. never, ever, ever thought we would do this. Mm -hmm. I'm so pleased we have. Uh, my only gripe is it's not in a 12 by 12. <laughs> Yeah, true. I'm we greedy. Want I want we more. Want more, more, more. <laughs> I've told the guys that at head office, I'm like, give me more. <laughs> um, I'll take nice. this for now, though. Let me just tell you because. Oh, and then a full rainbow one. I left it for the end. I left it for the end because, wow, that, wow. seriously, it's like a rainbow. Isn't it? Oh, and you're my. getting five of each of those colourways that I've just okay. shown you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all encapsulated, I can promise you. I would say I'd done the beard desk, but I've shaved this morning, so I can't. <laughs> Money kid in the money kid. <laughs> uh, but honestly, absolutely it's beautiful. Fifteen ninety nine on its own. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it, Shirley. I'm gonna save You're it. like save that one. Let's wait till last for a second because <laughs> we've got more twelve by twelves. Okay. Oh, I love this. Yeah. Now then, how good's I leave? I can. We're kind of coming close for this one. Mm -hmm. This is our mirror cardstock. So I'll mm. try and do it mm -hmm. this way so you can see it. Yeah. Look at the blues. Wow. Twelve by twelve. Um, lovely colourways. Oh. That hot pink in there. Then you've got the silver, and then. Yeah. Yay. You've got glitter cards as well. Can I just stop there for a second? Oh, oh my life. Gosh, that colour. I adore that turquoise. I've never wow. seen that colour way before. No. Um, absolutely beautiful. You're getting three mirrors, four of each. Right. Okay. And you're getting three glitters, four of each oh, as I like well. The and that well. is like a I almost call that a pewter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Absolutely stunning. It's cosmic. That's what it, it is. is isn't it's it? cosmic. Phenomenal. Because it's gonna go with that collection. Mm -hmm. So that's your 12 by 12. Okay. <sighs> Amazing. I'm telling you, I will promise you I'll get a demo in. Uh-huh. Are you ready for the pearl lesson? Yes. And you'll notice something running through all these papers. Mm -hmm. They all match. Exactly. They all perfect. colour coordinate. Mm -hmm. um, absolutely glorious. <laughs> oh my oh, god, it's absolutely well. juicy. Pearlescent oh, colours. Wow. And every single one of that that would go yes. beautiful with that turquoise Wouldn't glitter mm -hmm. cardstock. The purple. They're like powerful colours, aren't oh, they? Oh, so they're strong. so bold, so bright. I missed the colour. Let me go back. Pink. The paler pink mm -hmm. of the two and the uh, I call that the lovely it's like a mm. it's like a plum berry kind of yeah, colour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're going to get Phenomenal. 24 sheets of that. Yeah. And you've got six colourways in there, four of each. Brilliant. So absolutely yeah. stunning. So mm -hmm. that's your 12 by 12. Phenomenal. £19.99 for that. I've now, seen the best to last. Yeah, we've been waiting for Oh this. my God, I am telling you right now. And I've took mine out. You are going to get yes. 24 sheets, but I've took mine out. Yeah. So you're going to get to see them properly because mm -hmm. um, yeah. the paper pad's lovely, but I don't want to flick. No, you need to, don't you? Cheesy peeps <laughs> is all I'm going to say. Our crazy uh -huh. favourite expressions. Uh -huh. I absolutely adore this paper pad. It's not only galactic, cosmic and everything else. Mm -hmm. um, it is pearlized, it's pearlized, it's pearlescent. Nice. Um, and there is no such thing as a B-side. No. Because both of How these, did you choose? <laughs> it's a double A-side. Those old enough will remember what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. um, but honestly, absolutely stunning. So you're gonna get two of each of these that I'm away to show you. Yeah. Now I will tell you a little story behind this because they look uh, almost like you have popped your head uh -huh. through an a well, you won't put your head through a telescope. You put your eye through a, maybe you yeah. put your eye through a telescope. It yeah. looks like you've gone down the lens it of does. a telescope and taken mm -hmm. it. And do you know what we've done? Ah, Liam told me this. Go on. We've taken images of the real galaxy. So that's why it looks so real. Yeah, and that's why you've got this realistic feel. Oh, now, I'm going to tell you, the guys and the girls up at head office on Leanne's wow. team with our paper pads just blow me away every time. I don't think I've ever been blown away as much no, with this. No. Um, the colourways are stunning. Do you mind if I just show you every single side? This is wall art. That's this the thing is as well. You could just frame this, pop it straight up. Yeah, this is stuff that you can absolutely pop on your mm. walls. Oh, um, I absolutely adore them. And I'm just going to show you. I can't you. choose a favourite. That's there is thing. not. I'm Everyone telling you. Right this is incredible. Now, and I, I know for a fact um, oh, I'm getting an order in because I need more yeah, of this yeah, in my life. Yeah, this definitely. is absolutely stunning. Wow. So Literally. good. Still 15 99 Honestly. for the 12 by 12. And you are getting um, 24 sheets and mm -hmm. there's um, 12 designs. There's 12 designs in this. Wow. Okay. Uh, and two of each. Two of each. Um, yes. And again, the colourways just look phenomenal. 
it's just it's magical, it. isn't it? It's just, oh my gosh, so <laughs> Honestly, which one do you choose, Charlie? I, I, I can't. Oh, I can't. Oh, Every time you come to another one, oh yeah, that's my favourite. Oh no, that's stunning. my favourite. <laughs> and this is definitely wow. one to get your hands on because this, I seriously do mean this, they are a limited run. Look at that, yeah, that's With the thing. any of our collections, yeah. we do not stock this forever. No. So if this is something that you've got your eye on and maybe you just want to take one or two mm -hmm. little elements, those singles, those who've got them, mm -hmm. Absolutely, oh, well. do that, but please, please, please make sure you get this gorgeous 12 by yes. 12 printed yeah. cardstock. And if 12 by 12 is too big for you, now the reason I love 12 by 12 is because you can cut into yeah. it. Doesn't matter, but don't it? worry, because. Oh, you forgot you'd also got the six by six. We've scaled it to size. Yes. It's a little baby. It's exactly the same. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, Galaxy's in <laughs> pocket, I love that. Uh, but again, it's exactly the same. So yeah. all we've done, and if I just show you one, you'll get the gist. We've oh. scaled it to size. So all the papers that I've just shown you, yeah. Or in, in the there. six by six, and again you get in twenty four, twelve, twelve designs, and it's just so affordable at six pounds ninety nine. You know, for everybody, you can probably you can probably get. It. So, <coughs> that opportunity a lot of people are multi-buying so massive massive well done if you have managed to get that um oh i'm blown away by it i really am you could be you could be spending this money to go and see the northern lights you won't see them probably because no one seems to and you could just look at that and be like i'm there um now you can get all of those individually we've got brilliant prices of course for them individually but there is a saving if you want to get the paper pad bundle so everything that debbie just showed you you can get within this okay and you will get that at 79.99 that's three 12 by 12 paper pads you also get the six by six paper pad you get your eight by eight foil transfers as well that come with this and your a4 glitter ombre card um and it is um a fabulous price there that's 79.99 you can take home on split pay as well so just 39.99 today um and of course takes that then down to just over 13 pounds per one to be able to get this um do, do you know what as well though i mean i i would want a couple because i'd want to just kind of just Absolutely. look at them Absolutely. as crafters we always joke about mm. it one to one to use one to stroke <laughs> yeah. one to sniff and stroke uh, but seriously yeah. this is something you're going to use i mean yes. time and time and time i'm again. thinking as well right you know like sometimes you need a bit of a pick-me-up to make yeah. you feel a bit more positive if you had one of them with like a nice little sentiment on you could walk out your door every day looking at that and you'd feel like yeah do you know what i can yeah. go and have a great day i'll achieve something today. absolutely fabulous um okay. are you ready to see the other part yes. of the collection Come on please just a little this is the little, I call it the little embellishment. embellishment. We, honestly, it is nothing little. It's absolutely stunning and mm -hmm. I love this. We've popped some glitter paste in here for you. Now it's the chunky glitter and I say okay. paste. It, yep. Honestly, this is something else. You're going to add texture. You're going to add sparkle. Oh my life. Mm. And it's going it's to match your again. collection. Yep. Um, so I absolutely love this. And this is not just for your card making. You can use this through your stencils. Mm. You can take it into your own deco. You can take it into your mixed media. Yep. Um, so a lovely little pot of that that's stunning amazing. colour. Mm -hmm. It is exquisite. Love that. So that's on its own if you want as well. Yes. Yeah, yeah, However, that <laughs> embellishment bundle is there for you. Yep. Now I love and I absolutely love our shimmer mm -hmm. sprays. You've got that fine particles of mica in here. Yeah. This is stunning. And if I could just angle it, can you see the gorgeous shimmer on it? Yeah. Now this one, obviously, white on white, slightly harder to see. Mm -hmm. However, it's absolutely beautiful. Um, and it's a spray. So again, the two colors there that are gonna match your cosmic collection. So you can get those yeah. on their own as well. Mm -hmm. However, you can Brilliant. go and get the whole kit if you wanted yeah. to. <laughs> now, I've lost my pens. Oh. The Adams. oh, they're here. Oh, they're here. Let me just bring them in. <laughs> uh, because I looked at this board and I thought, what's this? What and then I realised <laughs> it's the metallic markers. Okay. So you've got two metallic markers in this. I love yeah. what the guys have done with this for the cosmic mm. sales. They've just used this to create a lovely little galaxy. Yeah. You've got a silver one and you've got a four mil chisel nib on there. And then you've got the gold one as well. So again, it's going to work with your collection absolutely mm. beautifully. Um, and that is in your embellishment kit. Or oh, you can buy those on their own. Yeah. Right. It's a lot of love this. I can see in a second. Honestly, <laughs> I love gilding yes. flakes. Uh, uh -huh. We talk about it a lot, me and Craig. We are obsessed that with blue gilding flakes. as well. It's have you different. seen this? This is just stunning. And have you noticed it matches the rest of the collection? Yeah. Uh -huh. the, the blue and the gold there have been chosen. Um, and you're going to get two pots of those gilding. I mean, you can see my kit. I've been using it already. <laughs> yeah. so. um, you're going to get two pots of the gilding flakes. You're going to mm -hmm. get two sponges in there. You've got an ink pad. Mm -hmm. So okay. the ink pad is what you, I call it a dry um, stamp ink pad. Yep, yep. You can turn any of your stamps into uh, gil using gilding flakes. Yep. And then you've got a lovely glue that's been specially designed to work with your gilding flakes. Mm -hmm. And then if that's not enough, 
Wait till you see this beauty. <laughs> the sequins. I'm going to go in and I'm going to see if our lovely, no. um, a lovely Levi can come in close. Oh, I knew oh, it! I knew, no, I knew I'd drop them everywhere. That's how oh, many Levi's in there, though. I've been warned you about me. It's fun, I am clumsy. <laughs> I am the clumsiest of the crafter experts at Crafters Companion. Um, absolutely beautiful. And a full... T I mean, look at this. Adam, can we do that overhead? Can you just do a little quick overhead yeah, yeah. for me? Yeah, look at this. Overhead. Look at all those beautiful sequins. Oh, I do apologise. Oh, here that. it comes. I, I'm so sorry. Moving Me around. producing from the floor. Uh. <laughs> Pack it in, Debbie, pack it in. Look at this. Absolutely gorgeous tub and beautiful colours and all matching the ombre glitter, the pearlescent cardstock mm. and, of course, that fabulous yeah. um, paper pads as well. Thank so I'm going to scoop mine back up, Charlene, because I need a yes. minute. Um, also, that should embellishment yeah. kit. £5.99 for those individually you will use. Of course, if you just want the embellishment kit, you can get that. That's not a problem. That's got a saving on as well. But the best way is to get everything. Um, so we are, I will let you know, limited now on this big bundle remember there's quite a lot of bits in that big bundle that you can't now buy individually because they have sold out individually but you can get it for 199 pounds but on a four-way split pay which is the way I always love to buy things which means you can take it home at 49 pounds 99 it's interest free of course don't forget that you get the whole collection after one payment and then you just pay your following ones over across the next few months as well Right, a third of the stock has gone. I will let you know that of the big collection. Um, we cannot put any more of these big collections together for the fact that, like Debbie said, individuals have sold out. We haven't got any more of certain elements. So it's not like we can kind of go, oh, it's all right, we'll, we'll just kind of bundle a few more. Not possible. <laughs> so a third of the stock has gone, so do make sure that you are taking advantage <laughs> of this, of course, whilst you can. Look at how much you're getting in that. Um, obviously, we've had a great, great look through with this as well. Essential Bundle is also incredibly popular too, which is where you are getting all of those fabulous dies. You are getting the amazing stamp sets. You, you're getting the, um, uh, the embossing folders, of course, and the stencils that are coming within this. So it is another huge, huge bundle, but you can get it for $79.99. And some people everybody wants something a little bit different you know you might want the paper pad bundle you might just be wanting a, 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 a kind of individual paper pad it's totally totally up to you um, how you want to get involved with this but it is a completely brand new collection so you are going to be one of the first people to be working with this and I have to say it's one of the biggest collections I've seen from uh, crafters in a long time because ju just just the paper pads alone I'm like whoa there is so many you're going to have a great amount of time um, being able to work with this six you know six paper pads card stocks that we've actually got there for you as well should we do a demo yes absolutely I'm just trying to get everything into uh, freeze frame as well yeah. there <laughs> lovely Adam I'm like I will watch it over and I'm like oh my god I've got all my cards on one side and I can't push them over anymore Adam because they're gonna fall off the other end uh, so I do apologize however we've got Levi and I mean I mean Levi's capable and he's gonna yeah, have to exactly. do a close-up now and again <laughs> uh, yeah now then I am going to use oh, God, I adore this. Go on, I'm going to use this fabulous embossing folder, the 3D embossing oh, folder, yes. and that metal die in there. Okay. And the proper title is called Moon and Stars. Mm -hmm. It is stunning. I'm going to show you, just using some of the gorgeous silver cardstock that's in yeah. the 12 by 12 pad, and I'm going to cut it down and show you how to use it through the embossing folder. Brilliant. Now, you've got two choices with this. You can use them separately. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's more than two, because you can use die separately. Yeah. Embossing folder separately, mm -hmm. both together, yeah. or you can just decide what you're going to do yeah. with this. Now, I'm going to do it separately because I want to show you. I'm going to run my die through my die cutting machine, okay. and I'm going to pop that on to uh, just do the um, out, outer, outer, outer die, Debbie. That's the word I'm looking uh -huh. for. Um, now, I normally just run through with a, a straightforward die. Mm -hmm. I just normally run it through with um, the plastic shim and the other Brilliant. cutting plate yep. on the top. Because I can always run it through again. Yeah. I would rather do it that way than put too much pressure. Uh -huh. If I add the magnetic shim to it, A, what I could do with it, obviously with the mirror card, mm -hmm. you can get some um, of the markings onto the mirror card and uh, I don't want to do that. Okay. Yeah. So I'm just going to check it, make sure that's cut through fine. Mm -hmm. um, and that looks absolutely perfect. So we're just going to take that out. Mm -hmm. Um, now, of course, this will go through. It will, 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 will go through at uh, the midi as well. Oh, so, uh, yes. but we'll talk about. I know we're talking we about will. that later on in the day. Absolutely. So I'm just going to remove that now. I do apologise, Jimmy. There's no bin at the back of here, so um, mm -hmm. 
It's his fault. He ain't, put, he ain't give me I've one. I've got a bin. It's his fault. Do you want have you got it? What have you got the bin? I don't, over I don't the know. Way? They obviously What's can't go there. there. <laughs> Think I'm going to craft today, don't they? <laughs> um, yeah. It's, do you know what it is? Sometimes we craft over there. That's what it is. I just remember not to trip over. No, that they though, thought I was going to be night. using the Gemini Midi. They thought That's it. They thought, gonna, yeah, they thought you were going to. Yeah. They thought you were going to do the demonstrating. Oh, yeah. Uh, now <laughs> then, I am just going to show you now. I'm mm -hmm. just going to take out those little pieces, the die cut element of it. Yeah. But of course, at the minute. It looks a bit, oh, what shall we say, flat. Okay. No dimension to right. it whatsoever. So this is when the magic will happen. Yeah. So I've got the gorgeous piece cut out. Now the embossing folder, this is when you could use it on some of your pattern cardstock and then you can then do this and then layer it over the top. And I'll show you that fabulous sample okay. in a minute. Yeah. But I just want to show you how you use this. Now, what you're looking for and you're feeling for is the bit that's going to push up into your... Um, into your cardstock. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to play that down and get that the right way around, Debbie. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put it into the one that's got the groove. Okay. So that's yes, got the yeah, sculpture yeah. out of it. Now you can line that up. Well, have you seen a couple of more bits, Cheryl? <laughs> Pop those out. You think you've got rid of everything and then no, you then see you it. you spot it, don't you? You spot it and it's like, what's that doing mm -hmm. there? We have um, actually only got one of these left now individually. What? So if you want it individually, there's one chance there's loads more than that looking at it. So it's just to give you a quick heads up on that stock. So you're going to feel for where that groove is and yep. then you're going to Close your embossing folder. <laughs> I, knew she gonna touch it. I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> and then I'm just going to turn that over. And then literally what you're going to do, it's a 3D folder. Yeah. So the combination. Now, if you're using, ooh, mm -hmm. can I borrow the MIDI? Yeah, of course. Yeah, it's available. And let, it's got the three dies available here. as well. Have someone stuck it on? Yeah. Oh, I've got mine down here. Shall have you? Oh, I do <laughs> apologise. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I am really, really, I'm so sorry. Now, if you've got a MIDI, a 3D folder, whoops, yeah. uh, is just going to go through the mouth of the machine. You don't need a shim. You don't need anything. Brilliant. You just run it through the mouth of the machine. Uh -huh. um, and uh, you literally run that through. Yeah. And you have got, and I'm just going to hold it in oh. the folder so you mm -hmm. can see it, that beautiful wow, detail. Yes. Now, if you're using this in white cardstock, mm -hmm. This is when you're going to play with your colours. Okay. Because seriously, it's absolutely, it's just exquisite. I'll put mine back down there, Sherry. Mm -hmm. I do apologise. I don't know what came over me. <laughs> I completely right. forgot I got it over there. Uh, now, there's another element that I'm going to show you because I'm going to save that little piece to put the card together. Mm -hmm. uh, the foil transfers. Okay. I bloomin' love them. Yeah. There's no other word around it. I bloomin' love them. So I'm going to bring in, and I'm going to show you okay. the way that you can do it with your... Yeah. Now, I'm going to set Gemini, so I'm going to cut this in half because I haven't got my large plates. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going, to tr just going to trim this in half. Now, of course, this is when you can. You absolutely can do this with any yeah. of your transfers. You're getting uh, the 8x8 eight eight sheets, but okay. all you're going to do is you're going to take this off. Mm -hmm. <coughs> now... This is the bit where all your glue is, where the yeah. transfer of the glue needs to transfer onto your cardstock. Mm -hmm. Now, you'll see the other guys use their hands and things like that yeah. to do this. I can't do it, so I cheat. Okay. <laughs> I, I cheat. I, it's the easiest way for me. Oh, Debbie, I should have put it the other way. Talk about wasting cardstock. <laughs> And it's Jimmy's as well. I, I pinched some from Jimmy. I didn't even bring, pinch it from home. <laughs> it's all right. If you let me off, you let me off. That, He's be fine. fine. I'm you just going to trim worry. this down. Oh, <laughs> my days. You can tell them. Um, um, I'm, I'm getting a bit flustered now because I can hear how can hear how busy it is yeah. in my ear. And yeah, I'm there's more people the fact that you do. looking at the foil transfers than we have. So again, that is going to be sold out in the next few minutes. Uh, Kathleen, Angela, New Crafters, Vivian, Susie, Louise, you do need to make sure you're checking out if you want it because we haven't got enough to go around. So if you're going to use your machines, yeah, this, okay. it would be used in the same way that you would use a die cutting okay. machine to die yeah. cut with. Mm -hmm. I know there's no metal, but you want some pressure for it to stick down. So I've got my transfer onto my cardstock. You can, of course, take a rubbing tool over it or you can rub it with your little lollipop sticks those kind of yep, things yep. Um, but I cheat okay. and I stick it through the machine as it's because <laughs> honestly um, it's got the pressure yeah, 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 yeah. and um, seriously for me mm -hmm. it just makes life easy for yes. myself yeah, yeah, yeah. especially because it's an eight by eight sheet mm -hmm. so if you've got your larger plates get it all done at once and then chop into yeah, it which is what I did yeah. um, but now that has transferred okay. straight over and if I peel that back yeah. It's taken, so there's nothing on that. There's no okay. glue now. That can go straight in the bin. Okay. Because the glue has transferred straight into on and onto the cardstock. Now, oh, I've gone yes. to the black because it shows up on black really well. Yeah, yeah. However, right now, it needs the foil. Yeah. So, I've pinched Jimmy's. Don't tell him. <laughs> I, can't, I can't find mine. 
Oh, that's a good question. Do you know I've not tried that cat? So cats just ask me, could you try the gilding flakes over yeah. the top? Well, I can't see why not. No, have a go. Have a go. Suppose, yeah, because yeah, it's glue at the end of the day. Yeah. So I'm going to just trim this down into half as well. Okay. So get my scissors working on this. Mm -hmm. Now, when you're using a cold foil, yes. you need to... Now, if you know about hot foiling, you put your pretty side down, but not mm -hmm. on cold foil. On cold okay. foil, you pop in... Pop, <laughs> you pop in the foil. Let me get that the right way around. Make sure I've got that the right way around. That's it. Yeah. You're popping it with it facing, yes. So I'm just going to okay. go over the top. Mm -hmm. And I, I remember the first time, because I've been so used to hot foiling, I've completely forgotten. I was like, the other way, what yeah. the heck? That didn't look right at all. <laughs> right. Uh, but again, it's the same way. Pop your foil down mm -hmm. yeah. um, and then straight onto your die cutting platform again okay. and run that through. And what that does then is it transfers all the foil on top of the glue. Fantastic. Um, and it's yeah. done with ease. And I mm -hmm. find it easier because I, I have, I've, I've mentioned it maybe once mm. or twice, <laughs> like a broken record, dexterity problems yeah. I have now and again, mm -hmm. will not let it stop me from crafting. No. Um, so when you lift that off, you've got that beautiful yeah. foil design. And wow. oh my life, Levi, are you ready? <sighs> Oh, 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 oh. Super smooth transition, yes, and it's yeah, yeah. honestly, it's absolutely That's phenomenal, super isn't it? stunning. Uh -huh. um, and can I tell you what I found yeah. as well? Well, this mm -hmm. is the waste, so yeah. I didn't want to waste it. So I shall tell you what I did with it. Yeah, go on. So I've, I fetched them because I did it at home. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I, I know, and I, I don't know. We'd have to get producer cat to check on the website. Okay. Um, but. You can transfer that yeah. using stick and stay, which is the permanent glue. Oh, yeah. And you stick it onto your um, cardstock, yeah, yeah, and yeah. then you're just going to stick that piece down. Oh, great. And oh, you've yeah. got the waste. Yes, yeah. So yeah, for yeah. The me, it's like it's the negative and the positive. That's so, so don't good. waste anything. No. Because seriously, that's what it will be intended to do. But that's the waste. That's beautiful. How and it looks waste? absolutely <laughs> incredible. It yeah. really does. I mean, that looks like a bookmark just there, straight away. Yeah. Isn't it? Oh, do you know? And that. Oh. Sharing. It's a great bookmark, isn't it? What a great idea. I'm yeah. always thinking of bookmarks. There you go. Uh, just but just yeah, don't throw your waste no, away. Yeah, That's yeah, one way you can combat to get that weight, mm, you know, that, really that transfer. Good. Should we put a card together? Yes. Why not? Whilst I'm here, let's put a card together. <laughs> um, so I've taken a, a card blank. It measures at eight by six. Okay. I've taken just a couple of the strips because I'm tight. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't wasting any of that foil. It's nope. going on there as mm -hmm. sparingly as possible. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to take my um, transfer mm -hmm. that I've transferred onto some matte black cardstock. Okay. I'm going to take a strip into this corner. Mm -hmm. A stick, uh, so, sorry, a stick, another strip into this corner. Mm -hmm. And if I've done my measurements right, I've left a little bit of a white gap to give it a little bit of that yes. framing. Mm -hmm. There we go, sorry. Oh, oh I would be so tight yeah. with my cardstock, oh. seriously. Um, I put one of the papers on, but I just uh -huh. got a middle rather than using it all. Yep, um, yep. So again, and I would, now I've learned a new word for the um, gutting, mm -hmm. extract the middle if I was yeah, at home. Yeah, yeah. I like that one as well, Kat, I knew you'd like that. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to pop that onto there. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, we've got the beautiful piece. So that's going to go and sit in that's that amazing. centre. Yeah. Um, I've already lined it up with some foam pads. Mm -hmm. Don't you dare come on off. <laughs> I've had my foam pads near a hot radiator. Oh, okay. Um, I talk to myself all the time. I keep saying, oh, my I'm God, you've got to take them away from the hot yeah. heater because they then stick to the back of it. Mm -hmm. um, and seriously, you don't want to do that. So no. I'm hoping that these will all play nicely. Yeah, of course, you could use things like... your. Um, um, I'm sorry, I keep calling it chunky glue. 3D colour yes, glue, yeah, that's yeah, the yeah. word. Uh -huh. um, and you could use that, come on, last one, mm -hmm. if you come. And I'm just going to place that over. Now, if you've embossed that cardstock, you can then pop that over the top because you've got the beautiful background. But I really love the moon and the stars, so I've mm -hmm. just kept it as it is. And then I've just finished it off with... Mm -hmm. Now, I did say... I love the stars. I'm not going to run them through the die cutting machine. I've already done some of my stars mm -hmm. oh, and put them out. Them. Yeah. I've already used uh, one of the sentiments yeah, as well yeah, yeah. and popped some uh, foam pads onto the back of there. Mm -hmm. um, and I honestly, I know that when you get this collection home, no matter which bit of it you've gone for, yeah. whether you've gone uh -huh. for one bit, when you've gone for all of it, you are absolutely mm -hmm. going to adore this. Mm -hmm. In fact, let me just get that. I'm just, ooh, ooh. Down. Come on, off you come. Oh my God, it's stuck down like you can't believe. <laughs> I'm going to come down here. I'm going to come this side and then I'm going to pop mm -hmm. some stars 
around the edge. Now I love yeah. these stars. Mm -hmm. I were terrible last night. I can't, I can't, I can't keep, I can't stop using them. But that's the thing. You just want to keep doing more. And yeah, more. absolutely. You're gonna, you're gonna adore yeah. them. Um, I know I've fast forwarded a lot of this. However, you, we've got tons of tuition. Mm -hmm. Which online. So great, our lovely Leanne did a launch show of these last week. Yeah. Go back and watch that on YouTube. Mm -hmm. um, just type in Crafters TV, you'll find Leanne yeah. taking you through some fantastic techniques, mm -hmm. let me just tell you, using many elements of this collection. So it's well worth going and having a little Definitely. look at that. Yeah. I can only show you a fraction today. You can go back and watch my Facebook Live if you want to do. Yeah. It lives on there. Um, some comedy moments in there. I bet, as always. <laughs> well, I actually stopped my live feed. Don't even ask me how I did it. <laughs> and then it ended on where I was pulling a funny face and I had five chins. Uh, so, um, yeah, so, and I honestly, that was towards the end, seriously. When they I used to, to do, do you remember when they used to do teaching during COVID? Yeah. And obviously it used to always freeze and the teachers' faces were like, so all of the students <laughs> used to just have all of these screenshots of just the worst face of the yeah. teacher. I, think, I think there's a few of them lying that around at me last night. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so there's been a few of them popping up somewhere. But this is the kind of thing. Now I've gone really, like, I've gone really galactic uh, there and cosmic it. with it. Yeah. But this is the most stunning collection mm. and it's something so different from us Absolutely. at Crafters Companion yeah. and I'm, I'm I can tell you I'm fully, I'm bursting because mm -hmm. I'm so pleased that you're loving it yeah. and you've grabbed hold of yours while you could because seriously yes. um, you're gonna love it too we've got less than 20 chances left now with the big bundle we're into the teens in terms of what is left in availability for the full bundle okay um, that is of course on a four-way split pay so you can take this home for 49 pounds 75 if you want to today and that's to get absolutely everything now a lot of things within this has completely sold out okay Okay, so the, the difference is, is that once this full collection sells out, which is likely to happen today, you then could not put another one together because a lot of the individual elements have now completely, completely gone. To let you know some of the sellouts, the sequins, they've sold out individually. The glitter paste, it's gone. Um, we've also seen that the foil transfers, sold out. 3D embossing folder, sold out. 2D embossing folder, gone. Starry Night, that has gone as well. Um, so the Over the Moon, that has gone. That was the, the stamp and die set. And also Stardust. So that is so many elements that are sold out. Everything has less than 10, uh, 10 available now in that essentials collection as well. So um, you do, of course, need to take advantage of. We do have a big um, availability on the paper pads. Obviously, they are new. We know that you have a limited run of these. So if you are wanting to get one of these individually, maybe on top of a collection, then you can still do that. Um, we've got your 12 by 12s that are available, of course, so we can bring those live for you. Um, and we've also got the six by six that's available there as well. The foil transfers have gone, but everything else we have got a big quantity of, so we do still have availability with those bits. Now, the 12 by 12, we'll just come across to this first. Is it the burlesque one? Well, yeah, yeah. I thought I heard that right in me, and then I was like scrambling underneath the counter <laughs> thinking, Where oh my it? God. <laughs> uh, this is stunning. The mm. collection is beautiful. Um, it's uh, honestly, it's absolutely beautiful. That pearlescent finish is mm. gorgeous. 12 by 12, mm -hmm. um, 250 GSM, so it's a construction weight. And the colourways on these Amazing. match the beautiful papers, mm -hmm. the glitter cardstocks, the ombre glitter cardstocks. They match everything to perfection. But you'd use um, it without this as well. You because are, the colours you know, are just so that, stunning. Uh, that is exactly the point I, I was just going to make. <laughs> Honestly, these are beautiful. Look at this pink. Mm. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah. That lovely, it's like a mauve colour. And then, of course, that beautiful... Wow. Uh, like, um, I used to have my hair this colour, actually. Did you? I love that idea. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, it's a beautiful plum. Yes, yeah, yeah. Kind of colour. Mm -hmm. So that's your 12 by 12. You are getting 24. Mm -hmm. You're getting six colourways and four of each yeah, in that. Yeah, it's all acid and lignin free as well. Mm -hmm. So it's honestly, it's absolutely stunning. I'll just put that to one side. What was the other one you wanted me to show, Kat? Pattern 12 by 12. It's got it here. Go on then, it's just here, it's ready. I mean, if I must, <laughs> if I must. Uh, again, you're getting 24 sheets. It's mm -hmm. all pearl, it's all pearl, mm. it's that beautiful pearlescent. But again, it's like you're looking through the eyes of a telescope mm -hmm. and you've literally captured that picture. Um, absolutely beautiful. And like I said, there, this is not a B-side. This mm -hmm. is another no, A-side. No, no. yeah. This is when you need to be thinking about getting your extra yes. pads. You're getting two of each. So each one I'm showing you right now, you're going to get two of each. Mm -hmm. I mean, come on, which do you choose? Oh, you can't. You Seriously. can't choose. Just love from the purples to the pinks to the turquoises, the blues, the greens. It's just... 
I, I mean, I've got no words for this. Mm -hmm. I was blown away when I saw it. Lily gave me this before I broke up for Christmas. Okay. And she said, Debbie, you're going to be launching Cosmica. I'll be making uh -huh. Well, to say I nearly jumped on her was an understatement. <laughs> I saw this and I was like, I want this in my life. Yeah, so I was I've begging to be part uh -huh. at launch. So I'm really chuffed that I've got it Incredible. free. And I'm yes. really chuffed that you uh -huh. have also loved mm -hmm. this just as much as we yeah. all have. Because every one of us have taken this to our hearts. Mm -hmm. It's something that little bit different. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing niche about this. This is something that you're going to be able to use yeah. over and over again. There'll be somebody in your life that you know that you can mm -hmm. think of, whether you love them to the moon and back, whether you think of them as friends like the stars. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, there's something for everybody yeah, in this definitely. for any occasion. And of course, these papers are simply mm -hmm. out of this they world. Are, they? they really, really are. Oh, fabulous. Look at that one. And £15.99 for you to get that in the 12 by 12. But we have the 6 by 6 as well, which is just the scaled down. Loads of people are going for this. And I think it's because a lot of the time the 6 by 6, you can actually just stick that straight on if you wanted to. You can you indeed. Can I, mean, I was looking for it then and I've left it down here. I'll find it. Yeah, literally. Uh, it's, it's just been scaled to size. So yeah. It's exactly the same paper, you know, the prints, mm -hmm. but just been scaled to size. Someone's had a good idea. I bet this would look fab with clear resin poured over it. Ooh, mm, nice talk. Oh, I like that door. Yeah. Do you know, I've not yet played with resin. Every time, is it Joe? Is it Joe that comes down here? I can't remember yes. her name. Yeah, yeah. I watch her and I think, oh my god, I'd yeah, love bad. to be able to create what she does. Uh -huh. But what a great idea! Mm. Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yep, and you can see that's there. So £6.99 for you to be able to get that if you're wanting the 6 by 6 um, So there is both the options there. Um, totally up to you which one you want to go to. But I love you don't lose any of it. It's just scaled down. You don't lose any same, of it, no. It? And that pearlescent finish is absolutely stunning. So seriously, absolutely glorious. <laughs> exactly. Now, the Essentials Bundle, a lot of you have been asking about. Now, this is your tools for life, isn't it, really? It's not a consumable. Um, what you are getting within this, you can see a huge 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 amount now so many of these individual elements have now completely sold out you've got numerous there um, dies stencils stamps that you can see you've got an embossing folders as well the 2d the 3d so there is so so much within this the most magical constellations the most gorgeous um, ways the stars are just dancing across this as well um, and when you are getting that saving that we're seeing there so down to 79.99 it makes them six pounds 66 each and do you know what I love as well? It's like you were showing lots of them. If people have got or want to buy the Gemini Midi, the new colour, loads of it will go through that as well. And absolutely. I like a new collection I with a new Do you know machine. what? I think absolutely every, yeah, everything in all? that essential bundle will go through your Midi. Oh my. So your manuals, your electronics, mm -hmm. whether you've gone for the original Midi, whether you've gone for the more heat yeah. colour. I always say, someone said to me last night, I'm alive, the colour doesn't do it justice on the camera. You're so right. Because yeah. it looks, it look, almost looks lemony yeah, on yeah, yeah. there. But uh -huh. when you get it in your hands for real yes. it's this beautiful lime green it is it's, it's so fruity mm -hmm. and zesty it's yeah. absolutely I stunning know. one of my favorite colors that we've ever oh, done really? in a machine yeah it's just brilliant and i will be going through a little bit more of a dedicated hour into Fabulous. there putting it through his paces with regular dyes mm -hmm. with um, um with i'm thinking of the word more Detailed okay. dyes yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, with embossing yeah. folders, with done. 3D embossing folders, with stencils, mm -hmm. with multimedia dyes, and all of the different things that you can do. Brilliant. That's more like it. Yeah. I like that yes, one, Adam. Yeah. That's a brilliant, uh, yeah. brilliant <laughs> example of it. Because uh, the camera, yeah. I think it's so many like, studio uh -huh. lights. Yeah. It? yeah, <laughs> absolutely. And it is available there with the free embossing folder and the free die as well. That's here with limited stock until that goes um, for the same price what the machine is normally. Now, of course, the best way though to get this brand new collection is to get the ultimate collection this is where you're getting your biggest saving we're talking over 30 pounds and it's where you get all three of those smaller collections so all of it okay now it means you're getting 23 elements in total you can see multitudes of your paper pads your foil transfers that are there your ombre glitter cardstock the fact that you are getting all of those dyes you're getting the stencils you're getting the stamps as well the stencils um, you've got the gilding flakes um, that are coming to you of course as well those metallic pens which I absolutely love the sequins um, you've got the shimmer sprays so there is just so so much that is actually included within this we 
are looking at being into the teens now with this collection. We were hoping to bring it back later. Whether the Ultimate Collection will still be available, I don't know, um, because there's so many of you coming through and getting this. Tara has said, Crafter's Companion is just the absolute best quality. It's my go-to brand. I owe so many products. Thank you so much. That's so lovely mm. to hear where you get messages like that. So thank you very much, Tara. Yeah. We can stand here and you'd probably think, well, she works for a company. She's going to say that. Mm -hmm. But genuinely, I've been a fan of Crafter's Companion for many years before I started. Mm -hmm. um, and I can hear you can. <laughs> um, but honestly, it seriously is the most... Yeah. Uh, it's lovely when you get things like yeah. that. It's really heartwarming and we all take that um, with, with gratitude because seriously, we know the hard work that goes into it. So for you to say that is just, it's a lovely thing to hear. Yeah. So thank and you. And it's Sarah. so true. You do know the quality you get. And that is why when you're getting deals like this, you do want to get it whilst you can because you get a £30 saving on that as well. Thank you so much. It's you're been very wonderful welcome. to be able to see it. Yeah, yeah, um, it's been <laughs> I've only got one show with you today. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, what's going on? Yeah. Uh, but I am with lovely Davy B later. Uh, I've got yes. a two hour show coming up at five uh -huh. and six. Um, lots of good bargains, something that's just ah, been added this morning as well. Okay. So it's going to be a good one. Oh, so do make sure you tune back in at five. You'll get to see more of this as well as loads of other bits as well. I'll be back in a moment with Sandra. We have got Santangle and we have got lots of brand new bits. Once again, I can't wait for you to see the Masquerade collection. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Here at Hobbymaker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the combine order button. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. 
Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. So we're back with Hello. Sandra, and you can see behind us, Dobby is here. Um, he's, brought, he's brought nobody presents. Nobody. Really? Yeah, no. no You're he's, joking. He's not brought anybody presents, and we had to cover for him last week because yeah, yeah. we didn't know he was going. Oh, my goodness. Honestly, I saw the picture, and I was like, I just love Pauline. It's just got in there in the cabin on her cruise. She's back in tomorrow, so I was thinking Dobby was going to come tomorrow, but yeah. she's nipped in this she's morning. She's nipped in this morning. She's like, take it back, take it back. <laughs> Well, we did see him lose his trousers, so we don't know what's happening. <laughs> They've been away, so we're, we're questioning it. We'll find out more from Pauline tomorrow. Um, anyway, we have got an absolutely amazing show, haven't we? Quite, a, yeah, something mm -hmm. really special, really yes. different. Yeah, and I, I like to do that. I like to do different. Yes, yeah, yeah, so definitely. It's, it's there, but not maybe what you expect. No, that, that's why I love. So we're launching the brand new Masquerade collection, OK? Um, we've got loads of people already getting in touch saying, yay, got it. Um, oh, we've not even you, showed everybody. you it, but well done for jumping straight in you know how popular it is of course whenever we do shows with brand new launches so it is well worth doing that now we are going to bring you the bundle you can of course get these bits individually if you want to but we know that generally the most popular way is to get the bundle because it's the best price and it does yeah. mean you have everything as it well, does yeah it? because everything's interconnected so yeah. the background stencils have been drawn based on mm -hmm. Yeah. Artwork, the artwork that's in the bundle and it exactly. all works together. I like that. Now, I just I just love, I have to say, everything that you do because it's... I remember the first show we did, obviously, <laughs> ages ago now, and I cannot draw, I said, and Sandra's like, anyone can draw if you're showing what to do. And it was so true that as we were working through things, suddenly you can, you follow the, yeah. the, the patterns, the designs, and it's so enjoyable. And you go, oh, actually, I can do this. And yeah. everybody can with what I you create. I think that's it, isn't it? It's getting that first pen and paper yeah. and thinking, do you know, I am actually going to mm -hmm. try this and see yeah. where it leads me. Yeah. Yeah, and you follow so the instructions, good. even if you did it with just mm. a regular pencil and a bit of paper that you've got off mm -hmm. your printer and just tried it and did yeah. a little sketch following the stencils mm -hmm. and instructions. It's brilliant. You will get, of course, it's going to look different than mine. Yes, yeah, but that's but fine, everybody's isn't it? Yeah. is going to be different. Yeah. But everything is step by step. Mm -hmm. and, and this one is a little bit special because I know the last couple of classes, yeah. I've done eyes. So I did a dragon yes. eye and yeah, things yeah, yeah. like that. And mm -hmm. I know that you all out there love that and you mm -hmm. can't all get to class. So I have included in this book so instructions for uh -huh. how to draw the eye. And I love this because well. I, I always remember from art class, one of the hardest things to yeah. do. So, of course, you've got all of that detailed instructions. comes, of course, with all your stencils. Just to let you see, of course, the background stencils as oh, well because they are lovely. <laughs> OK, 30% of the stock has been allocated already. So we do need to be very, very quick if you're wanting to get involved with this. But you can see that they are just fabulous. And you know how much you're going to use these with this. But I always oh, think yeah, yeah, separately yeah. And I'll, well. I'll link through them in a, in a minute. And yeah. then you can see exactly what they look like because you don't always see it with the stencil. Mm -hmm. So look at this look one. at this, what you can yeah. actually create. So I mean, that's a mask, but it, it looks more realistic because you've yeah. got the eyes in there. So and that's what you were saying, to actually be able to learn how to do how that. How to do that, absolutely. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I mean, that's really sort of way out. It's very yes. skull-like almost. Mm -hmm. But not all masks are pretty, pretty, mm -hmm. are they? No. Some are a little bit different. Look at this one. Whereas this one, very oh. carnival. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely, yeah. isn't it? Half the stock has now been allocated, so you do need to obviously um, be getting involved um, as soon as yeah. you can. You can create that. And then we look at this again, so different. Very, yeah, very different. Very ice-like, mm. isn't it? And you can sort of think quite masculine as well. Yes, 100%. But it's, it's what you want it to be. I'm giving mm -hmm. you the starting points. It's up to you then as to what you yep. want to do with it. And then... The Another one here that you could create, and I love it's got fabulous just at the bottom because that is. I know. Field, and of course, well, that's our stamps. If you've got our stamps, mm -hmm. you can mix and match them all in as well. Just, just lovely. Yeah. It really we do is. have a, a sample of the eye somewhere. Yeah, well, but, you know, it could, it could be anywhere. Uh, really well, we've got we've got this one here that Angie did. Shall I show you Angie's? Yeah. So it's um, we did because we were we were looking at it earlier. Yeah, it's right? around somewhere. I wonder whether it's been put on, on display be, or. Be, I don't know. We'll have a look for it in a second. But you you can see here as well. I like to see kind of what you've done and then what. Other, other people, people have done do as well, well yeah. absolutely. Yeah, because that's the beauty with these stencils. Once you've followed the instructions mm. and done your version of mine, if, you, if yes. that makes sense, yeah, yeah, yeah. you can then go off and do your own thing with it because they're not mm -hmm. s simple and simple stencils that you have to do the same thing every time. You've got elements of uh -huh. different 
things that you can do within there. And I don't use every single shape on the stencil mm. in the instructions. Okay, so, so you've, you've got extras yes, as well, so you, you can play around with it. Wow, I, I mean, look how unusual that one oh, is. Oh, yeah, isn't it just? But, you know, you can go serious art with it. Or if you mm -hmm. were into doing portraits, but you yep, needed yep. the help there, you could actually use some of the, the shapes in here to help it's you. It's fabulous, isn't it? Create the proportions. I don't know whether we can have a quick look at our, our screen, our call screen. Obviously, if you look at the oh. whole of our call screen, what you have is you have the Hi first everyone. three rows. <laughs> Hello there. <laughs> uh, the, yeah, the first three rows are everybody who's already confirmed. The fourth row that you see, where it says press one, talking and web bids, are the people still waiting to get involved. You can see hundreds and hundreds of people are getting involved um, right now. We had a big, big quantity, but we are looking at almost 70 percent of that quantity now having been allocated um, well well done we always know you have to be super super quick oh, you, know, thank you can get you it as many times I'm not even, as I'm not even drawing it's... anything yet give me a chance <laughs> I, I, but, but we, we, oh, we know how good your stuff is but also we're seeing you know these amazing yeah. um, pieces that obviously you've done but also what Angie has done here and Alison um, and it is it's timeless it's classic isn't well, it, it is and you're going like to do it. something completely different as yeah. well you, you know looking at the colors there mm. You can go really gothic, you can go mm -hmm. really summery and fancy like yeah. that. There's so many different things you can I'm do. I'm also with thinking these. like invites and stuff. It's great for things like <gasps> yeah, that. Yeah, absolutely. Isn't it? Yeah. It, you know, it, it's yeah. got that sort of like ball like feeling. Julie, hello. Can we have the number for the masquerade stencil on its own? Gosh, you can. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. We, we can bring them both up available for you individually. That's not a problem. So if you want just the masquerade stencil set on its own, then it's here for you, £21.99. So it is um, yeah, it's brilliant if you just want it on its own. Um, you can also, of course, get the background stencils if you want to on their own as well. Um, we know that sometimes people do want to. It's just we generally come to the main bundle because we know that's where most people tend to go, yeah, don't yeah, we? Just because of the nice deal that we get. Options, isn't it? Um, but it's nice to have all the options. That's £10.99 on its own um, of course if you want both then you are going to get that extra saving um, as well and of course they just work so well together don't they so, <laughs> should we have a little look Let, let's do it I'll, I'll show you the background first yes, and I'll actually perfect. show you where where this came from yes, in a okay. sense okay mm -hmm. so just so you can get an idea because sometimes when you look at um, stencils and backgrounds particularly you don't mm -hmm. always see what they they are do you yeah so this particular one let me just ink it a little bit mm -hmm. and then I'll show you where it comes from Okay. And you were like, okay, how did that work? <laughs> I get it. How did that happen? Let's add a little bit of a different colour. Mm -hmm. So I like to use just elements of this. I don't tend to always use it, although you can, you can emboss it. Okay. And you can use it as a whole background together, but look at it just on its own. Yeah, and if so I look nice. at this one yeah, here. It's there, isn't it? There it is. There's mm -hmm. your square. Yeah. And you see the little sort of cathedral windows almost at the top. Mm -hmm. So that comes purely. Wow, that one okay. there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then looking at this one, this is more carnival kind of thing. Yeah. And you've got lots of elements again. So if you wanted to, mm -hmm. you've got just a simple flower okay. in the middle there. Or you can bring out the loops. There mm -hmm. we go. Let's put a little bit of that in. So if I then look at that. Wow, I love that. If I just that. bring a little bit of pencil in there now, let's make this mm -hmm. a little bit more of um, a, a bit of detail in there. Yeah. A little bit there. There we go. Beautiful. Put my tortillon in mm -hmm. and soften that up. So if you wanted to, you could make more of it as a flower. Mm -hmm. And that's just a little bit of the background there. These backgrounds are lovely. Yeah. There you go. And then, of course, if you wanted to, you could bring in more of the tangly bits on it. So yeah. you're sort of, you're drawing, but you're not drawing. Mm -hmm. And this one comes from... One second, this one here, it starts sort of life as this one here. So you okay. see where you've got your little elements in there? Yeah, yeah. And there it is. So mm -hmm. you can play around with the two. You could use them on their own if you wanted. Yeah, yeah. I like to sort of ink this all the way, like so I've got quite uh -huh. a space, and then just pick a bit yeah. of detail out of one of them. Really nice. And that's just mm -hmm. the background. Yeah, yeah exactly. Just the background. You've not even started yet. <laughs> not even started yet. <laughs> so that's, that's where they sort of... Uh, fall into play mm -hmm. but you want to see the stencils yes yeah. as well uh -huh. okay I'm trying to I'm trying to tidy up <laughs> if I can let's put that away for a minute mm -hmm. now looking at the stencil of okay. course um it's sort of an A4 one quite a large yeah, a lot, a large nice piece a lot on there mm. but what we've actually done for you is you can see here you've not just got this size mm -hmm. You've got this size as well. Yeah, it's great. So if you isn't wanted it? to do cards, you've yeah. got the smaller version. Or if you think I want to start with the small one mm -hmm. to see how I go, then you can go bigger. Yes, and you've got idea. the same with all 
of these sort of masky mm -hmm. kind of shapes going on. Lots of circles. I don't use all of them in the instructions, but yeah. they're so useful. To do a perfect circle is so difficult. It's so, it, it is difficult, yeah. <laughs> and then you've got different lips. So in the yeah. instructions, I, I use this one and say, create your own shape. Uh, okay. If you don't want to, I've actually put you some in there okay. as well. Mm -hmm. This is for your eyes. And okay, we've got... Here, you'll notice they're, sort of, they're not round. Mm -hmm. We'll give you ridges because yeah. I'm encouraging you to put the curves in. Yes, so okay. there's loads going on there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so all right, where do we start? Let's go with uh, this one here, number okay. 40. Lovely. Now, I'm not going to use the instructions because mm -hmm. I, I wrote them <laughs> not, not that long ago. <laughs> so I don't sort of know what's in it. But, but if I just sort of yeah. show you to start with, uh -huh. uh, this one is, let's move along a bit. Here we go. Yeah. So it's, um, hold on. They are starting mm -hmm. here. Hold on. Oh, no. Yeah, there, starting. <laughs> the seven inches. Yeah. Creating a front on half mask okay. design. Mm -hmm. So that's where you've got sort of this going off. You know what's so good about your instructions? And I know I've said it before, but I know that all of us learn differently. You know, some we people do. learn yeah, from yeah. images. Some people learn from written. And yeah. I love that you just cover that base for everybody. Yeah. And, and that, I think, is really special because it just includes everybody. It does, yeah. I mean, sometimes, I mean, and I try and keep the instructions to a minimum. I don't yeah. get, there's nothing technical in there. <laughs> There's, there's no measuring, uh, mm -hmm. very or very little on some yeah. of my stencils, if you need to measure. But it's it's all about you creating your own thing and you stay enjoying it. Mm -hmm. okay, so mm -hmm. we've already got a mask design going yeah. off. Okay. Perfect. First job done. So the next bit, it's we're going to put like a shape around the eye. I'm only going to do one side, so you can sort of get the idea of where it's coming. Mm -hmm. Again, I'm using a pencil, look, so I'm drawing that little bit in. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then I'm going to sort of bring another line down here. So from the point to about here. So there's my middle. So around here. Now, when you're drawing big curves, we do this in class mm -hmm. quite a lot. This feels a bit weird to me. Yes, yeah. So I turn my page round and it's easier for me to do it that way. Uh huh, yeah. But if you, to try and do one completely, sometimes mm -hmm. you think, well, actually, it might be just easier to do a dotted line. Yes to imagine where it's going to go. And then you've got something to work to. You can bring it in. Yeah. Yeah. Really and at the bottom here, I'm going to put a curl. Okay. Like that. Okay. Yeah. So I've got my line. Mm -hmm. So then I'm going to turn it around again. I'm going to bring another line down here. And one there. Amazing. And look, I've got a little scroll. Mm-hmm. You see? That's the starting point there. And I'm going to split off my space. We do this ever such a lot because just makes life easy see yep. top bottom side to side mm -hmm. and then in between here I can go for one or I can go two so okay. let's put two in there and again all done in pencil mm -hmm. two in there and two in there so I've sort of got about the same amount of space yeah. same amount of sort of uh, shape going on let's do the same here so let's split that off and then I can put one in there and again what do I want to do I'm going to go two okay and two there yeah this little bit here, going to bring in a bit of a triangle shape. Sort mm -hmm. of gives where, that's where the nose is going to be. Yes, yeah, yeah. And then let's put some zigzags in here. So nothing too tricky at no. all at the minute. Yeah. And let's double up the lines. Okay, put in a bit of a zigzag in. Mm -hmm. There you go. And little dots in each one. Okay. Okay, so I do that on both sides. Yep. Of course, I would do my bits and pieces in pen, but I want to show you a few extra little bits. So mm -hmm. this little swirl here that we did, this scroll, I'm going to bring another yep. one up here. And bring it back down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yep. like so. Let's bring another one. So it starts with a swirl. Okay. So you could do this at home. Yeah, yeah. A swirl. Mm -hmm. And then take it from here, look, bring a line down, a line down. Yeah. Yeah, got your swirl. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this. <laughs> so then let's bring a few of our little circle shapes in. Mm -hmm. uh, circles are brilliant. They, they sort of start flowers off and all sorts of things. Mm. They race. So a couple of circles. I'm going to do a wavy line. It very quickly looks 3D, doesn't does, it? It does, doesn't it? Yeah. We've hardly done anything at the <laughs> minute. Yeah. Wavy yeah. line. So once we've done this, it's going to look a bit like this. So I've got both sort of sides done in here. Okay, fair. So you can see where I've got my split up and I've got my little zigzags. Yeah, yeah. So the next thing I would do is let's come in with these little bubbles here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go around my bubble mm -hmm. up to the top. Okay. To the side. Yeah. To the side. Mm -hmm. And the same with all of them. You see, it's sort of creating this kind of a yes, yeah, yeah. lovely little effect going mm -hmm. on there. Yeah. So, of course, once that's shaded, it's going to look three-dimensional. It's yeah, going to look amazing, exactly. isn't it? Mm -hmm. 
down into that one. This across the top, remember we just had a look at this on the uh, yeah. background stencil, we're creating those sort of mm -hmm. little gothic arches across the top there. Yeah. I mean, are you imagining what kind of colours you're going to use know, with this? That's the thing, isn't it? And, uh, you know, is it going to be uh, painted? Are mm. you going to watercolour it? Let's do a second line in there. You know, what other things can you add? All the glitters that mm -hmm. you can bring in. <laughs> are you going to put the eyes in or not? Yeah, so it many. Matter either way, does it? Yeah. And in this one here, really difficult look. I'm putting a cross in between each one. <laughs> I mean, come on, we've all drawn those, haven't we? Yeah. And then in between each one, let's just do a few around there. Mm -hmm. I'm going to draw like a little triangle. Oh, lovely. See, in between each one there. Yeah. This one here, let's yep. put some loops in. There you go. Brilliant. All right. Yeah. And then let's bring in one I've done. I've put it mm -hmm. in the pen. Yep. There it is. Fab. So with this one, I've actually started with my uh, one of my frames behind it oh, because yeah, sometimes nice it's idea. nice to put something yeah, in. Definitely. So I've got my little heptagon frame here, okay. mm -hmm. and what I've actually done, lined it up. Yeah. Drawn sections of it. Uh -huh. So I've drawn two of my lines and put my dots in. Yes. Yeah, so yeah, this yeah. is where my dots come in. Because mm -hmm. what I can actually do with this, if I wanted to, I can then. Split the space off. You see where the dots are going? Yes, yeah. Just as before. And then I can take an element from here. So looking at these like little uh -huh. gothic arches, I could put one of those in each uh, one of those of if I wanted to. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of bringing it together. And you don't have to use the whole thing. Yeah. You've just used a section of it, as you can see. But you see where you're taking little mm. bits. Mm -hmm. So let's add a little bit more detail in there. And this oh, is where we've so started to add some black. Yeah lines in we've got those stripes mm -hmm. in we've got some extra little sort of uh, swirls here here we yeah. go so one of those would be up here let's bring that one in mm -hmm. as well it actually looks amazing Bubble. even monochrome doesn't it if you it didn't want to add any color at all. absolutely it does see i've swirled around that way yes yeah around that way let's put another one in there that's what's created mm -hmm. that one there so we've got little bits really and pieces good. going on, but we want to add a little bit of colour to it, don't we? So what I have done, I've got a copy here, so it's on uh, okay. my, yeah. my nice cartridge. Do we want a watercolour or do we want a coloured pencil? Oh, what are you going to go for? <laughs> Let's use coloured pencils. Go for these, yeah. Okay, okay. so you, you could do anything you wanted to yeah. do with it, really. I'll just do a little bit so you can see where we're headed. And we've got these so, available, and of course, these just have such an amazing array of colours within them, don't they? And well, so yeah, oh, to use. Uh, they are really nice to use, and mm -hmm. uh, the colours are there because they blend, yes, and that's yeah. the idea. Mm -hmm. it, I mean, they've not been out that long. It took so long for me to yeah. find. And this one, look, my claret. Where's my Santangle red? Let's bring yeah. a bit of that. See, I've done top and bottom of mm -hmm. these little loops. Yeah. Let's bring in a little bit there. Mm -hmm. So you notice I'm not pressing on, you can still see the white of the paper underneath. Exactly. Let's bring in that light red because it's nice to bring it in in, in mm -hmm. layers. There we go. And then a bit of white. Mm -hmm. The white really helps, it really burnishes it. And then I'll go back yeah. in again and do those layers again. See, so that's it. Just, you know, just a little yeah. bit more pressure, but because there's pencil already underneath, yeah. it's not, it's not sort of like trying to argument mm -hmm. or anything. It's, uh, it's just giving it a really nice blend. Amazing. So you, what I like mm -hmm. to do sometimes as well is use a little bit of colour, then bring a bit of pencil and torchy on in. Yes, yeah, yeah, do yeah. Do it yeah. that way as well. But it depends what you want to do. And I mm -hmm. think these do really want a bit of brightness to yeah. them. So let's uh, just finish that bit off. And then, of course, if I do one of these uh, scrolls, mm -hmm. so again, it's nice to have the colours there that you need. Yeah. Let's have a little bit of the darkness. Let's take a mm -hmm. bit of that darkness around there as well. Then bring in the next one, move it next to it. It's just mesmerising sort of watching you, but also I know that when you're doing this at home, when everybody gets at home, they'll be able to just have that kind of time, that space to themselves. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. Such a lovely... Absolutely, sort of yeah. Activity. I mean, I am very quick now I, I do it a lot but it's it's nice that you can sit and just play yeah. and you know I, I know you know you're using your nice cartridge mm -hmm. paper and these pencils are just going to blend beautifully 
definitely. Let's just put this one in a bit dark. Hi, Rose. Well. Rose has just said, I love Hi, this Rose. set. My sister's oh. involved in a theatre group and doing panto oh, nice. at the moment. It's perfect for her birthday card. Thank you, Sandra. Exactly. Oh, idea. brilliant. Yeah, and that's the thing. You can. You can do it, use it for so many different things. Uh, Susan, you're here as well. Afternoon, Sandra. Just spending my birthday money. It's oh, my birthday today. Happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Susan. What a lovely treat. Absolutely. Nice, happy <laughs> birthday. Ruth has said, loving the new bundle. And that's Ruth from Reddit. Oh, thank you, Ruth. Got it. So, so oh. many of you taking advantage. Well I know. <laughs> <laughs> so after all this colouring, mm -hmm. I've scribbled a load of <laughs> a load of pencil in the yeah, eye like yeah. what's going on did here on did it on of purpose because <laughs> i'm bringing my torty on in and okay. what i can do with this is i can shape it a little bit yes. so rather than you worry too much about what color you're going to do in for mm -hmm. the eyes and things like that i mean you could fussy cut them out and put some um, mirror card behind mm -hmm. things like mm -hmm. that but uh, you know if you if you just want to give it a little bit of a gesture and sh and sort of shade mm -hmm. it then mm -hmm. using the torty really helps you yeah. see uh, bring a little bit of red in there as well mm -hmm. and it just sort of echoes but i'm not sort of having to do a load of work i'm more interested in the mask and how yeah, much definitely. color i can get onto there mm -hmm. so of course oh we didn't show you the roses you see how to Amazing. do those roses yeah. i mean yeah. let's have a look at it finished yeah yeah so you can see here look that i've got quite a lot of monochrome in there and a yes, proper color yeah. but those those roses honestly let me find me let me find my picture mm -hmm. Let's go back a few. All right. <laughs> are, you, are you ready for this? Go I mean, as, as tricky as this is, you've got your, you've got your circle. circle. Yeah. So you've got a line that goes this way. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. A line that goes this way. Okay. And then a curl. Oh, my word. And that, that's is, well <laughs> that is it. Seriously. That is it. That means so from now there, you could just draw that. roses on everything you want to of do. Course well, you could. Of course you could. I mean, I've got a couple of little lines coming up here, giving it a little bit of shape. But there you go. So let's let's I sort of work that. That. <laughs> so from doing our pencil version yeah, yeah, yeah. all the way through. Uh, and of course I could spend all day colouring that. I mean it'd just look lovely all in those yeah, reds, yeah, wouldn't yeah. it? But then from there oh, to so there, and that's just amazing. one of them. There mm -hmm. are five different lots yeah. of instructions five in different that. Instructions. Oh <gasps> we've not used the background. Let me show you oh, the background. No, we can. Fran has just said, couldn't resist the bundle. It fell into my basket. Oh. How could it not? How could it not, Fran? Remember, of course, in the bundle, you are getting all of these. So you are getting the stencil set, of course, um, your booklet that's there as well. You are also getting the background stencils as well. So you're getting both of those. So, um, and of course, you're getting that extra saving at 27.49. Yeah. Just put in a little, you know, yeah. as I said, I don't like to, I well, it's, it is nice to use the whole thing, but you know, mm. you've got your main picture and that's yeah, what you want. Bits of it. So yeah. what I'm doing is, I just want to use a little bit round it. You see how it just gives yeah, that little really bit of nice. attention there. Yeah. And let's just then add a little bit of ink on its mm -hmm. own. In there. Imagine, you know, once this is coloured, it would be mm. divine, wouldn't it? You just want to mm -hmm. sit and colour it now. <laughs> yeah. And you then start with your glitter on the top. But yes, yeah, exactly. looking at that one to that one, you see I've added just a tiny yeah, touch of, of my background stencil mm -hmm. in there. And it just Brilliant. brings it out and gives it a bit of interest. Yeah. Of course, having your... Uh, Heptagon frame round there, yeah, whatever bad, frame you've got, just mm -hmm. brings it all together. Yep, definitely. Oh, oh it's amazing. I could do that it really I could literally all afternoon. Yes. I could just do that one, 100%. but I know we've. <laughs> yeah, I can see why. So you, you <laughs> are heading totally, totally brand new today. The Masquerade bundle that we can see here for under thirty pounds. Of course, a really informative booklet with all five of those finished pieces that you can actually go through with that template that comes with it, and then it comes as well with both of those background um, stencils also that you've got here. Um, for under thirty pounds, and when you just sort of see, you know, a few know, more. That's just, oh, they're just, that's just just one so of them. So many, wasn't it? Isn't yeah. It? I mean, that one's slightly on the side, so you mm -hmm. can go a bit more three dimensional with that one. Yeah, definitely. Rather than just being a sort of full front space mm -hmm. one, if you wanted it but to these be. As well. Hello, Maureen. Hi, Maureen. Hi, loving the set, especially as I'm no good at drawing eyes. I mean, that is what is so incredible. It is, yeah. And got the guide. Yeah. To draw I mean, the there eyes are, well. in the instructions, it does go through. I mean, it's yeah. here somewhere. Yeah, somewhere. We 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 were literally admiring. In the somewhere. eye earlier, well, maybe yeah, Jimmy it, that, was yeah. in love with it so much. Do you think it? it's probably Dobby? It's gonna be Dobby. Gonna be it's Dobby, gonna be Dobby. But here we go. Here's the instructions. Yeah. Look, and it does show you. Mm -hmm. Just move that in yeah. a little bit for you. Brilliant. It does show you look, how to actually go from the very mm -hmm. first bit all the way through to yeah. actually doing some shading in there so that you've got the instructions in there. Fantastic, yeah. isn't it? Uh, a quick question from Annette saying, I've yet to colour my sand tangle, but now I want to try. Can I use watercolour paint on my tiles or would I need to tangle on watercolour paper? 
No, you can use your water. No, you, yeah, you can use that. Yeah, you can use that. It's fine. There you yeah. go. Any, <laughs> any of the papers that we, we do, mm -hmm. you can watercolour on. Okay, if you want. perfect. It's Always worth it. asking questions while Sandra's No, that's fine. Yeah, it'll yeah, take it. I'd rather you ask that you want than to. not be sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, of course, do make sure that you're checking out on that. Um, we have managed to add a few extras in. So you've got a little bit more um, that is now available. So well, well done if you get that. Um, because we've, yeah, we've got, we've got a bit more, which we always tend to need. So um, we have got you more of an allocation, so there's still a chance to get involved. Um, a lot of you probably gone for the heptagon as well that we made um, available for you and the, the colouring pencils also, so there's lots there. Now, we're going to come across next to our no, Creating Artistic Tiles with I like, Cavishans. I like using these. Mm -hmm. These are, these are just mesmerising, aren't they're they? They're so pretty. And do you know what? You beautiful. can actually build a whole piece around one of those. Yes. And I do use them quite a bit. And they're lovely. It's just nice to have a mixture. And I think sometimes mm -hmm. as well, because you're not necessarily going to know exactly which one you're going to yeah. get, mm -hmm. you've got to work with what, mm. what comes. I like you know that I mean. because yeah. you get a bit of excitement, don't you, when you open I know, the parcel you think, and think, oh, what can I do with this and what yes, colour way am I going to Definitely. Use? It's really nice. Um, and again, um, we've, we've got the opportunity to be able to get, of course, all of that guide that's there, all of the instructions of what you can create with these. And it's been a long time since we've actually had a chance to it work has. with the Yeah, it, it has. It's, it's getting hold of them and it's mm -hmm. because we actually do... Um, lots of different sizes in here. Yep. Trying to get them all oh, the same, at the same time mm -hmm. is quite tricky. That's um, amazing. I love the, the tree design. I'm, I'll demonstrate that. I'll show you how to draw that. To, to the little tree that's coming on that cabinet. It's so well. sweet. It just works perfectly, doesn't it? Isn't so it? you can see some of the bits that you'll be able to create with this. And of course, as we said, Sandra will give you a demonstration as well. Lots and lots of you coming through. So you can get this for 18.55. I know. Have a little look. Mm. So um, I've got my sort of uh, random selection here. <laughs> yeah. Now you get a little stencil with it. You're like, why would you want to do that? Because sometimes you've got to draw around these and drawing oh, okay. round them can be a little bit awkward. Yes, yeah, yeah. So we've actually given you the shapes on the stencil oh, that you can actually use it to draw <laughs> yeah. around. So I'm just going to put that to one side for a moment because okay. I don't actually need it for the, the tree. Mm -hmm. A few people asking, do you do the cavishons on their own? No, we don't. They come as part of this. Yeah, so they okay. will come um, with the book. Then. Yeah, we'll try and get more in so we can do that. But we... It's just hard to get hold of them, though, isn't I it? Know. <laughs> <laughs> to get enough. I know. To get enough. Right, OK, so uh, I'm just going to start this a bit of uh, cartridge mm -hmm. paper. Um, you can use the macros if you want. You can okay. make the tiles. But this is how it all starts, mm -hmm. with a pen. All right? Okay. Now, I suggest that you do do this with a pen to start mm -hmm. with because... Um, you don't want to go back over it afterwards. If you no, you know, okay. A wavy line. Uh -huh. All right, that's how yeah. it starts. <laughs> and then I'm going to thicken little bits up, wavy lines. Yeah. So I've got little sort of bobbles mm -hmm. on either side, okay. like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to do another one next to it. So I'm going to sort of follow the, the line shape now because I've changed yeah. it, haven't I, with those bobbles. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to choose a few more places okay. and put little bobbles on. Mm-hmm. So even if you you know you've never done it before, mm -hmm. you can draw a wavy line. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You can yeah. do that. Yeah, we can probably draw a wavy line better than a straight one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So again, I'm going to put some little bobbles in there. I'm trying to sort okay. of pick little dips and things like that. Yeah. I'll do one more. Mm -hmm. a wavy line. Okay. Mm -hmm. And again, a little bit of a wobble. How now, did you sort of like first realise that you could simplify everything? Oh gosh. Was it? Did you just Sort of know that you could do it and then think actually I can make it accessible to everyone. Uh, yeah, well I've always drawn. Yeah. And I've always done it this kind of drawing uh -huh. and I've I used to teach oh, for a living. Okay, right. So try mm -hmm. sort of getting somebody else to draw what I can do. That's yes. the main thing yeah, for me. Yeah, yeah. And and that's if brilliant. Yeah, if I can write instructions, mm. you see I'm gonna do a wavy line coming up yeah. here. Okay. If I can draw something, break it down yeah. and, and encourage others to draw in this way i think the trick is getting you to believe out there that you can do this mm -hmm. okay see yeah. wavy line same with this one like wavy line yeah and i think that the scary thing of course as we've said is picking this pen up and yes, having a definitely. go mm -hmm. if um you see i'm just extending yeah. that wavy line take uh -huh. it up a little bit yeah once you've picked up a pen and tried it mm -hmm. you know how however it sort of looks to start with yeah I'm going to take this one over here, look, like this. But the brilliant thing is, it's not like a collection that you're then going to ruin if you go wrong or anything. No. Nope. So actually, if you then think, oh, I want to start again, just start again. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, of course, 
you know, if the, the the better the equipment you've got. So mm. if you've got a decent fine liner, you've got your yeah. the, the right pencil, a decent piece of cardstock, mm -hmm. then it's going to work better. Definitely. Than using, um, you know, something that's, yeah. see some more wavy lines. Over a quarter of our stock has now gone on, on this. Um, oh. Wow, yeah, nice. Let's that's grounded it, hasn't it? A few more. Yeah. So... You see how it's just a few wavy lines. Wavy lines. <laughs> but it just looks Let's brilliant. Have another one here, look. Yeah. And then we can, I mean, you can have whatever season you want. Mm -hmm. So let's bring a couple of leaves out. So let's bring a little line. Okay. And then a little leaf at the top there. Mm -hmm. See, let's just colour that in. Yeah. And then if I do little leaf shapes mm -hmm. coming down. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, it could be Halloween, couldn't it? It could, <laughs> it could be yeah. a, a bit of a moon in the background silhouette. But you know, once you've drawn this tree, Mm -hmm. You could draw, I say, any sort of variation. See, little leaves. Yeah, let's just do another one of those. Mm -hmm. And little uh, leaves. Okay. So again, it's quite small, isn't it? So mm -hmm. I'm not really doing anything that's tricky. Yeah. Okay. And then let's put a couple of little flowers on. So yeah, you know, like a little bubble. Mm -hmm. All right. And then I'm going to do top and bottom, side and side flower. Nice. Let's okay. join it. Let's do another one. Bubble. Then top, mm -hmm. bottom, side, side. You see? Perfect, yeah. Let's put some little leaves in there. Same again. So you see how it starts to build mm -hmm. and starts mm -hmm. to grow. So once we've put a little bit of uh, shading on, again, pencil. Okay. Now this is a 2B pencil. Right. Uh -huh. So we, we want it to sort of move a little bit. Mm -hmm. See, I'm not colouring in. I'm just no. adding a yeah. little bit. And then in comes my tortillon, <laughs> okay. which are on the website. I think they're always on the website. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They'll be available on Brand Shop. There you go. Soften it off a little bit. Mm -hmm. Now you you could hang anything from this. You could yeah, have a tire yeah. swing. You could have regular swing. Yeah, yeah. Little, I mean, little hearts, of, yeah, of course. But creating this, you'd want another little wave. Mm -hmm. And then you'd have your cabochon at the bottom. Yeah. So if I bring one in, that's sort of at that stage. Oh, brilliant! There you go. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So a little bit of ink around it. But again, mm -hmm. we could bring a little bit of. Um, so good. A little bit of inking around there. So though this cabochon, obviously, looking at the, 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 the colours, you've got the yeah. same sort of colours. Mm -hmm. So it might have been that I, I wasn't planning to use reds and orange, yeah. but, you know, being that there's reds and oranges in the mm -hmm. cabochon. Yes, that's what you've gone for. Wendy's just said, Sandra's stencils and instructions are brilliant. Oh, so thank easy you, to Wendy. follow and then take the next step doing your own designs. Thanks, Wendy. Yeah, I I think that's the thing, actually, mm. you doing your own designs. So I start you off. Yeah. Then See, you just a little bit around the tree yeah, just I gives it that. a little bit of an effect. Uh, Victoria's just said, can I ask, are, oh, you've spotted that, have you? Are the playing cards coming soon? I love being a Ooh, tangler. Playing and thanks, cards? Thanks, Sandra, for all your help. Playing cards? Um, Who said anything about playing yeah. cards? Yeah, Vix, they are going to be uh, coming up in, well, about an hour. Uh, four o'clock yeah. so you've not got long to last we, we did have the discussion about putting them on pre-order the concern we have to do that is if we put it on pre-order we know that by the time we launch the show at four they'll have sold out completely. I might be going home early um, yeah I mean <laughs> I could sit here and <laughs> chat about I don't know some grapes for an hour but um, <laughs> but but no we want to give everybody the same opportunity and that's what we feel is the fairest way to do it so as soon as four o'clock comes we will put them onto pre-order and they'll, they'll be there okay for that show so yes they're, they're amazing well I'm really excited about that as well. well I wasn't sure which to do first because oh, I love them Jesus all it, and yeah. yeah and you just think which one so I just sort of sh shut my eyes yeah, and whichever one I picked up <laughs> but yeah I just want to show you that you can actually you know we, we're drawing these and they look lovely but yeah. you can actually they're, they're for making cards with yes yeah, so um I am a crafter mm -hmm. first and foremost so it's not just about it being a piece yeah. of artwork mm -hmm. it's about That's you know it creating a card you could put your little yeah. sentiment on it mm -hmm. this could say anything couldn't anything. it yeah i mean even a sympathy card yeah, it could be, be confetti it could be wedding yes, it could yeah, be yeah. sorry to see you going mm -hmm. to a different job yeah, something yeah. like that but it's just they're just beautiful and are you okay to make and sell absolutely yeah, yeah. because what what you see is you're drawing it yeah. i'm showing you how to draw it but you're physically mm -hmm. drawing it so whatever's whatever's yeah, on this <laughs> you've drawn it don't forget to sign it you have to sign it to say it's mm -hmm. yours mm -hmm. and then of course yeah it's a unique somebody's going to keep that and frame it rather than you know think oh it's just a exactly. card i'm going to bin it because yeah. my birthday's yeah, gone fabulous but isn't it? yeah oh. turn them into cards look yes, i made a mess brilliant up. it's fine so 18 pounds 55 for you to be able to get that we've got loads of you still coming through for that wendy janet olivia ruth beverly jackie it's kayla really nice janet 
Um, make sure you check out your baskets. The last thing you want to do is come later and then, you know, they're all sold out because you've put lots in your basket and haven't checked out. You can check out as many times as you want during the day. You'll still only pay that one-off P&P. And remember, with this, you are getting your booklet that guides you through everything. You are also getting your cavachons and your stencil that comes with this and so, so much inspiration. And of course, the cavachons will be a little surprise when you get them home as well in terms of which colours they are um, and what the designs are, which I think is so, so lovely. So, um, well, well done if you have managed to get that. We've got a lot more that we actually want to fit in as I well. Know. It's haven't we? a bit of a busy day. <laughs> We've gone down the lines of countries in a sense because uh -huh. we've got Venice yeah. of a sort, but then, of course, it's we've true. got all the other yes. pieces in. We've got the Spanish, shall we go for? Oh, let's next. do Spanish first. I mm -hmm. love this one. Yeah. Uh, and I'm not just saying that I love it. Actually, the, the original artwork is usually in the gallery at HQ. Oh, really? Because there's only certain artworks yeah, that, that go up, and both of those that we've brought to you today, they yeah. get, they're in they're the, the reception area. That says it all, yeah. doesn't it? Says it all, but <laughs> these are just divine. Now, these are all individual. Um, we've not got the bundle with this. So if you want this, then you can get this, of course, again. It's got all of those step-by-step -step instructions that comes through this. This with the masquerade would be lovely as oh, well, wouldn't could you? it? Yeah, absolutely. Because, again, mm. you've got fan sections yep. that you create your own, so you could actually create... Mm -hmm. different versions and you could have part mask exactly. and part fan you could have a fully open mm -hmm. fan this one is divine yes i know yeah i mean the actual detail in mm -hmm. there but if if you get a little closer with that one yeah yeah you'll actually see that what it's actually made of because it looks so detailed mm -hmm. but bearing in mind we've just done circles and swirls mm -hmm. These are circles and squirrels. <laughs> and if you look here, these are little like, hook shapes. Yes, yeah. These are we've just drawn these leaves on the yeah, tree. Yeah. These again, the same leaf, but they're creating petals. Mm -hmm. So every single thing within there is doable. See, that's what's so clever. You look at that, and I think you would yeah. you'd sit there probably if you're somebody who's you know just coming to to sort of doing these um, designs for the first time, yeah. or you're somebody who doesn't class yourself as an artist. Yeah. You might be thinking, I can't. But like Sandra said. They are just the techniques that we've gone through. Absolutely. And once you build yeah. that up, it's actually quite simple to actually it, it, it manage is, to yeah, create one that. One bit at a time, nice. and that's what the yeah. instructions are there for. So many more uh, beautiful samples that I just um, want to share with you as well that yeah, you've actually got the chance of doing. Yeah, when you think about mm -hmm. it, this is from one stencil. I know. There's so many different And then patterns. that card that you can oh. see just there, you know, if you're wanting to create a card, it's lovely to sort of have that place there. A really large one here, but great for the one. wall, isn't it? But yeah, you can go this large. Yes, You can yeah. go this large, or you can make it for a card that mm -hmm. I mean I actually did do it yeah the difference that, of, and of I did the full two. open okay band, but you've got the instructions for how to draw that one Amazing. and the one we just oh, looked at so up. so good isn't it um so yep so beautiful beautiful opportunities with this now we do also which I just want to um show you have the background as well so if you're thinking well I want that but I also want the backgrounds to go with then we have these here um these are just fab aren't they and again, they're, they're brilliant for backgrounds, but you can see that they've come from the fans themselves. Yeah. So yeah, that's yeah. A, a very, very sort of very stylized Spanish tile on mm -hmm. the top one there. Yeah. And that's been used on the purple one, but it's come off the purple one. Uh -huh. And this one here, the, so the, that one there. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's actually come from the, the, the flourishes that you learn how to draw okay. for the red and yellow Spanish fan. Yes, and yeah. you can then mix and match so everything. Amazing. And goes again, with, well. with, with the look of these sort of almost vines, you'd, you'd be using this, I think, in yeah. so many different designs. Great it's clouds, probably one of the most turning oh, it the other yes. way. Clouds, if you wanted to. Or if you can even. Baby, yeah. yeah, little oh, things like that. that. So much. Yeah, again, so I both do of those. Use that one a lot. And, yeah, I know that one yeah. quite well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love that one. <laughs> We've then got Japan, oh, if you want to come to this one as around well. Around the world. I know. Less than 80 days. This is just, <laughs> yeah. again, oh, wow. This Look is. at this. Um, so, again, your stencils will, of course, be coming to you. Um, I love as well, sometimes you look at the stencil and you think, how is that going to yeah, that? Yeah, I like that about them, though. Yeah. I, I like when you look at that. We do that in class a lot. Do you? And say, like, which yeah. bit is going to be Because they right? don't know what they're going to draw when they come I to class. I love that. So you just kind of hand out a I just hand out a stencil like, and they're like, time. what's this? <laughs> Debbie, you know what I'm going to say, but I'm not going to say it. Oh. De Debbie does uh, pick a lot and she does have a, a go. And she's normally yeah. quite good at the mark. Oh, really? Picks. Uh -huh. But one day she didn't, so everything's now a duck. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah th this, I mean, this kind of card, look at this crane. Mm, I know. There's a, I mean, there's a sample further on where you, there's two cranes together, so imagine that as a wedding oh, card. Oh, okay. I bet we'll get to that yeah, in They're down there, and the fish and the mm -hmm. yin yang. The yin yang is a stencil in its own right anyway, but you yes, can mix them, true, see? Yes, true, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Come on. 
Wow. Some commas. Mm -hmm. It's just, oh, just every single one as well is just, yeah. you know, different because you can just take your own sort of inspiration, can't oh, yeah, you? Yeah, and yeah. go from the, the stencils and do whatever you That's would it. like to do it's as well. Triangle frame there and oh, look at that in the gold. Yeah. Oh, it's just divine. And I love the, the bookmark that we've got just there or the tag that you wanted to see. Yeah. It's just, just lovely, isn't it? So, so different what we've got. And there's, there's just loads and loads of samples. This is the one you were just, just yeah, talking about, wasn't you? Yeah, that's the one I was on you? about. Yeah, look at go. that one. So, you, you know, you can do so mm. many things with it. Mm -hmm. Just see my instructions as the starting point. I'm just getting you going. Oh, that Once one is you've well, decided definitely. that, you know, it's the one for you and you like it. Mm -hmm. There's so many things you can do. Yeah, with it really is. And um, such a positive sort of It is, isn't I feel it? Like yeah, this one very, as well. very bright as well. Yeah, definitely. It's not all, all reds, but it no. works well with any colour. I mean, mm -hmm. look at this one. Look at this. Look at that. Oh. You know, when you think, oh, it's just a few lines. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but imagine framing that. Yeah. That's going to be staying on my wall forever. I know. You know, I've had that, I know. So. Yeah. Oh, fabulous, isn't it? So you've got that. You've then also got the chance to get the background stencils yeah. if you wanted to, which goes with this as well. We just oh, wanted to I make know. as much life for you as possible. <laughs> um, so so, we're trying to be tidy. It's not quite working. I know. It's, it's, just, it's just too much to show, isn't yeah. there? So you can see them oh, there, the two yeah. background stencils. But this one's got. again, oh, you, nice. you know, the, you've got the cherry blossom mm. there. You can take just a sprig of it and you could actually use that on the tree that we've just drawn yes yeah yeah you know, mask a little bit off and it's drawing it for you or you can do the whole thing mm -hmm. and pick a little bit Great of it idea. out yeah. and then you've got that lovely geometric design mm -hmm. in the back as mm -hmm. well works yeah. for all sorts of mm -hmm. things that's that fantastic um so you've got those there then we've also got egypt i know you? i thought Which... we, yeah well, well planned because we'll i'll demonstrate a bit of egypt yes perfect <gasps> we'll, we'll bring it up and get it think, get it live you know, hieroglyphs think cats uh -huh. think the pyramids think the scarab beetle oh. Okay. It's just so many <laughs> things to this. I actually I put quite a few instructions in here because mm -hmm. there's so many things you can actually do yeah. with it. Yeah, that's that's amazing there, isn't it? Yeah. And I think all of us as well, I don't you know, kind of remember learning about Egypt oh, I know, at school yeah. and being fascinated by it. So to be able to create things that are inspired by yeah. it yeah. is is just just brilliant. It yeah. really is. I mean, look and at these. look at these. Again, that the stencils have actually... Yeah, how did that make done, that? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Absolutely. That, where you're seeing like all sort of like multiple parts almost that have yeah. just been put together of and course, used together. Of course, mix it all up. Mm -hmm. See, it's absolutely fabulous, uh, the things that you'll be able to actually create with this. It is, it's, it's just brilliant, isn't it? Um, so again, this is for your instruction booklet and your main stencils. You can see so, so much that you'll be able to actually do with this as well. Um, but you've also got the background stencils that are available also. Um, so if you're wanting to get both, can do remember it is, of course, that one-off postage and packaging fee between midnight and midnight. Those cats are so cute. Look at the little yeah, cats. Yeah, look. you got oh. the cats and the bottom the, the vases and the oh, jugs cute. and they all match the stencil uh -huh. so you can actually draw and yes, have that yeah. in the background as well oh, that's and then the same fair. with the flowers the flowers mm -hmm. on the other one are actually part of the the, the stencil and show you how to draw them yeah but then having it as a background yeah. as well it's just, so, it just so all good. works oh you have a little look it's, like, yeah. it's just Let's lovely isn't again. it absolutely <laughs> So, okay, first thing, and we've probably not mentioned this, if mm -hmm. you've not done this before, yeah. with most of the stencils, if they need it, mm -hmm. you do have numbers. So on Brilliant. the back page yeah. here, I've actually numbered all mm -hmm. the different shapes yeah. because what I'll do in the instructions is I'll refer to example shape one okay. or shape 11 or shape 18. Mm -hmm. So you get an idea of what shape you're working yes. to. Can't so, anything, yeah, can I mean, here, look, draw a vertical line in the centre of your mm -hmm. paper, draw shapes 27, 28, 29, Using the vertical line to centre them. Yeah, perfect. Oh, that's so, yeah, as, that's as gotta, difficult that's it. as it gets. <laughs> just yeah. find them. And so the, here is mine. Look, I have actually got them numbered. You, you need something on, like yeah. a Sharpie and write mm -hmm. it on, okay? Yeah. That's that sorted. So, all right, let's have a go at this uh, a, a scarab beetle then. It's mm -hmm. sort of the, it seems to be the biggest beetle. Oh, there's that cat look. That cat's just, no, just look, look at it. it. Anyway, great. anyway, focus, Sandra, focus. <laughs> There's so many things. It's so exciting to you sort of pick all the different Not get distracted, can you? No, no, vertical line, mm -hmm. okay? And then here's my numbers, look, 27, 28, 29. So I'm going to centre them up on the line as it says in the instructions. I'm just going to draw a bit of this because I've got one a little bit further mm -hmm. on and, and I'll show you sort of how it, how it works from there. So here we go. All right, draw my shapes. Yeah. Yeah? Vicky's just said, I love the Egypt stencil set, perfect oh, for gold and glitter pens. <gasps> Great idea. Yes, yeah. yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Right, a couple little curves either side and I'm going to join this one to this one. Mm -hmm. 
You see? So already, whoever's drawing this is going to be different because mm. you've had to draw that bit. Yeah, yeah. And this is the beauty of it. I don't want to give you everything. I want to give you enough that you can work with, but yes. then you can create. So let's just do one of the legs. It's like mm. a little, little rectangle look. Okay. And then I'm going to put a little curve so I know where it's going. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then on here, I'm going to do like a triangle. Yep. And see, following the line, another mm -hmm. triangle. Another triangle. Yep. And at the top here, curve. Mm -hmm. Curve. And a curve. There's Brilliant. your leg. Yeah. Yep. A little one. One on the top there. Mm -hmm. Do you see how that works? Yes. And then here you go. Here's my little wing. It's going to go in here. Mm -hmm. So you see how that sort of starts to yeah. form? Yeah. yeah. So once you've got the structure in, we then start adding extra bits and pieces in. Okay. So this has got a little bit more to it. You see, I've added the extra little bit. Mm -hmm. I've got my little curls coming in here. Yeah. So I've sort of moved on a little bit up the stages. Okay. So we're here now to sort of actually come in. Mm -hmm. I've got a rectangle here. It looks a bit odd. That's because what I want to do is I want to keep this shape within that space. Mm -hmm. I don't want it going all over the place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So helping me out to keep it within that is, is that bit of structure. Mm -hmm. So we could all draw yeah. a rectangle. Yeah. You know, trying to keep a, a swirly, curly thing in, mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. in control uh -huh. isn't as straightforward. So actually using uh -huh. the, that rectangle to help us puts yeah. that in place mm -hmm. like so. So that's why that one's there. Yeah. Yeah. So that gives us that little mm -hmm. bit. And then it's like, what are we going to do on the top here? And we've got flowers to put in. Let's mm -hmm. put one of these. Let's say flowers. Think about the ones we've just seen on the uh, background stencil. Very similar little triangles almost. Mm -hmm. And then one here. Yeah. And then I can put some little shapes here mm -hmm. to create these. So little loops. Mm -hmm. So again, Nothing tricky at all there, yeah. at all. But let's come to the body and let's mm -hmm. have a look at this. So we did swirls with the fan, at uh, the fan, the masquerade <laughs> earlier. Yes. So I'm sort of got ideas now, mm -hmm. thinking fans and masks together. That's why I'm, <laughs> that's how my head's working. So again, if I do half of it, you can see I'm bringing swirls in to fill that mm -hmm. space. So I'm not worried too much about whether it matches what's no, in the exactly. picture or not. It doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then here, I can bring in a loop. There's one. Amazing. And then that one, see, it looks like mm -hmm. it's going underneath. And that one looks like it's going underneath. And then here, let's put some lines in. And then this one. You see, so I've put myself a little grid in. Mm -hmm. And then I could put like a little square in the top there. square in there <laughs> and there mm -hmm. so again i'm building up very very simple shapes yeah okay very little bits and pieces looks so majestic almost it does doesn't it i mean you i mean with the colors with the scarab beetle mm -hmm. it's one of those things you could go real to town with so if yeah. i show you now i was obviously i do that on on both sides the uh, the actual wings i think i've got some little lines sort of coming off mm -hmm. this way but let me show you once it's colored with, with the Egypt stencil, we've got like two. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's pretty much gone. Okay. <laughs> well, look, look at that. And then, of course, here's those flowers in the background, and that. it just brings it together, doesn't it? I just so love it with in. all of like the glitter and everything. Oh, the glitter. It? But you could go to town, oh. and you've seen quite a few of these, actually. The creative yeah, team yeah, have really yeah. sort of uh, come through because there's one with a cabochon in the middle yeah. there. If you mm -hmm. want to use that one. I, mean, I think but that's what I love that you can see how it, the collections yeah. actually work across Ev with each Everything, other. absolutely. But yeah, yeah. that's. Wow. Very straightforward to draw. So I've used yeah. a pencil until you're confident. Yeah. Then go in with pen, rub out your pencil when you know mm -hmm. it's dry. Yeah. And then go to town, put your yeah. colours on, put them in as yes. pictures, yeah, cards, yeah. anything. I mean, even we draw onto mm -hmm. fabric and all sorts. Yeah. Your tangle board, everything you could do with this. It's just, they're just beautiful. It's just phenomenal, isn't it? It really is. Um, yeah. One thing out yeah. of the instructions. I know, and I just love that we can see that they're so so different you know yeah. each one that you kind of exactly. um, that you Whatever get you just there as well the wrong way around didn't I? sorry okay. um i'm like where am i going where am i going, where am I going? there yeah. we are <laughs> we're flying all directions <laughs> i know 
<laughs> they are, of course they do. <laughs> but you can see everything else that you can create, of course, with this as well. So uh, well, well done, of course, if you've managed to get this. Annette has said, any chance there might be some uh, around the world themed mini stencils? Maybe wonderful postcard. Oh, Thank you. Oh, they would actually, yeah, yeah. Good idea. Something's a shh. I can't, tell you, I can't tell you what's coming. It's all my head. Keep 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 your eyes keep your eyes peeled it's is what we'd always head. say with things like this. Uh, then we've got another message from Claire. Hello, Claire. You okay? Um, hi, I've just joined watching you. I'm fascinated. These designs hi, are just lines. I can't wait to see they a demonstration. Yeah. yeah, that that's the they thing, are. isn't just it? Lines. You'll be able to just do lines. it, which is what I absolutely love about it. Um, <laughs> Uh, are you from Stoke? I am originally, yes. Yes. And you know, you, you it comes out when I'm I'm, I'm uh -huh. in full flow of talking about things. Yeah. It does, I've not lived in Stoke on Trek for a long time, uh -huh. but yeah, I do come from Stoke. Yes, you are. Um, <laughs> we've just had Theresa as well saying, just I bought do. the latest bundle for Lily after she had oh. surgery to remove four wisdom teeth. Oh, well. I know. Yeah, I hope she's well. Oh, yeah, thinking about okay. it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, she'll yeah. love. She will love this. Mm -hmm. It's a lovely she little will. present. Maybe she makes will. it worth having the teeth out. Yeah. <laughs> Well, maybe. We'll, yeah, maybe. We'll, we'll just come back to the Masquerade, which is the brand, brand new one. We have, as I say, added additional stock. We had sold out of our initial quantity. We've added more for you, um, which is fabulous. Um, there's a couple of people who have just asked about the pin badge code from Christmas Day, Santangle. If you had any issues at all, um, it's all it's all been sorted. So, um, yeah, you can definitely apply it to your basket and it will kind of Brilliant. work. We've just had a check to make yeah. sure. So, yes. Yeah, so, um, some something I don't know technical, but yeah, it's all yeah. working. Yeah. So yeah, and it wasn't Dobby because he's there. No, we can't blame <laughs> him today. We'll, we'll blame someone upstairs. Yeah, we can still blame Liam. Um, he might be in Frankfurt. We can blame him. <laughs> so yeah, this masquerade bundle has been incredibly, incredibly popular. I think we've got about forty chances left, and that's with the additional stock that we've added in. Um, so do of course be quick if you want to get this. This is the bundle set where you are of course getting the stencils, the background stencils, as well as the fabulous, fabulous booklet and guide. Okay. Oh, no, I thought else. I'd do, do the eye. Yeah, 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 please do, yeah. Now, you've got your shapes in here. Now, of course, if you wanted to draw this larger, mm -hmm. you could draw it and then you could draw around it. Oh, yeah, good you idea. Know, to give you yeah. that. But let's work with this size here, okay? Starting with that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to come over the top. Yep, mm -hmm. like this. And then I'm going to do a line underneath as okay. well. Like so. You see, I'm just going to curve that off slightly. Mm-hmm got that going on all right it's going to give me a bit of a thicker line there mm -hmm. and I'm going to do a little bit there yeah and a little bit there mm -hmm. okay so get it's just they're just gestures at the moment yes, they're just yeah, lines yeah. they're just shapes and then I'm going to imagine here mm -hmm. that I've got a so you're never going to see sort of the full circle it's almost going to sort of sit slightly above there yeah. and of course you've got loads of circles on the stencil you mm -hmm. can use if mm -hmm. you want to brown free handy let's, do, let's go for it okay yeah and then let's put bubble in the middle mm -hmm. and I'm going to put a little sort of highlight there okay let's do another one there mm -hmm. yeah let's go around the eye there and then in this one I'm gonna let's fill it in with um, black ink mm -hmm. so let's fill that middle bit in with black ink yeah there we go all right mm -hmm. with my pen and I'm going to draw that highlight in there and yep. I'm going to bring that little line all around. I'm just going to sketch it in slightly. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's put that one in and that one in. Yep. And there. See, let's draw all of this in now. I wouldn't draw everything in until you're confident. Mm -hmm. but yes. I'm working on a bit of a time schedule here. So, <laughs> all right, let's put that in there and that one in there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got that going on. And then I'm going to come around and I'm going to put some lines in. Now, each each line, you see, I'm working from the outwards mm -hmm. going in. Yes. And I want them all to be different sizes. Okay. So you've got to follow the shape. Okay? So mm -hmm. don't don't sort of try and keep it straight. You've got to follow the shape round. You see? All the way around. And again, I'm doing this quickly, so take your time. And I would mm -hmm. do this straight away with pen. Yeah. Because okay. going back in it, after you've drawn it, and you'll never get it the same as you've drawn with pencil, and you know, yeah. you'll, you'll lose the will to live a little bit. And again, from the outside, mm -hmm. like so. Okay. okay. Yeah. Brilliant. We come my way around. And then around here, I'm going to do sort of mm -hmm. a bit of a wavy line to sort of thicken it up a bit. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of like a rough yeah. kind of line going around. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. uh, eyelashes start in the middle. Okay. Yes. Zoom in that way. Mm -hmm. So you can go as long or short as you want. You can add yeah. dots on. You can go more tangly. Mm -hmm. So this side, they're going to get a bit smaller going this way. Okay. And same on this side. There you go. So they're going to be a bit small at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Unless you've used loads of mascara. <laughs> yeah. See? And then let's just bring my torch on in. Mm -hmm. I want to darken it up this side. And this side. Yeah. Going in there. Mm -hmm. Okay, just going to bring a little bit of colour in. Now, I know you don't yeah. normally get red eyes, but because I've only got <laughs> two minutes, uh, and this is the colour that's there. Yeah. Okay, so a bit of colour in there. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's see, working It's so around. good again. I mean, uh, this could really be something that somebody struggles with, you know, to actually yeah. create an eye that looks realistic yeah. and real. And with those simple directions, you can do it. That's it. Let's go a little bit darker in there, mm -hmm. darker in there. Fantastic. All that in eight steps. Yeah. That's unbelievable. And I. Yeah, and are. then of course you want a pair, you just do it the opposite <laughs> yes, way around. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Job done, yeah. So, Job so done. Good. So you, you can learn how to do that, of course, um, within this, as well as the steps. other <laughs> steps. Eight steps to do it. You know what? I needed you as my teacher when I was at school because <laughs> no way did my art teacher ever teach me that in eight steps eight I could do an eye. I, no. I was still trying up two weeks later, you know, to like <laughs> same design that's there. So, so, so much comes in this. Remember, of course, you're also getting um, your, your templates there, your stencils, and then you've also got your two background stencils that are going to come with this and it means that you can also create those fabulous um, masks as well oh, as the gorgeous that. eyes that we're seeing I mean these designs are just fantastic to get all five of these aren't they yeah. And so there, there is an eye one somewhere. There is. We, we we'll find it haven't. later. It'll be yeah. on the next show. We can show it in the next show, yeah. can't we? <laughs> and then the eye, but you've just showed it. Yeah. Um, just yeah. there of what we're going of, to do. Put a picture on And Facebook it's a really good, right, really good picture that we were admiring. Maybe it's still upstairs. Who knows? Um, so 27 dollars This is on eBay already. <laughs> Maybe that's where Adam's gone. He's Maybe ran so away with it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, now you're back in an hour. Yeah. Um, and we will then be launching the playing cards that I know have been being being asked about so yeah as soon as we come to talk sorry hour, everybody we'll we had to, to hold off with it mm -hmm. we did yeah, so yeah. you see how busy yeah, we always yeah. are it just doesn't Neither seem fair yeah. to be like sorry sold out um sorry we haven't had time to fit in pictures as well we'll try and squeeze them into the next hour Brilliant. just wanted to get in as many demo bits as we possibly could um i will be back in a moment we've got maria coming up with some amazing bits and then sandra will be back at full see you soon If you're shopping here at Hobbymaker and have a discount code to use, this is applied at checkout via our website or app. Once you've added all your items to your basket, then simply pop the code in the discount box and click redeem. The price will automatically adjust and then you're ready to continue with checkout. Alternatively, if you're shopping with us via the phone, our friendly help team will apply the discount for you. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel.
Registering for a Hobbymaker account on our website couldn't be easier. Head over to hobbymaker.co.uk and click on Register Now. Type in your preferred email address, create a password of your choice, and we just ask you for a few simple details. Click on Create Account and then away you go. Within your account setting, you can view your order history, address and card details and items in your basket. Shopping made easy with Hobbymaker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Hello, what a fantastic day we're having. Um, so we have got Maria here from Old Made New and I'm really excited about this because we've done some lovely shows back preemie going off on maternity, but I've never actually done a show with you that's like this uh, and I've never seen these amazing kind of wooden stamping blocks and I'm really excited to see how they work and everything about that as well. So yeah. it's all part of my heritage um, aspect of the business. Okay. Um, it's an again, endangered craft. Mm -hmm. It's all sort of basically handed down hundreds of years in India yeah. where they have families who have actually learnt the art of skill of carving the blocks. Okay, yeah. And they do each one by hand. So they like works of art on their own. Yeah, absolutely. And um, basically it's a dying industry. Mm -hmm. So all my stuff is based on heritage, as okay. you know. Yes. So yeah, but I have had the, the blocks are so successful. Mm. I've been on about four times. Yeah. I've done four collections since we've seen each yes, other. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not and surprised. They're just, they're they're just growing. Yeah, yeah it is. It's absolutely <laughs> lovely to see it. We'll, we'll pop them straight onto the website for you. So if you do want to shop ahead, you can do. I mean, I'm thinking, yeah, you can use these, but I would just be putting them up, to be honest. I'd be like, yeah. I want this as my decoration. They're absolutely stunning. Um, so we'll be talking about those more in a few moments. But we're going to start first where we've got Indian rag paper. You might be sitting there and thinking, what's that? Well, let us show you because the texture of this is absolutely amazing. Yeah, basically I have journals. I've sold mm -hmm. the journals on, on before, as you know. Yeah. And um, basically it's rag paper, so it's cotton based. Okay. Mm -hmm. so there's no trees or anything involved to be you know, chopped down. Yeah. Um, it's all hand pulped mm -hmm. and dried out. Wow. And it's all individually handmade. Okay. And, I, and I just love the way they tear the edges. Yes, you know, I do. Tall yeah. edges. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? That kind of finish that we've actually yeah. got. And we've got some over here that have actually been used, of course, with those wooden stamps as well that we've got. Yeah. I, I mean, it just looks so brilliant, that finish that yeah. you're actually getting as Any well. Any card makers or crafters, I mean, you can make wrapping paper with that. You oh, can, great you idea. Know, that sort of the gift wrapping, mm -hmm. um, tags. But um, any crafters that love their card making, uh, this paper is absolutely fantastic because mm -hmm. it does take the water really well. Oh, so okay. water colour, which I'm going to show you with the yeah. intense blocks as well. Yeah, brilliant. Yeah. And um, so yeah, we will be seeing, of course, how 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 we actually kind of use onto this as well. But you're going to get ten sheets, okay, in total. I'm really excited for you to get it home if you haven't worked with something like this before because it's feeling that texture, it's feeling that thickness as well that you've got. And then, like you said, with journaling or scrapbooking, to be able to right. kind of like um, you know cut into this or rip into this and yeah. use parts of it to build up. I, think I mean, you can brilliant. dye them into different colours. You can do all your um, basic mm -hmm. mixed media on these. Yes. Um, you can actually emboss into these as really? well. Really? As well? Yeah, oh, and it's absolutely okay. stunning because when you do your watercolour over the embossing, it does look really effective. Oh, wow. 
Wow. Um, and that is £12.99 today to be able to get all 10 of these sheets. Um, oh, we've got a clock on. It makes me think that we're probably going to go even lower on that price. Um, it's always nice to be able to bring you something that's a little bit different as well. Can you die cut into, into this? You can well? die cut yeah. into this as well. Um, another thing, you, well, obviously it looks lovely torn yes. as well on the edges. So you can actually tear into it, mm -hmm. um, layer them up, dye yep. them, you know, all kinds. Oh, it's fabulous, isn't it? So a fantastic opportunity. Um, and I really think you want to get these home to sort of really appreciate that, that texture, that quality that we can feel as well um, and what we're seeing, especially when today we're actually going to be going to a lower price. So we're not going to be at £12.99. I don't even know where we're going, to be honest with you. See what Kat's doing. OK, that's a pound a sheet now. So we're talking under £10 for you to be able to get these. Um, and of course, we are going to be showing you how to work with these across all of the other collections as well, um, so that you can really sort of see the medium that we've actually got here with the rag paper. It's totally, totally brand new. Um, and I think it's nice when we're actually sourcing something that is a bit different on the shelves. Yeah, I must admit, um, when I have sort of researched mm. what I was taking as products, yeah. I haven't really seen a lot of this on the market. Obviously, it's from India anyway. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, but in the future, watch the space because there is more coming, oh, more different okay. types of papers. Oh, amazing. Um, beautiful ones with dried flowers in and all oh, kinds of things, cool. but all done in India. Yes, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh you get so, some yeah. of the most amazing <laughs> bits from there, don't you? It's, yeah. um, lovely opportunities for you. £9.99. You can multiply, you can buy, um, you know, if you want more than 10 sheets that are available, it's completely up to you. But lovely how they've just got that fabulous kind of vintage esque edging that I can sort of um, see there where they've already been ripped, they've kind of been finished off perfectly perfectly as well so that is £9.99 um, so well done I mean if you if you manage to get the thermal cinch and like that it'd be great to kind of work along with that as well because of making your journals um, so it's, it's just nice how everything can kind of work together and it is a brand new opportunity today at £9.99 now um, the meadow flower blocks we've had a couple of people You've spotted them. You've measured in saying, can we have a little look at these? Of course you can. Um, so you've got the set of three that you can just see at the bottom here. If people haven't come across these before, should we just talk they a little bit about new. them? All the three blocks today mm -hmm. are new launch. Um, I love meadow flowers. Yes, and I think yeah. you can do so much. And they're versatile. Um, they're about two and a half inches by an inch Great, aren't they? wide. Mm -hmm. um, basically, you can use them together or individually. Yep. As you see in some of the samples that I've done, mm -hmm. they create a lovely um, background fabrics for your sewing yeah. as yeah, well. Yeah. Um, on, you know, you can do it on cloth or on paper, paper mm -hmm. crafting. There's a lot you can do with those. Absolutely. They really are. And I love the size of them, I have to say, because yeah. they're very usable, aren't they? They're they something are. that I think um, you are just going to be consistently using as well to be able to get all three of them. And lovely to actually have the mix of flowers that we can see, which, you know, yes, like we said, you can use them together. You could use them separately. It's totally up to you in terms of being able to actually build up these scenes that we're seeing um, and to actually have those opportunities. And it's 1999 for you to be able to get all three if you look at the second piece um, that we've got here as well um, and that that's making like a really sort of long design that's as well right. by sort of stamping them next to each other yeah I mean if you do furnishings home furnishings the cushions mm -hmm. garden rooms would be lovely with these oh definitely because you know, that's definitely. a new thing at the moment I went to a garden center at the weekend and there's so many outhouses outbuildings mm -hmm. and they'd be lovely wouldn't they yeah and the thing is I think you do find um, that it's you know it's this is my style <laughs> I love this this is like a shawl pretty nice up and have a look you can put it around you if oh you want. wow look at that <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> again i mean if you're into your sort of asian beautiful isn't as it well you can actually create your own yes but yeah that's all the blocks that are on today that's the actual meadow flower oh, block set fabulous? plus also the little foliage one yes yeah, yeah 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 and the fact that you can actually build up something like this it's just yeah. just, just mesmerizing isn't and it, it doesn't take long as well it doesn't know, once you once you start knowing how to load up yeah which I'll demonstrate. Yeah, yeah, fabulous. Um, something like that only took me the afternoon to do. Really? Yeah. See, that's the thing. You can, you can literally <laughs> build these up as quickly as you want. Um, we've got um, a message just come through here saying, what medium would you use to apply blocks to fabric for embroidery? I'm actually going to use, funny enough, the ink tense block okay. and the yeah. ink tense pencils. And I think they are on your website by some Yes, Street. yes, we've got them available, yeah. Um, I love, I'm a firm believer mm -hmm. in these ink tense pencils. Basically, they are ink in a pencil mm -hmm. and the colours are so vibrant. Yeah. And I'm going to show you how to use the ink blocks and make a paste with these. Oh, OK. So then we can actually block print with them. Oh, amazing. So okay. I'll show that. And I think as well, like with so much stuff, you need the right 
tools yeah. to be able to actually get the effect, don't you? And that's yeah. what you want. You want it to be perfectly kind of stamping into each of these bits as well. 15% of the stock has gone now on these. You are getting all three for under £20. That's making them less than £7 each. And these are hand-carved, aren't They're they, all each as well? individually as well. It's amazing. So when, I think I did have Aisha on in August. Yeah, OK. Came over from Delhi. Mm -hmm. She was over here for the NEC Quilt oh, Festival. Oh, how lucky. And um, we had some pictures. Yeah. And we've got a video somewhere, I think, on one of your websites. Yeah. Um, showing you the carvers, how they actually do oh, the carving. How good but is they do that? it in big sections. Yeah. And they do about 30 probably on one section. Wow. They're literally okay. just stamping out. Yeah, they're amazing. I think it just makes it so much more special when you yeah. actually know as well that work that's gone into it, the workmanship um, that we have. Now, we also have the two larger ones that we've got here. So we've got the Dutch Tulip. We've also got the Pretty Primrose that you can see here. Um, so if we start with the Pretty Primrose, um, I absolutely love 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 both of these i have to say but it's the way that it perfectly yeah. stamps onto right. onto this bag i mean yeah i mean i colored into that with alcohol and markers did you as okay. well yeah, so yeah. again if you use acrylic paints to actually uh -huh. stamp it first yeah which i'll demonstrate and um, then i used my acrylic blocks or i've used um, my alcohol markers mm -hmm. and they're actually really good they really do really good isn't it and i think as well when you get something that's as detailed as this, it, it kind of elevates your work. And it, yeah. it, rather than having to spend all this time to try and create something that you probably can't actually create yourself anyway, all the work's done for you and suddenly right. it just looks perfect. And the other thing as well, I did have on the other show, I did a clay show. Oh, okay, amazing. You can actually use these blocks and stamp into the clay. Oh, really? And then you can actually then hard and dry hard. And then when they are, you can paint them, okay. make them into coasters. You could do all kinds of things. Oh, wow. But I did tree decorations as a Christmas show. Oh, that's a great idea. And we did mm -hmm. trees for the tree. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you see, you don't think of that, do you? Yeah. That you can actually kind of use it for so many. The yeah, wood is made purposes. of shisham wood. Okay. So it's a hard wood. Yeah. And it's really good with all mediums, like gel mediums, mm -hmm. paint. You can leave them in the water and they don't warp. Okay, brilliant. And they dry out quite quick as yeah. well. And I think when if I, if I just sort of show you this just up close so you can really kind of get into that design, you can see as well, I mean, it's it's thick, isn't it? Yeah. It's a real kind of high-end. It's very high, heavy. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's really amazing quality that you've got there. And you can just see that all of this individually hand carved and look at every single detail every single little part of that that has just been created perfectly yeah, hasn't it that's right um so 19 pounds 99 if you want to get that that's just six by six we can also come across to the tulips i know for a lot of people tulips are their favorite flower as yeah. well people absolutely adore tulips and um this i mean I, I love them all but this was the one that immediately drew you know drew me into this yeah. and especially when you actually see it because we have got the bags available for you to buy as well so if you wanted to create something like this how spectacular is that that's using the pencils the intense pencils after okay this, and actually just sketching into that mm -hmm. again cassandra's just been on you can do zantangle yeah, if you want yeah. as well oh she could yeah i think that's what's lovely when you get images like this you can kind of then you know sort of use your own imagination and that's your own nice. creative that you want to if you want to individualize it but again at 19 pounds 99 and you can see that we go from this super sized stamp and that then comes to that as well and um, if you do want to buy any of the the bags because you are thinking well i want to create exactly that then you've got these available on the show as well so if you want to buy uh the cream tote bag it's eight pounds 99 one now nah, go lower cat's like no 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 <laughs> 8.99 um 100 cotton these bags are as well six pounds 99 today and you could you know you could stamp on both sides you could stamp on one side you could personalize them as well i love a tote bag yeah they are all actually handmade in india again and the oh, cotton brilliant. is really really lovely yeah you can yeah, feel the quality yeah, can't you with quality cotton that absolutely um so yep you've got that there maybe you wanted to make a little beach bag i'm sort of ready for summer to come now so i'd be ready to kind of go down and to the patchwork and... you could actually patchwork all these blocks onto pieces of sections oh, yes. of fabric and then just stitch into them oh that's a great idea yeah, yeah that'd be lovely wouldn't it um so six pounds 99 should we have a little look yeah. at how to use all of these bits well, i'm going to start off with the paper because yeah. i think the paper's because it's new as yeah, well. Yeah, it's nice, you know, it's it, nice. Mm -hmm. So it all comes, it says handmade with care as well, so mm -hmm. it has been. Um, again, you get your 10 sheets. Fab. I'll just put that aside. And what I tend to do is when I'm actually working, I always tend to have a bit of um, sort of give, because when you use the blocks, they're quite hard. Okay. And it's yes. a bit like um, gel stamps, they've already got that bit of give. Yeah, yeah. So you're sort of given a base, mm -hmm. which has actually got a bit of give to it. So you've got that. And I just yeah. use a piece of funky foam, which oh, is yeah. easy, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
and then just fit it onto here. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wet the, the actual base with okay. the intense blocks. These are the intense. These are for fabric, okay. but you can use them on paper. Oh, as well. And don't Definitely. think I'm using cotton fabric, cotton in the paper. Yes. So yeah. it's actually quite a fabric-y as well. Yeah, very true. Which is quite good. Mm -hmm. So yeah, basically I'm just going to sort of run over. Okay. So you can be like a bit of a Picasso if you want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> to be. So it's just giving you a bit of a base. Mm -hmm. I do two tones. Yeah. So we can colour in. Just wanted to show what it's like when it gets wet mm -hmm. and how do you create your own papers really. Yeah. And if you're not happy with anything, don't forget, you know, you can always sort of like tear bits off it. Yeah, and just keep cool. it into your journals. Mm -hmm. Just gonna wet my brush. You've got yep. my water's just over here. <laughs> I've got a, a basically a sable brush because it's quite soft, but the brushes I've got on today are actually synthetic and they're really good because they hold the okay. water really well. Mm -hmm. So you can see already, it's giving you that watercolour effect. And you can see the water sort of literally seeping into the, the paper, mm -hmm. which is really, really lovely. You wouldn't think that, would you, with papers, that you could put all the water on like that? I know, it's actually near enough dry already. Wow. It dries quite quickly, because I think what it does is it sucks up all that yes, water yeah, yeah. into the rag, which is it's actually fabric, really. Mm -hmm. And the nice thing about it as well, you can put on as much as you want, but it doesn't seem to come through very much. No, really doesn't, does it? No, which is really good. So if you are actually wanting the other side, mm -hmm. I mean, book covers would be lovely on this. Oh, definitely. Um, mm -hmm. but again, if you're doing your journaling, yeah. I think that's why I always think with things like this, like people need to get it home because you need to feel it. Yeah. You know, to, to really sort of feel that, that quality of this and, and the that's sort right. of thickness. I mean, it is quite hard to come by. I've not seen it anywhere in the UK very much. Mm. Um, there is lots of like angel hair and lots of other types of papers, but not the actual percentage of 100% mm -hmm. rag paper in here, which is actually cotton. Yes, yeah, yeah. And if you, you know, even if you've got your general stamps, you know, your plant form and stuff, you've got a base, yeah, which is really lovely to work with. So already you can see that's already dry on that side. Wow. So it dries quite quickly. Yeah. And I did quite, I wet that quite a lot. Yes, yeah, yeah. I love so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start to use the meadows. Okay, I love brilliant. the meadow stamps. Yes, anyway. yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, somebody did ask just now about using um, different paints. I use acrylic as well. Okay, acrylic's yeah. Acrylic's quite good for fabric. The only trouble is with acrylic, mm -hmm. if you don't mix it with a fabric medium, yeah. it goes very stiff. Oh, okay. And you can't get rid of that stiffness, even yeah. if you wash it. Mm -hmm. So that's why I tend to use the ink tent pencils if right. I can. Yeah. I'm going to just show you how to make a paste of one of these as okay. well. So what we can do is we get the intense block and I'm literally mm -hmm. going to wet the block on the end. Okay. Just to get some colour up on there. Yeah. And what you need to do is wait till it goes quite creamy. Mm -hmm. It doesn't hurt the block as it, it dries again. So the consistency is quite, yes, it's like a yeah, paint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I just wanted to say, just do the flower, I can literally mm -hmm. just use my paintbrush. Okay. Press it down firmly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't press too hard Okay. as well, because if you do just do firm, you'll see how mm. it nicely goes. Mm -hmm. And the nice thing about block printing, if there is little bits that you think, oh, I'm not happy with, it doesn't yeah. matter, because that's part of the look. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. So again, these blocks are really good. But you can do this on the fabric because obviously they are designed to go on fabric. Okay, yeah. And once you've ironed it, it is fixed. Oh, brilliant. So you can wash mm -hmm. as well with it. So I'm only doing the flower at the moment. Yeah. And then that's another thing about these blocks is if you, there's certain sections mm. that you don't want it in to be all of it. Yeah, you, you can actually parts. use the green where it's green and, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And sometimes you do just want the flowers or you might just want the foliage or just the leaves. So you can kind of just take whatever you want from it, really. That's right. You? But they're nice and vibrant. Mm. And the whole collection is based on Dutch flowers because I got inspired when I went to see an exhibition. Yes. <laughs> uh -huh. in, in Plymouth. It was called the Dutch Painters Exhibition. And um, basically I got some sketches going and that's how, where it all comes from. And they're really vibrant, the colours. Yeah, definitely. I think that's the thing I always love to, you know, we were speaking about it upstairs, like where the inspiration actually comes from, yeah. you know, for each different thing as well. That's right. That's so nice. 
So basically, it was like this is a very happy collection. Yeah, that's it. And also another thing is if children love this, because they can't break the blocks, no, but they absolutely yeah. love block printing. Mm -hmm. And the workshops I've seen with children doing this is absolutely stunning, some yeah. of the work that they've done. So a tote bag, you know, they could decorate one up for Easter. Mm -hmm. Yes. Put your little Easter eggs in for the Easter egg hunt. <laughs> and Mother's Day, I think it'll be quite nice to have. Yeah. Them. Mm -hmm. So again, this is the blocks. This is not using acrylic paint or anything. You mm -hmm. can see how much, how much paint can come off one little stick there. Yes, yeah, yeah. And how wet it is, you know, when it can sort of... Mm -hmm. And have the blocks been on the shows previously? Um, these ones haven't. These are brand new launch, these three. But the, I've had four shows with blocks. Four, four different, different shows. types of yes. designs. The mm -hmm. Christmas one was really good. That sold out twice. Yes, yeah. That one. I'm not surprised. I think it's because they're so different to what we normally see in terms of stamps, aren't they? They are. But you just know that because of the quality of them, you're going to be able to uh, just just use them and use them. And like you say, it's lovely that children can have yeah. a go. You can have a go. You can do it with grandchildren and everything like that as well. I've got um, lunchbox cases now and I've got about five yeah. with all the different designs really? I've done. Oh, I love that. And I do go back on them because that range, the foliage flower, yes. the Bindi yeah. collection, mm -hmm. that has been on before, but it's sold out twice. Yes. <laughs> and um, it's such a lovely collection because you can, you can use mm -hmm. it to fill in mm -hmm. little areas. Yeah. So when I'm, when I'm actually cleaning this, I'm literally using just a damp cloth. Okay. And it literally will clean. Brilliant. Okay. So it's ever so good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this one here now, which is actually like a, it looks a bit yeah. like a lavender mm -hmm. sort of lavender yeah, it does, stick doesn't sort it? of thing. So what we'll do is we're going to use, we'll do it on a green maybe, a nice. Mm -hmm. And you get a little hand printed mm -hmm. um, block print as well on bag with those ones as well, mm -hmm. as they're all individually. Lots of you with these um, in your baskets as well. So do remember they are completely brand new today and you are actually getting the chance to get three of these hand carved flowers, these meadow flowers that we're seeing. You know, every single one is individual. It's something that has, I just love that each one has been hand carved. Um, Maria was last on in October because obviously it takes such a long time for us to be able to obviously get these created because they do come directly from India. And they're just so pretty, aren't they? Each of those they stamps are. to be able to get all three of those that are totally different but we know of course that with flowers flowers butterflies we always talk about as being the most used so with these use them on fabric use them on the tote bags use them on your cards you can use them on so many different mediums um, they could they could just be a decoration in your craft room if that's what you wanted because they're just so pretty aren't they? The Beautiful. they smell nice as well yeah they do yeah <laughs> they've got this lovely um cedar cedar wood sort of smell haven't they Bit of a wait on the phone lines there. You will be answered next, Linda. Jacqueline, you're almost there. Kathleen, Jennifer, Lynn as well. Jane just managing to get yours. Well done to you. Um, great price at under seven pounds each. They're lovely. Again, with my collections, I only do a limited number. Yes, yeah. And then yeah. I'm on to my next design. Mm -hmm. So I've got a lot of followers who buy all my blocks I every bet. time. Yeah. And then they have in their collection. Yes. Which is, you know, I always have in mind that mm -hmm. this you'll use and use. Yeah. You know. I think it makes it more special as well when there's limited numbers. Because oh, yeah. you know that you're one of that, that small kind of acquired group that actually have this and can use it as well yeah you don't want it to be um mass produced mm, you know no. sort of thing and i do put a lot of thought into the design yeah. side so again mm -hmm. i'm just using the intense blocks which are absolutely fab these are brilliant these are you can use them for so many things fab. do you, you use the watercolors in the the same way as well if you've, yeah. you've got those yeah, so what we're going to do is, with the pencils, I'm going to use straight onto fabric. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm also, you can actually put the pencils into this as well if mm -hmm. you wanted to. Yeah. Um, but I find it's a waste in a way sometimes if you're using the pencils mm -hmm. um, because you can just use the blocks okay. in yeah. the same way. But yeah. again, if I ironed this, this would actually be fixed as wow, well. That's so, so good, isn't it? Yeah, they're really, yeah. really good. So basically, that's that one. That's, mm -hmm. That design's done. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to do a little bag. Okay, lovely. Um, just to show you. Mm -hmm. I don't know what, I'll have a look through this and just to give you some ideas yes, as well. Yeah, yeah. This is quite good. This is my little journal. It all started when I had the, the last lot of blocks. Okay, yeah. So some of the blocks that you haven't seen are in this journal. Uh -huh, perfect. So basically, so these are all the flower blocks, which is the Asian flower, Alpine okay. flowers, yeah, yeah, which yeah. is on the show. Uh-huh. 
So I started off doing that. And again, it shows you the Asian foliage. Oh, wow, look. You know, so you could do little images. Mm -hmm. If you're doing card making, you could do a little piece of fabric yeah. and then put it into your cards. Mm -hmm. And are you okay to make and sell with all? Yeah, yeah, that yeah, definitely, yeah. That's what I love. I love doing all that. You can stitch into them as well. Mm -hmm. So basically all over prints. I mean, you know, design your own papers, really. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's traditional sort of like foulard, they call that, mm -hmm. in India. Okay. An Indian block printing. Yeah. So you've got little bits. These are my little bits of fabrics, uh -huh. just test pieces, really. Yeah. And you can make, you know, pictures, watercolours. Yeah, so you can it's actually so nice to actually kind that. of keep track of all of these in that yeah. book, isn't it? It's just showing you, yeah. you know, that's, a, that's the actual... Um, just how much rows. you can do as well. I do space them in between in case I sort of... And that's yeah. the tulip one. Again, wow. this is how I designed the tulips and mm -hmm. stuff. And I've got the original um, drawings with me as well. Yeah, perfect. And is that on the... Is that the same paper? Yeah, yeah this is this is actually the journals that I was selling on the last show, which right. I still sell. Yes, I'll bring yeah, them yeah. on the next show probably. Mm -hmm. But, um, yeah, it's exactly the same paper. Fabulous, isn't it? But I thought it'd be nice to have it loose yeah, this time around. Definitely. Yeah, and the fact that, of course, you can make your own then as well, can't you? So yeah. you, you've got the papers there, so you could literally make something like that yeah. if you wanted to. A lot of people multi-buying on this as well. Kay multi-buying, Susan multi-buying, Anne, Estelle, Elizabeth, well done yeah, to you, Yeah, this Jane. is so nice, honestly. Yeah. When it's dry, I'll show you how to tear bits into oh, that, okay, and then yeah. you can actually really do that. But I'm mm -hmm. going to just now do one of these bags. Okay, super. I'll do the little bindi blocks, I think, mm -hmm. as well, the Asian foliage ones. Yeah, now we haven't got many of those left at all. We will get them live for oh. you. These have been a bestseller, as we know. Um, so we'll come to your alpine florals first. Um, we think we've got like less than 10 chances available in these, oh. so they will go super, super quick. So do yeah. take advantage um, whilst you can. And you're actually getting eight in this as well. So it, it's a lot that you're actually going to get within this. All of them, of course, one inch... Um, um, each and you can just see that they're most beautiful beautiful images designs that we've got just there um, and and I love that you could almost have those like postcard stamps and things yeah. as well couldn't you they're really lovely because they actually there are filler in I call them <laughs> where actually if you've got a bit of a gap when you've block printed and you just want something there yes you know good idea. and again that stole had um, the daisy flower I think I've just put that in between as well mm -hmm. which looked really good yeah absolutely we with these did launch at 22.99 um, uh, we've got even lower because we've only got those last few chances that are available. So we're not going to go to 22 99 today. In fact, we're not even going to go to 19 99 Would you like final 10 chances to be able to get all of those today at £17.99? So 18, 18 pounds for you to be able to get all eight of those opportunities. And they really are. They're beautiful sizes, as you can sort of see. Uh, lovely images that we're getting to experience. They work so well with the rest of the collections as well. So take advantage of that price. We've also got as well the Asian foliage so I'll just get those live for you as well once again um, a bestseller so very limited on these we've got seven different stamps and you you can really I'd imagine with these kind of build up seams as well oh, yeah you? yeah that's the idea especially mm. with the meadow flower blocks you yeah. can actually then put them into sort of like in between and a bit like the stole at the end that I've just done mm -hmm. as well yeah, so I've just basically, what I thought I might do is show you one of the bigger blocks, the tulip blocks. Yeah, 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 that'd be brilliant. And show you that you don't need to link up the whole thing. Okay, yeah, yeah. You can do bits. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to literally do one tulip. Okay. So what I've done is I'm going to mix up some more paste mm -hmm. from my Intense block. And I'm only going to colour just one head on there, really. Mm -hmm. And these intense blocks, um, will they be available on other shows coming forward as well? Yeah, I think they're all, they're all on Soundtrack. I think they're, on, they're out of stock, I think, at the moment. But okay, yeah. Actually, I know um, Kat was trying to get them in. So yeah. She was having a little look. But I mean... I know we've got the pens available. On the yeah. Show, so. You can use the acrylic paints as well, which mm -hmm. I'll show you as well. It's the same sort of effect. So what I'm going to do is just plonk that down. And it's just come out like that, but mm -hmm. don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to show you another tip. Yeah. <laughs> so what we do is we can then go into, because they match the colours. Oh, perfect. You can actually then use, say, the matching colour. Yeah. And go back on the pencils and you just get a really good. Yes. So you're going to colour in. That's why I've got both sets, yeah, really. it's great, isn't it? You know, that's how I did the tote bag. And what I like about that is a bit of a texture on this as well, which is really nice. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. 
just great how the pencils can actually go onto fabric as well because yeah. you can kind of create anything you want then, can't you, with such precision? I mean, you can do it with fabric paints as well if mm. you wanted to as well. But I find with fabric paints, it does wa the water will actually make it spread. So yes. it may go over your lines. Mm -hmm. So that's why I tend to use these pencils. Yeah. But there is another little tip as well. Mm -hmm. Is when your water brush, I tend to put in not water, it's called Xantador oil. Oh, so okay. it's actually an artist oil. Yeah. And it's oil based, obviously. Yes. And what is. happens is you can wet it, but it doesn't spread. Mm -hmm. And it's really good because you don't get that staining, yeah. staining effect. Yeah. I think it's always those little tips you want to get from, from the shape. Yeah. So again, you can see the colour in this mm -hmm. already. And it just spreads up. So again, you can make loads of different pictures with this, just with, with one block. You could just have one tulip mm, head. Exactly. You could have a few together. Yeah. The Easter time, you always get these lovely tulips. Yes, you do, don't you? Um, £55.99, if you would like the permanent watercolour pencil tin, you're getting 24 of those as well, and it's available on Split Pay for you. You can take it home for £27.99 if you want to today. And again, it, because it's the intense blocks are matching yeah. the pencils, you can actually pick up that side of it as well mm -hmm. so you can make them two-tone yeah it's a lovely image the tulips isn't it I do I like this one's got all six different types of tulips mm -hmm. so if you look on there yeah I don't know the exact names no <laughs> I don't either <laughs> but they're actually this one is that one that's really pointed I think it's on the back there I've drawn um on um, yeah just that one yeah. there yeah and you can see the different tulips there there's different types yeah can see them there, all six of them. Yeah, they're just yeah, they're gorgeous, just aren't they? All the different shapes that we're seeing just there as well. It's beautiful. And I love as well that you could make, because it's tulips, which come in all different colours, you can make them kind of as bright or as muted as you want to yeah, as well, and like personalise them to yourself. Yeah, I mean, you can lift it off if you want to. You can sort of like put in mm -hmm. some, you know, sort of like what I'm doing now. I'm lifting yeah. it off, so it's going paler. So if you just thought, oh, I put too much on. That's yes. the thing about these. You must never put too much okay, on. Okay, so you don't need much. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's that. And then I'm going to... Mm -hmm. Might use... Yeah. Some of the... One of these or something just to oh, go yes. around there. Yeah, yeah, that would look nice. Chris has just sent in a question. Hello, Ooh. Chris. Good afternoon. Could you tell me which side do you iron on to set the colour? The actual, you iron it on top. On top. On the, on the, yeah. yeah. But I would put a piece of like greaseproof paper or mm -hmm. something just, yes. to sort, yeah, just in yeah, case yeah. your iron's marked or anything like that. Yeah, literally just on the top. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have the Cricut heat presses. Okay, and Sometimes yeah. I can use one of those as well. They're quite good. Yeah. So anything really with a bit of heat mm -hmm. there, you're fine. Yeah, they do. They really do. I just love that once you've created something and then it's done, isn't it? Once you've actually heat set it as well. Yeah. Whether I mean, you're gifting it, selling if you're it, using, actually yourself. using it to wash as well, you need to mm. sort of think about. So I love that because the way it sort of yeah. has a, you know, a bit of texture on that one. Uh -huh. And it leads round, doesn't it? It's kind of yeah, sweeping like almost. The primrose one is really nice as well mm. because um, again, you can just colour in different centres, which I'll actually yes. demonstrate how to yeah. do that. I'm going to use acrylic paint on the next ones. Okay, brilliant. Just to show you the different um, effects, really. This yeah. is using the intent blocks. And then I'm just literally going to draw. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Yeah, just to that's so gorgeous. So you've got something like sort of... Mm. That's fab. <laughs> and, and like you say, when you when you look at that and then you think about what you can see here. So it's up to you whether you're wanting to use one tulip, whether you want the whole design. Um, it is absolutely fabulous. And of course, when it comes to like a card making and things like that, we know how popular flowers are. And you could use as many or as, as few of these as you wanted to kind of create those those card scenes or or of course your bags or anything like that. So do take advantage. It's very, very popular. The tulip um, stamp that we've got just there. Uh, there's your code 
we've got the last few chances available, £20 for you to get something as well. There is, of course, handcrafted, handmade for you to be able to get this, um, for you to have all of those six different designs. And of course, it is just it's spectacular. But when you actually get this home, you can really see and sort of feel as well the, the way that this has been cut into this wood. It's, it's a big, big chunk that we've got there on this block. So you know that it's going to be something you're going to use and use and use and use and then keep it on display when you're not using it, I'd say, as well. Uh, Susan's just said, what fabric did you use for the scarf? So the scarf here. Um, that's a very a fine cotton lawn, I cotton. think that was. That actually is made in India as well. Ah, Again, okay. on the next shows, I probably will have these to sell. Oh, that's they amazing. Some. I love um, these. They're called yeah. cotton lawn. I think it is mm -hmm. a very fine cotton. But again, what I did was, so because it's so fine, always make sure you put something underneath so it doesn't yes. go through. Yeah. Um, you know, if you've sort of like folded it up, mm -hmm. basically make sure you're doing that. Yeah. Um, but otherwise than that, you know, it doesn't go through. It's lovely. You have it's just, just the other side. It's not really. No, you can see. No, exactly. Not come through there. And it's absolutely, it's just beautiful, isn't it? I mean, and it's, the, I think it's the fact that you can personalise something That's that you're actually nice. able to make. If you want to make it yourself, a friend, yeah. a family member, you're actually able to personalise this in any way. But yeah. all of these stamps and stamp sets just work and interlink so well with That's them all right. being those florals that we've got. Yeah, because basically they are a collection. This is why it's a limited collection. Mm -hmm. um, if you buy all of them, you won't see these again two months time that'll be it yes yeah 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 so, but yeah that's what i do so i'm on to the probably easter or after wow, easter yeah, okay. christmas soon yeah yeah <laughs> that's the thing that's how far ahead <laughs> we always are so, um, yeah. <laughs> and and the tulips were based wasn't they on an artist's um, yeah. work as well Polly Pinder, was um, it basically i had to get um uh, it was actually by search press right it's okay. one of those dover books where you get lots of illustrations yes yeah and yeah. there's an artist called Polly Pinder mm -hmm. in the 1970s yeah um, but I, I loved it so much because yeah, it just fabulous. fitted perfect for what I was doing. Mm. I actually asked permission from Search Press and they said, yes, please, yeah. as long as you mention her. And I have done, I've done it for yeah, instructions because yeah, yeah, yeah. tomorrow I'm on Sewing Street. Okay, right. And there's something yes. really exciting happening there mm -hmm. as well. Um, so, yeah, so I had to put it through the yeah. illustrations and the instructions. Yeah, so, yeah. it's fantastic, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and that's how, how limited we, we are. I mean, we've got less than 30 chances available for you to be able to get the tulip as well, uh, which is HM7932 um, that we've got there on that one as well. So big, big block design that we've got. But as we've just seen there from Maria, you can use single elements of this or, of course, use it all together as well. Now, we've got a couple of paintbrushes that are also available, um, which if you want to get these to kind of be working with this, you can do. You are going Going to get both of these um, today for, for seven pounds and ninety nine. So it's a duo that you've got. We're going lower, of course we are. Enough. Not even seven ninety nine. Um, so we are going to go right, right down as low as we can on these prices. And would you say that these are perfect to actually work these, with this medium? These are lovely because they're synthetic, mm -hmm. they're firm. So when you're actually working into fabric, you don't want them too soft. Yes, yeah, yeah. And um, also they hold the water really well. Mm -hmm. um, the flat brush is fantastic if you're sort of really stippling in or making yeah. marks. Uh huh. That's really, really good. But the round one I use a lot, especially when. Well, I was using one just now. You know, mm -hmm. on that. So, yeah, because yeah, yeah. you've almost got, you, you, obviously we know, uh, like you said, with flat brushes, but then you've also got that kind of precision, haven't you, with That's the other right. one? So it's really pointy. Yeah. yeah. So two different uses, £5 today, so £2.58 um, synthetic. So they're going to work perfectly, of course, with these block stamps that we have. And again, if you know anybody arty who wants a present, mm -hmm. that paper yeah. in the paintbrushes. Exactly. That's a nice, affordable present. For yeah, somebody. isn't it? Yeah, when you think under £15 yeah. pounds and you've got all of those 10 papers and you've got the brushes to go with them, people can start creating when they at home. Yeah. Right, so we're having a so look at this with the paint. I'm going to actually now put this on acrylic. Okay. So I'm mm -hmm. going to just show you what, how you can actually, your acrylics are quite good because yeah. they stay wet for longer. Okay. So yes. with the ink tents, I tend to use the smaller blocks mm -hmm. because you haven't got that. With <laughs> yeah. a big block, you, by the time you've got round, you're mm -hmm. going to be dry on this side. Yeah. So I tend to use just normal acrylics really because mm -hmm. it can be anything. But I know Meryl quite well from Parchment oh, Craft. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So I use a lot of her Parchment Craft acrylics. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you only need a tiny amount with these, and they've lasted me for ages. They're so intense as well, aren't they? The pigment in these. Yeah, and I have used them before, and she's allowed me to. And so, again, if yeah. you want some acrylics, I suggest buying them from Meryl's. Yeah, and I imagine they'll be on the brand shop if you go on to Parchment Craft Australia as well. Yeah. Yeah. So we basically, because we did a lot of um, stencils. I designed some stencils for her. Okay, perfect. So that's why we'd, we're doing that. Yeah. So basically, I've just got the cream there, which mm -hmm. is really nice. The cream's a good base. And then we're just going to put a little bit of, make it a nice pale pink. 
And what I'm going to do this time, I'm going mm -hmm. to use some sponges instead of using a paintbrush okay. as well. Mm -hmm. Again, anything really. Um, these daubers are good, which I use a lot of. Yes. So if you've got paper crafters, they've got all these, haven't yes, they? Yes, so daubers. It's another thing to use. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do is, I'm just going to do like the centre flowers. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to mix the colours together. Okay. So you've got like a different, you yeah. know, sort of like changes from light to dark. And you're literally step, stippling onto it. So some sections will be darker than others. And you'll know when it's, you can actually see if it's covered because again, they're all painted a light cream. Mm -hmm. So you'll know if you've got your color on there or not. Lovely. So this is just the center. I'm just going to give it a good firm press down. Mm -hmm. Another way to do it is actually put the paper on the top and then you can actually rub the yes. papers yeah, yeah, yeah. over that. So sometimes mm -hmm. I do that as well. Mm -hmm. But I just want it sort of like, you can see yeah. where it's all gradient and stuff. Mm -hmm. And I'll show you the other way just to show you how you can yeah. actually do it and do two different types of ways. So you get some really nice colours with this. Yeah, you do. Yeah. I did a show with Mabel actually just the other day and I think we, we were bringing these, these live. They're always very popular, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to put yellow in there. Yes. You know, any mix of colour really. Nice and bright. Really <laughs> nice. <laughs> I saw actually the first few daffodils yesterday you know when you start seeing oh, the first yeah. bits they're not out but you know when you see them just coming like the little buds in the green and I was like oh it's coming oh, no. spring is coming <laughs> well, I haven't seen any snowdrops this year yet. no I haven't you know either um I know there is some around because mm. I've seen pictures on National Trust okay yeah but, yeah, but um I haven't actually seen them visually <laughs> no I've not <laughs> usually it's them first yeah it? it is they... or crocuses I haven't seen any crocuses no which is weird mm. Is it because it's too wet, probably? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it could be. We've had a bit of a... You have to... Any weird garden, winter. Anyone that knows about the garden, have to ring in or tell us. Yeah. Because <laughs> we're not sure on that one. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to get back out in the garden. There we go, pop that. So this time round, I'm just going to show mm -hmm. you how the difference is of actually putting the paper on the top. Okay, yes. So literally, you're just putting your hand on there mm -hmm. and then feeling... Oh, yeah. Would you use like a brayer ever, sort of on it you as well? You can do, you can yeah. do, yeah. But sometimes I think if you're going like that, you might be risk of moving it. Um, so, yes. I'm not, you know, that's the only thing I think with a brayer I'd So be with careful. your fingers you can, yeah. yeah. More. Another thing I use is a jelly plate, oh, which I actually have yes. got with me as well, so I can show you that. Yeah. Um, what you can do is, is use the jelly plate, then put the block into the jelly plate, mm -hmm. and then you can have a relief, which is how I did that bag. Ah, okay. Like, yeah. Yeah. Lovely. So again, you'll get much more of a. Oh, that looks great. You know, it? but I quite mm. like the way they're doing the. Yeah, it depends what you're going for, doesn't it? Which which effect? They look a bit like high sins, like. That <laughs> yeah, they well, do. Which is quite nice. <laughs> yes. So you've got you know that way as well. Mm -hmm. Again, where I've actually got my finger on when I was embossing. Yeah. You can just see the relief yeah, of some yeah, of the yeah. leaves uh -huh. and around as well. It's really lovely, isn't it? It's really nice when you can just play around. Yeah, with that's effects. the thing. And when you look at that as well, what you've done, it looks totally different to this yeah. little bag that we've got here where you did the complete image with sort of different colours that we're seeing there as well. So it, it really is just about what you want to create yourself in terms of the primrose and the tulip. But they're big sizes, these block stamps that we've got there. Um, we are down to less than 30 chance on both of them. £20 today for something that is hand carved. So that workmanship has gone into it as well, um, which is just amazing. It's so much more special and they really are. They're big, you know, they're solid. You can feel the quality of these as well. So I'm really excited if you haven't used something like this before for you to get them home and have a little play with them as well. Different colour greens. Yeah, this time I thought we'll do the leaves yes, as well. Uh -huh. And then, you know, actually do the actual um, whole thing mm -hmm. still. And you need a lot more paint as well. With acrylic, I do find that you need a lot. Okay. But it's mm -hmm. funny enough with the ink tents. You don't. <laughs> hardly used yeah. any. But um, 
you know, it's what you've got at home really yeah, as exactly. well. You want mm -hmm. to have a real play. There's anyone that does illustrations or printmaking, that's really nice. You can use lipo ink okay. as well. Uh -huh. But with lipo ink, because there's actually these wood blocks are made, with, they've actually dipped in oil as well mm -hmm. to keep the actual um, wood, you know, sort of nice, yes, and sort yeah, of doesn't yeah. go brittle or anything. Um, so again, you can use oils to mm -hmm. clean it afterwards, which yeah. won't hurt the block. Oh, that's great. So anybody that's into their lipo printing, you know, illustrations yes, and things yeah, like yeah. that, you can actually use it for that which is nice. Mm -hmm. Get some more pink in there. If you are wanting some finger daubers to be able to do this as well, um, have a look on the web. I think we've got a few different brands who sell something like this Crafters Companion, I think Hunky Dory. Um, so you'd be able to get something similar if you're, you're thinking, I haven't got that at home and I want to do this when I get my, um, my, my, my stamp block home. So yeah, take advantage of those. They're really good, aren't they? they yes. Yeah. I mean, again, you know, it stops you getting dirty and stuff. I know, exactly. <laughs> They're actually really good for children as well. We always say the stamps are, those finger daubers are as well. Yeah. I'm just doing it quite quickly. Mm -hmm. It's a big block, so it needs inked up quite a bit. Yes. And again, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over with the paper. I'll use that side for a change, mm -hmm. I think. So then you'll see the whole thing. It's always like waiting for the unveil, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Worth the wait. Mm -hmm. Always. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice on fabric as well. I've got some fabric pre printed, which yeah. I'll show you how to use the um, pencils okay. the better. But that's basically oh, what it yeah. looks like Look there. It's just it, such a big stamp as well, isn't it? Yeah. So it covers a really big surface area. Yeah, and again, you can draw into it a bit more. Mm. Just leave it like that, like yeah. that piece that I did. This would be lovely if it's all over. Wouldn't it? You can make it into a wrapping paper yeah, or something. Yeah, definitely. Or a yeah. And obviously, you, you can snip into that or anything like that. You can cut around it. There's so many different ways that you could actually use this. Um, so just to give you a quick reminder, these are, we've got quite a lot of brand new things on the show today. So, of course, we've got the Primrose, which we've just been seeing being used just there. Big size. Six by six. Well done to Erica and Christine, Janice, new crafters, Susan, Anne, Lynn, uh, Kathleen almost there. It is a gorgeous image, and you can just see all of the different ways that, of course, you can use this by using the whole image, by using the separate images. It's totally, totally up to you. Uh, the tulips, also very, very popular. Brand new today. Another very, very large block stamp that we've got. Um, and I love that, you know, Maria picked out just one of those. If that's what you want to do, you can do that. Or you can create a real stunning focal image with that whole design that we have there it's it's absolutely fabulous every nuance of those tulips are there you know the way that, that all of those buds are opening up the flowers um, and then with the leaves that we've got as well once again 19 pounds 99 now if you'd like a set of three then we've got the three at the bottom which will work perfectly together but also they'll work gorgeously individually um, if that's what you're wanting as well so these are the meadow flowers very sort of happy images that we're seeing um, and if I show you some of these on fabric you can kind of see how they um, they will stamp out as well um, and of course you can add colors to them if you want to it's totally up to you we've also got the images on a little bag that we can see there um, and then you've got more that we can see here as well and all of those we're talking under 20 pounds for you to be able to get all three of those um, we also had a couple of sets of bestsellers. They've almost gone now. We are talking about the last couple of chances on each of these. And this is where you're getting the slightly smaller images, um, but you're getting a lot of them. <laughs> so you're actually about to get seven in this. This is your Alpine florals that we can see just there. So all seven of those. Um, they're just so pretty, aren't they? You can either have them all for yourself or you might want to gift a few of these out. Um, and you could build big scenes or you could have them as little postcard stamps. It's totally 
totally up to you. Add colour, do them black and white. Um, it is, they are just going to be real, real fabulous kind of additions to your collection. And such a great price to be able to get all of those for £17.99 as well. So you're looking at just over £2 per one. And these are still hand carved, hand crafted as well. Every single one individually done. Now, the second collection that I'm going to show you here, another bestseller. It launched and sold brilliantly. It sold out twice, £22.99. We've got it back today at a discount deal, but it's the last chance to see this, £17.99. That's for all eight of those. You've got that gorgeous leaf set that you can see. And, and we always want to ground things, don't we, in our images and our cards, everything like that. So this would be great if you wanted to create, you know, a meadow, you want to pop this around gates, you know, whatever you would sort of like, like to build up. Yeah. I think that's that's, that's a brilliant true. opportunity. Definitely, yeah. Probably one of the most used <laughs> stamp sets, I think, that, that you'll actually have. Uh, also talking um, about brand new, which we'll come back to in a second, is the papers. Eric has just said, though, what's the best way to clean the block? Um, I actually am just using normal water Fab, yeah. you know, with a nice sort of damp cloth, mm -hmm. really. It's nice and easy, um, isn't it? If you do find that, it, like, sometimes the paint can get in, if you're using acrylic especially, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. it can get into the grooves, a little fine toothbrush under a running uh, tab. okay. And just leave it to dry. Yeah. And that's it. That's all you need to do. That's all, yeah. So not 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 difficult to care for them. <laughs> no. Um, and you're just ripping the paper. I'm literally going to show you how yeah. it's lovely. Because when I've ripped it, you can you see all the rag, the actual mm -hmm. edging, how it's it's really gives that sort of hairiness all it does, the way around the it? edge there. And again, you can make that into a card. You could put that mm -hmm. onto a tar or a gift tag or something. Yeah. Just wanted to show you how easy the really paper is actually yeah. to manipulate as well with this. Yeah. I just love the edge, I really do. That you so I just that. love that sort of like yeah. spiky mm -hmm. edge there. Fabulous. So that's another. Brand new today, 10 sheets. £10, so a pound a sheet we're talking about, and this is for the Indian rag paper. Now, when you actually get this home and you get to feel it, it's fabulous. The texture, the thickness of this, you've, you've seen how, how well it actually works as well with these stamps. You know, you, you could make a sort of wall art with this. You might be wanting to make wrapping paper. You might be using this in your scrapbooks or your journals. It's totally up to you, but there's so, so much you can do with it. Um, lots and lots of you coming in and taking this. Most people multi-buying as well. I imagine it's because you're thinking, well, it's brand new. I don't want 10 sheets. I want at least 20. Um, really good good idea because it is the one-off postage and packaging and it's bigger than a4 as well which is really lovely oh, it's um, in between a4 and a5 yeah, a3, yeah rather yeah um so it's a good amount mm. and you can see how far that goes yeah it really does know, it doesn't does, it yeah. um a few of you have asked about the acrylic paints we, we can uh, yeah show you where to get those as well so if you are wanting those acrylic paints um you can there's two sets i think that are available currently with them so we've got the autumn set um that that you've got the chance to get um and we'll, we'll get a little picture for you to be able to see the colours that you can get there. I think that includes the yellow that we used um, a moment ago. Yeah, I think that's the bright pink. Yeah. The bright colours, I think they were. Yeah. They're the brights, I think, aren't they? Yeah. Those three. Um, so we've got we've got that there for you as well, which comes with a paintbrush. And then there's um, they sometimes come, yeah, in spring one that we can yeah, bring live to you. Yeah, if you think of the spring collection. Yeah, it works, doesn't spring, it? it? Kind of crosses yeah. over in terms of <laughs> in terms of what you'd want. Yeah, there we go. So if you want the colours that we've seen used on this show, then this would be the set that you want, the spring set. Um, you've got a white as well, which is great because it means you could sort of lighten colours. You've got the sponges that come with this as well as the paintbrush. Um, and what I always think is great with the paints. You can always mix them to create new colours if you, you want to do. as well. Yeah, if you want to. Um, actually, what you can do as well is really, really water them down, put them into spray bottles. Oh, yeah. And then spritz that. them, which is really lovely. Mm -hmm. um, again, you can do that with the Intense blocks as well. Yes, brilliant. So idea. you can actually um, make some crumbs with it. I mm -hmm. just sharpen it a bit. Yeah. Um, wet it and then you can spritz them. There's loads of things you can do with that. Yeah, super. Yeah. So basically what I've done is I've pre-printed it on mm -hmm. here in a grey. And I'm going to use the pencils just mm -hmm. to show you. Yeah, we've got a couple of minutes left. Just to show you, because I did that on the tote yeah, bag brilliant. there. I'm going to use the um, brushes as well. Mm -hmm. And again, I've got the Santador oil in yes, here, yeah, not yeah. water. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the yellow. Mm -hmm. Always make sure they're quite sharp yeah. as well. Always sharpen them up a bit. And again, you can keep the actual little bits there and again use those as water oh, so I just yes. spritz those yeah. and then you can have different colours from mm -hmm. that so what we're going to do is I'm um, going to do that nice yellow and red tulip mm -hmm. and you can see how nice they go onto the fabric mm, this is a nice fine cotton this is just a smooth cotton okay I do find the smoother fabrics are better yeah yeah if you want extra detail mm -hmm. but then again it's nice to have a texture like the bag like yes, it's done as yeah. well so 
and you only need a little bit. So if you actually just colour yeah. a small amount first, see how much paint there mm -hmm. is, and then go on to that. And then... I mean, they're just going to last ages, aren't they, those watercolour pencils? Because you're going to oh. use so little of them. I've had time. these for nearly two years. Have you? Wow, yeah. OK. And, that I've shows. Done, and I've done a lot of projects. Yeah, with yeah, yeah, of course. Well. Great, great value for money. Then. And when I do my embroidery or my freestyles, again, that's another thing you can do is your free motion stitching into mm -hmm. this as well. Mm -hmm. So again, if you do a tote bag, you can have free motion stitching onto yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. So you can see what I was saying about the Zanzador oil is literally drying. Mm -hmm. But it's not gone over any of the edges. No, very clever, isn't it's it? It's really, really good. And it picks up the actual colour really well. And the nice thing about once that's on there, mm. I'll use the next tone down. The next colour actually mm. goes on yeah, even more vibrant. Over. Wow. Because it's picking up that oil. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. It just works, doesn't it? So again, if you want some nice tones coming through. Mm -hmm. This is how I did the um, tote bag. Yes, so you've got that lovely texture on there yeah it'd be nice to see if anyone has done any block yeah definitely. from previous shows yes um, send in you some know, pictures. especially the christmas trees yeah. and, the, and, the, and the snowflake that did you say you're on sewing street tomorrow i'm did on sewing well? street tomorrow at nine o'clock nine o'clock and fabulous. i'm on for an hour and a half oh exciting got okay demonstration oh that's great <laughs> so yeah but it's something even more exciting mm -hmm. um I've actually, yeah, I'm not going to say nothing. No, I'm but tune in, it. nine o'clock yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, you will see. <laughs> Make sure you see it. Um, oh, thank you so much. It's been such a super, super show. The time I just disappears, believe. doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it just absolutely goes. Um, so tune in tomorrow, nine o'clock. It's our sister channel, Sewing Street, but it's on the exact same channel, so you don't need to turn over anything. It's just a little bit earlier than we start at one o'clock. So nine o'clock tomorrow. Um, there is lots of exciting stuff to come on there and a lot more to come on Hobby Maker in the future as well. Uh, loads of you are sitting with bits in your baskets make sure you're checking them out remember it doesn't matter how many times you want to check out in a day you still won't pay any more on that postage and packaging we will be back are we get are we gonna load should we load it in yeah okay do you know what i'm gonna do so many of you have been messaging in uh asking about the card the brand new card templates that sandra's bringing i what we'll do as soon as four o'clock hits, so you've literally got a minute and 20 seconds. So even if it's during the break, I'll pop it straight onto pre-order on the website for you at four o'clock. So you can actually get in before the show, which is the best way to do it. We know it's going to sell out. So take, it, take, take, take that chance, get involved, and we'll be back with Sandra in a moment. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm, and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobby Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobby Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? 
then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Registering for a Hobbymaker account on our website wouldn't be easier. Head over to hobbymaker.co.uk and click on register now. Type in your preferred email address, create a password of your choice and we just ask you for a few simple details. Click on create account and then away you go. Within your account setting you can view your order history, address and card details and items in your basket. Shopping made easy with Hobbymaker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Oh, how exciting is this? OK, so obviously... Right, 10% of the stock has gone. Um, it's literally been just launched in the break on our pre-order. So if you want to get involved with the playing cards, um, then it's there. It's on the website for you right now. I am so excited about this. Do you know what? Actually, we, I mean, we were looking at the samples earlier. Should I show a few of the samples like, straight away? Oh, things it's you can amazing. do with this is great. Because, of course, five different designs, mm -hmm. but you can mix and match all of them together. Yes. I mean, that's everything. So you've got different sizes mm -hmm. and sort of a, a bit of a giveaway as well. It's just, look just, at this. oh, look. Look at that. And of course, you've got this little cabbage. On I know. Side yeah, yeah, yeah. Just pop them in, in, use them. <laughs> oh, wow. They're, then, ju they're just so, it's so different. Oh, it's. And do you know what the great thing about this is you could actually take that design, mm -hmm. which is on the spade, and yeah. you can reproduce that design on the heart. Of course, you could. Yeah. So you've not just got like one design. No. You could mix them all together. And yeah. You could do a whole suite in the same design if you wanted mm -hmm. to. Absolutely. Or do them all separate. Oh, that is just beautiful. Just, just beautiful, isn't it? Just I mean, so you could good. go completely different if you yeah. want. Angie's uh, nice to get one to. in as well. Mm -hmm. and, uh, Absolutely. So you know, use the shapes to do what you want to do for them. Mm -hmm. People saying already, got the bundle, well done. Oh, I would have done the fun. same. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> 20%, OK, quarter of the stock's gone already. Yeah. Sorry, and... me, as you wait. <laughs> yeah, but, but you can it's... understand why. We would have... It's fab. Yeah, it's... We'd have been sitting here saying we've sold out, wouldn't we, if, if we oh, hadn't... Can you imagine doing a so. whole set of cards? You could... Oh, yeah. Oh, it's oh. just look amazing, wouldn't People it? are just going to love this as well, because I think it's yeah. so different. Yeah. But most people, I think, have grown up playing cards, you know, love playing cards. There's yeah. a lot of memories for me. I always think of my granddad, you yeah. know, and, and and that's what I love. But on top of that, the designs are just so, so magical. And, you know, when we were talking about them upstairs, I just love that, like you said, you can actually interlink these. You don't have to do the set designs. They can kind of no, move between each other. No, I've given you really five designs. Mm -hmm. So you can then decide which shape you yep. want to do and mm -hmm. you can reproduce it in any of those designs. So you can do a, a whole set of one or you can yes. mix and match them. Wow. And again, Step mm -hmm. by step. Yes, it's all there, forward. isn't it? Mm -hmm. All there. It's all all there. there. The stencils are there. Obviously, these are all coming to you today. So yes. you've got your stencils, as yeah. you can see, with your card shapes. But I do feel as well that because obviously like, you've got the hearts and things like that, you're going to be using these for separate things as well, aren't you? Because of that's one of the most are, used yeah. images. Of course you are. And Globally. We've given them you separate so mm -hmm. you could actually create the shapes. You know, you've got a yes. little corner punch. You yep. can draw the rectangles out and then you can actually corner punch them out. And you think, mm -hmm. well, OK, what about the numbers? We've given yes. you the numbers separately because you can choose or you can yeah, use your ace, your king, queen or your jack. Mm -hmm. And then you've got, of course, some shapes there that are smaller still. So yeah, you've I got know. so many variations yeah. for this. And yeah. I, I, I mean, yeah. I did a couple and I was like, I'm really excited about this. I need another two weeks to do more. <laughs> I need to do more. But, I need to do more. Yeah, and, we and then the backgrounds, over 100 have already gone, OK? And we hadn't even showed you what you were getting. Oh, these <laughs> so ones, yeah. Uh, you've got two Great. stencils here. One of them is nice and struck. I say it's structured, mm -hmm. but random. So you've got all the yes. four different bits in this one. Yeah. But 
the nice and structured. Mm. Whereas the other one, yeah. uh, we've given you four separates mm -hmm. yeah. on one. Just, which is so nice, you can it? use just hearts, just spades, mm -hmm. just clubs, just diamonds yeah. if you want to. So it's nice to have that separation. Definitely is, but of course it? the other one yeah. has got all of them mixed yeah. in. Which is great. So you're you've gonna, got, again, yeah. best of both mm -hmm. worlds. You can mix and match and do yes, what you want to do Yes, absolutely. Um, yeah, okay, so we have got more people looking at this than we have availability now. Oh, okay. So I have not demoed it yet. That's the point we're at. That is the bundle. What did you say? Sorry, Kat. Yeah. We might try and jiggle a bit of stuff yeah, around yeah. if that's all right with yeah. you, yeah? yeah. Um, so we have got the separates as well. Let me make these live for you because um, you might be thinking, I mean, I'm sure everyone just wants everything, but <laughs> if you want to get it. Now, if you want the main stencil set, which of course comes with, um, it's just amazing, it really is. So <laughs> It's different, isn't it, as well, having them all on, on separate pieces. Exactly. And, you know, I'm looking at all this. I'm still amazed by the price on this because obviously we know how costs have gone through the roof. Yeah, yeah, you're getting yeah. so, so much within this. Um, I just love it. And I, I think of like Alice in Wonderland, things like that as well. You know, oh, like the big cards all that sorts are of things. Lock it lane. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. I mean, you could make the look at that. This, the spade is a house. Yes. Yeah, yeah, in yeah. Lock it Lane, isn't it? So there's so yeah. many different things mm -hmm. that you could do with it. Susan's just sent a lovely message fun. saying, this has been a wonderful birthday today. Oh. Husband got me a new puppy and I've spent all my birthday money on Santangle. Oh, <laughs> Thank you, Sandra. happy birthday, Susan. Yeah, happy birthday, Susan. Yeah. How lovely. Oh. Suzanne got mine and I managed to use my Santangle badge. Good. Oh, brilliant. Good, brilliant. good, good. That was yeah, the Christmas yeah. Day badge, wasn't yeah, it? I've got mine on. You, you, you need a badge. I haven't got a badge. Oh, you need a badge. I've got, I'm oh. sure I've got one somewhere. Oh. It is. This is my first is. Untangle show since I've been back. Yes. Oh, thank you. I'd love that. Yeah. <laughs> and yes, here we go. Look, Alice said the playing cards would be a great set for Alice in Wonderland themes, which is what I said. Yeah, absolutely love it. I totally agree. Yeah, it yeah. really is brilliant. Um, okay, so $21.99 if you want the main stencil set. We then also have, of course, the background stencils. So if you want to get these. And I think these are so usable with this collection, but I just think they're so usable generally. I know. Could you imagine embossing this one? Oh, wow. And then putting a little yes. bit of gilding wax. Oh, over the top of it and just, just so good. black gold mm -hmm. and things like that yeah yeah yeah, yeah definitely even do you know masks i know we did masks I earlier i was literally thinking the same well thing. actually bringing all mm -hmm. this in to mix yeah. in with the yeah. masks yes yeah, you yeah, could yeah. have a playing card mask. yeah sorry you? so many ideas it's just, it's just exciting when <laughs> yeah, you see things like, like this like oh look leslie i see dobby has returned gone sleep too tired um tell him to get himself back to the office i know he's hanging know. out having a little nap he's instead. been rubbish leslie he's been rubbish mm. all morning look at him Let's yeah, Pauline's see. back on the show tomorrow with me. <laughs> you, you need to you need to be telling Pauline off for tiring him out. I, I think, know. Tomorrow, so. it, yes. Look, at, I just love he's got his little suitcase, not even yeah. unpacked. At least no. got his shoes on now, his little dobby. Honest, I don't think Pauline knew where he was half the time. No, so. no. But then did he know where she was? I mean, who knows? Yeah. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> oh, Carol. Oh, oh, um, hi, Sandra and everyone. Hi. Just ordered the playing cards. Oh. Can't wait. <laughs> oh, my now arm is out of plaster so I can tangle again. Oh, Carol. Carol. Carol, that's great news. Oh, I hope it's all better and yeah. feeling good. Uh, loads of messages coming through. We will get through as many as we can. Lynn, so happy I've got mine on my discount as well. Thank you Yay. so much. Lovely. Thanks for the great stencils. Um, okay, what we, we have only got, I think, less than 10 available on the bundle. We are just just try and <laughs> we are just going to move a bit of the, the stock around from the individuals and pop that into the bundle so yeah to keep you checking out and then we'll yeah just we'll get you there we'll sort there. it out right. one way or another let's have a little look shall well, we I've started drawing do? already yeah um okay. right. <laughs> so I've, I've, I've drawn around the outside yeah and I mean you'll normally do that in pen but we'll stick with mm -hmm. pens for that yeah, and yeah, I've drawn sure. around the outside here and I also come in on the inside because these are almost like little frames. Yes, yeah. Uh, if you're sort of familiar with the frame system that mm -hmm. we have, you'll know about these dots and that kind of thing. But as well as this, we've given you different heart yes, sort of yeah, sizes yeah, yeah. in the middle. Mm -hmm. Now you're like, okay, well, what are the circles? Circles are great because we do, we do a lot. We do flowers yeah. and things like that. Mm -hmm. So the circles on there just to sort of give you that little bit of a hint. Yeah. And then we've got two hearts here, like one here, one here. And you think, well, mm. like, they're a bit odd in an odd mm -hmm. place. Uh, they're not in an odd place. <laughs> they're there because they're trying to give you a little bit of a hint. So that's your first little bit. Yes. So then you can bring in your numbers or your letters. Mm -hmm. And so if I go for the A. Yep. There we go. And I put that in there. Mm -hmm. You see it sits Yes, forward. it fits perfectly. So we've left you it? just enough space. Yeah. Now I'm putting another A at the bottom here because as we know with playing cards mm -hmm. you tend to get half and half, don't you? But yeah. 
Uh, you, you can mix and match if you want. You can put whatever mm -hmm. numbers, whatever letters you want. Yes, yeah. You don't have to use the hearts, which is why we've had mm -hmm. them separately. Yeah, totally up to you. But this is where you would sort of start off. This okay. is the first bit, okay? Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to sort of join my little lines off there. And here, I'm going to come on in. I've moved my dots there. It's all right, because mm -hmm. I drew them first. And then let's put some little lines around here, okay? So I'm just working my way around the shape. And again, it's always about sort of splitting that space up. We do that ever such a lot, okay? And that gives me that. So far, so yes, good. Not has. done anything no. that nobody else can do. That can't do. So yeah. if I come in with pen, uh, what I'm going to do is take each of these sections. So I'll draw some a little bit around here. Mm -hmm. take it this way. And I'm going to draw a curve like this. See? Inside the section. Yeah, okay. To the other. Bring that in. So I'll do that all the way around. See, that mm -hmm. one goes point to point, yep. and I'm coming on the inside. Mm -hmm. Point to point on the inside. Point to point on the inside. You see? And I do that all the way along, mm -hmm. all the way around. Perfect. Even when I get to here, you think, oh, this is a bit tricky. Yes. I will yeah, yeah. still do the same okay. shape. Mm -hmm. Ignore the sort of... Um, shape as it comes around mm -hmm. do those two because it looks a bit weird without them. <laughs> okay uh -huh. and then on the other side i do the same but i do like a mirror image oh, so okay. it goes that way round. yeah yeah and then bringing it in afterwards mm -hmm. i would come in this way okay. so again aiming sort of for up here yeah put those in mm -hmm. okay now i would normally do this in pencil okay and you'll see why in a moment but so you can see the difference between yes, yeah. what I'm drawing here and the construction lines. I thought I'd do it in pen. Okay, I've got mm -hmm. one that I've moved on a little bit more anyway, so that's fine. So you see I'm getting these little crossings, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah. So then what I'd do, and again, I would do this in pencil. Okay. Um, first of all, let's put a little bit of a frame around that yeah. edge. So again, I use my stencil to mm -hmm. bring my frame round. So I'll just do that little bit. I'll do that all the way around. Yes, yeah, yeah. But I'm going to extend these lines. Okay. Okay, so this one, it's going this way, you see? Right, yeah. So I'm going to go this way. Ah, uh, okay, I see. And extend that one that way. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then let's take, uh, let's do a couple more of those. So I'd follow that one out. Mm -hmm. And I'm, ta I'm, I'm following it wherever it's going to take me. So this one, for example, I'll yep. just put my little frame in there, a little border. Mm -hmm. So this one look, is going to sort of take me down here. You see? Yes, yeah, yeah. And then like these, they're going to extend this way. Mm -hmm. So I'm actually creating oh, a sort of a, a frame, yeah. but it's going out of the frame. Mm -hmm. Look, it, it looks really unusual. That's See how it started to work. Yeah. Once I've done looks that. looks woven, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, kind of all integrated. Mm -hmm. And then these I could decide, see, if I did it in pencil, yeah. which one would go over, which one would go under. Yes, so you can get yeah. them sort of really interconnected. Mm -hmm. Yeah, amazing. And then the spaces here I would fill mm -hmm. with black ink. Okay. Yeah, and it looked like that. <gasps> Look at that, amazing. Yeah, so you see how they've all interconnected, all yeah. sort of gone mm -hmm. in together and that kind of thing. We have managed to um, get more stock of the bundle available for you. I know you're just waiting for that. So it's there now, it's available for you. And um, so we'll bring that back live. So if you're just waiting, then just let you know it's there. So, mm -hmm. okay, I'm going to use coloured pencils. Okay. Um, I could use watercolour, but I've got no water. Yeah. <laughs> you can get you some if you need But then again, I haven't asked for any. <laughs> Jimmy can Jimmy, always do anything. Could I have some water? Please? Not to drink, but to actually... Just to... Oh, <laughs> He's like, of course. <laughs> okay. But um, colour pencils. So what I could do here now, you could do this mm -hmm. in a uh, regular pencil if you yeah. want to. Or let's bring a little bit of colour in. You see where everywhere mm -hmm. that they go underneath mm -hmm. each other. Yeah. You see? Mm-hmm. Man. Bring a little bit more out. I'm obviously in a red mood today. Uh -huh, yeah. Imagine this for Valentine's. Oh, amazing, isn't it? Lovely, wouldn't it? Yeah. You see, just that little bit of colour in there. Mm -hmm. Just bring a bit of white. Yeah. Just add that bit in there. Mm -hmm. So you could, it so well, doesn't it? Yeah, you could really go in. But then in the middle, you've got all these spaces. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You could leave them, but why? It's no. tangling. Yeah, exactly. So Great here we go. Let's pick this up. one. I'll just put a bubble in. Mm hmm and then I'm going to do a top and a bottom, mm -hmm. side to side. Yeah. Okay. And then I'll split that in half as well. Mm -hmm. There we go. Amazing. And then if I come around each one, yeah. like so, mm -hmm. and I create this little oh, look. Look shape that. in there. 
So you're good. Thank you. Chewy, chewy. And slick. Mm -hmm. And slick. Amazing. That was perfect. So then I'd pick a, a few others. Now here, if you've got some lines you think, well, there's quite a large mm -hmm. space there, yeah. you could come in and add an extra one. Okay. If you wanted to. Mm -hmm. Or you could just draw it in as... Yeah. Right. See, but I've got to keep going now. You've, you've sort of started it. Yes. So you've yeah, got yeah. to yeah. follow it through. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it'd look a little odd, wouldn't it? Yeah. But again, it. using pencil, you could decide, you know, whether yeah. you were going to go in and out with that one. Mm -hmm. And again, let's pick this one here. So same thing. Mm -hmm. Slightly different shape to work in, but we're doing exactly the same thing. We're going in with our curves. Mm -hmm. We're creating Amazing. those lovely little flower designs. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's put a few little flicks in there. So good. So a couple of other things we can do here if we mm -hmm. want to. I mean that um, Jimmy's brought... Um, yeah, yeah, colour. got your water. Wood colour <laughs> pencils. Now this never ceases to amaze because, mm -hmm. I mean... Hang on, I'm just going to open Go on. the roll. Yeah, yeah. You've seen these? Yeah, I love this. <gasps> this is so good, isn't Are you it? Are ready? Uh-huh. Go on. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, they're just amazing. Yeah, they're so, so good. So let's, let's use a little bit of um, mm -hmm. red in it. So, you know, you could use mm -hmm. wh whatever sort of works for you if you wanted yeah. to, whether you want to sort of go with the watercolour or whether you wanted to go with colour pencil. Yeah, but it's great, nice to it? pick a few bits out, mm -hmm. isn't it? Absolutely. And the, the beauty, of course, we've mentioned before with using watercolours yeah. is uh, you can actually, once it's dry, you can go back over it with pens mm -hmm. and you can add more tangles to it. Yes, yeah, yeah. So here we go. A little bit of a... Very pretty. Let me pencil. Let me brush <laughs> So you can mm -hmm. see where that is um, bringing a bit of water. I mean, this is super smooth mm -hmm. paper, so watercolour is not the, always the best on it, but you can see where you yeah. can sort of mix and match and do two different things. Definitely. I would probably mm -hmm. watercolour all of this. Yes, yeah. Let yeah. it dry, but then the next thing you could do with this mm -hmm. is my background stencils. Okay. Mm -hmm. all right. Which is why I've not watercoloured that, because I'd have to let it dry. Yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, hang on. Mm -hmm. Go. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to stick with the hearts, just the heart yep. section there. And what I can actually do is come in and just add yeah. some hearts yep. inside that bit there. Uh -huh. Now, if you've got my stamps that I brought out Christmas Day, okay, uh, we brought them, I think, the last show. Mm -hmm. There's one stamp in there that says love. Oh, okay. And so it, it works fits in well. here. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Mm hmm so you could do yeah. look, a little bit to that, so and then nice. you could stamp the word love yes, yeah, down cool. there. You want to see how that would look? Yeah. You ready? You yeah, ready? go on. <laughs> oh, amazing. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, I just love so that. So what, what have I done here? Yeah, go on. You've seen how I've drawn the heart. Mm -hmm. Instead of using colour on the lines, I've used pencil and tortillon. Yes, yeah, yeah. I've used colour. Mm -hmm. some, for the flowers that yeah. I've added in. I've not like flowered everything, I've just added yeah, the odd yeah. one. Uh -huh. Then it's full-blown glitter. Yes, which I love. My hearts <laughs> and the number. Uh -huh. So the number could be something that you're, you know, represents you. It could yeah. be an anniversary number. Yeah, cool. Anything like that. Mm -hmm. And then look, there's our stamp that's yeah, been then the glittered. It's amazing. Then I've used the background. The hearts again, mm. look, are on the edge. Yeah, it brings it in, doesn't just it? It brings it all in. And then, of course, you you remember my stamps. I put my stamps okay. as a border down the side. Yeah. And that. Oh, I just love So if, that. I, if you could just pass me the club design out of the cards. Oh, the, the club, the club yeah. design, sorry. Just so I can show you, because this is this the one. pattern yeah. I used. There you go. There you go. So this is the pattern that you can see where we did the crosses. Look, yes. you see the crosses yeah, yeah. now. And then I extended all the lines mm -hmm. out, mm -hmm. but I've used that pattern. Yes. But I used the heart yeah. to do it instead. And that's what's so, so good that they all, you they all cross over. The two, they yeah, all yeah. cross over, so whatever you want to do with it, yeah. that's, that's how it works. Oh, it's it? just amazing. How lovely is that? I just love it, I really do. And Valentine's, here we go. <laughs> yeah, exactly, <laughs> we're ready. Um, we have obviously restocked this. I know Nadine, Alison, Wendy, Gwen, Davina, Karen, Robert, Deborah, John, Brenda. Uh, we've got weights on the phone lines as well. You've all managed to jump in and get that restock. Uh, about a third of the restock has already been allocated, so um, do be quick. I know that um, there's a lot of you with it in your baskets, so if you want that, do check out. Um, remember that you 
are getting um, for 27.49, you are getting everything, okay? So you're getting that fabulous, fabulous book that will just take you through all of the techniques. It gives you all of the instructions. It, it just, it's just so easy to follow, which is just so fantastic for you to create all five of those fabulous designs. So of course, you get all of those designs to be able to create the playing cards from the heart to the club that we've got there, the diamond, we've got the spade, and then you've got your separate one as well, which is what I think is brilliant, that you've got your separate numbers. Um, <laughs> yeah, not a word, cat. you know, <laughs> your Asian king, your queen, your jack. Um, and then you've got your, your hearts and um, obviously all of those, um, the club, the diamond, and the, um, the spade that we've got there as well. But then this is also coming with the backgrounds that you've seen just work so perfectly, where you can either get one that's very mixed of everything, or these bits, you've got the, the central kind of a lot of hearts together, a lot of diamonds together. These should all be over 35 pounds. You're getting all of it today for 27.49. And remember that you get to make all of these. And then if you want to, like Sandra just did, you can actually think, well, actually, I'm going to take that design, but I'm going to include this bit and kind of mix it's it up, mix it up completely. Then it's mm. your design, isn't it? Yeah. You've got quite a few to choose from in there. Exactly. So you, you pick the bits that you like. I yep. love that it looks a bit spacey. Yes. And yeah, that yeah. bottom edge there, it's almost like you've got that dimension, mm -hmm. almost a, a through the keyhole yes, it is. Yeah, yeah, kind yeah, of design as well. So you can mix it up with yeah. those sort of uh, stencils Absolutely. as well. They all just look so, so different, don't they? And then you can see that, that mix of all of those bits kind of coming together in that one. Um, and then it's nice to see what somebody else has done as well. Yep. So we've got that just there that you can see as well, which is so different to all the other it, ones. Well, it so, is, isn't it? You you've yeah. still got the numbers you've got yeah. the playing card shape mm. and the heart in there but you just just bring your own little bits and pieces exactly in and do your own thing yeah fantastic opportunity um so well done um a lot of you have sent pictures in during the two oh, shows yeah, yeah. thank you so much we'll just have a look at a few of those yeah. um so we've got susan here who has said um here are a few of my oh, recent sandangle oh, projects remember that one yeah they're, they're great aren't they yeah we, we yeah, absolutely we did that as a video on facebook actually oh, okay an extra one yeah There's so many things you can do with that stencil mm -hmm. we did an extra one but susan they're beautiful. Yeah, well done. How realistic are they? Yeah, they're fantastic. Oh. Uh, here's one um, from Fran. I love Sandra and her sandtangling. Please you. find a picture I've just finished. Oh, it's lovely. Wow. I've seen that on Facebook actually. Yeah, the and I'm actually going to demonstrate case. that next show. Oh, are you? I am. Oh, yeah. There we go, oh, yeah, Fran. So Tune in for it. I'll copy yours, Fran. <laughs> yeah. We'll just show your picture, Fran, and yeah, say we've we'll do done it. Yeah, yeah. Here's how it happened. Yeah. <laughs> um, this is made from the Locket Lane set. Oh, look at that. That's fabulous. Mm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Look at the bee at the front. I know, he's well, so cute. And the one it? sleeping on the floor, yeah, the grass yeah, yeah. at the back. Oh, such so so oh. amazing, isn't it? Such creativity so with that. Can, so many things you can yeah, do. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah it's lovely. Yeah. And then so different here from Alison. Here's my version yeah. of a project done this month's workshop on my diary cover. Oh, nice. That, yeah, diary. it's very three D. She's been mixing yeah. different bits and pieces up with that. Mm, it's fabulous, isn't it? Yeah, the dragon yeah, tail. Yeah, we did that in class. They didn't actually know what they're going to draw. Just okay. this paper and a few shapes, and they ended <laughs> up with that. So so good. <laughs> it's crazy. Um, another one from Jan. We'll just share this one as well on the Sang Tangle oh, board that we can Jan, see. Look at that. The dragon I drew over the weekend's not finished yet as I'll be colouring him and then working on the background. Your stencils and instructions are amazing, Sandra. Thank yeah, you for what everything you've drawn. You did. That's yeah. so good, Jan. Yeah. Oh, send it in when it's finished as yeah, well. So I want to see the colour added too because it looks what great like that. Go red? Yeah. Gonna go blue. I know, I'm like, just don't know, do we? We don't want, to, we don't want to influence no, now, do no, we? No, no, yeah, no, you choose. <laughs> if it was today, you'd be influenced by red. <laughs> That's what we so feel like. So I kind of a feel today. It might be it? because of my dress. I wonder think? if that, Could maybe. Be. It could be that, yeah, yeah there's, there's, I, don't I don't know. know. Or it could just be love. Um, <laughs> just a lot of love. Um, right, let me come across, because oh, there's a few others that yeah. we want to share with you as yeah. well. Yes, let's come to this. So the oh, no, artistic yeah. so I'm I can show you a little bit about this. Oh, yeah, go on then. Yeah. yeah. If you think, oh, drawing, not necessarily, mm -hmm. and I'm a little bit stuck, but I don't know where to start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These are brilliant. Mm -hmm. Because what I've actually done, gives you an about this book, tells you about it anyway. Mm. I've got a bit of Locket Lane in here. Oh, no. Nice. And what I do, okay. I give you some, some pictures that you can add to, so a little bit of colour in there. But yeah. I give you these shapes mm -hmm. that I've actually drawn. And this is drawn so from the, the, the frame shapes that okay. we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've, I've started you off almost. You yeah. see, I've started to tangle a bit mm -hmm. in there. And what you can do, you can pick elements just little bits nice. and you can try different patterns yeah now on some of them you see here mm -hmm. like i've given you instructions and i've shown you Brilliant. how i've added the mm -hmm. patterns in giving you some written as well yes, yeah, yeah. and then you can see there that's how it looks when that's finished yes but yeah. then i've given you a blank version uh -huh. as well yeah so you can sort of play around with it mm -hmm. and there's a few of those in here 
Hold on a second, I've got to find another. See that I've actually shown, but then yeah. you can take some of these elements mm -hmm. and use it in the others. Yeah. Of course, we've got tangly trails uh, with yeah. the dice on. Uh -huh. So you could actually roll the dice, pick the pattern, yeah, and then that's, that's how idea. you can create uh -huh. it. So you could do that. But um, I've got this one. I thought we'd, mm -hmm. we'd have a look at this yeah. one. Mm -hmm. And I'll do a little bit of uh, colouring and tangling because, of course, colouring is an important part of it as well. Yeah, definitely. We all like our colouring. So yeah. what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop a bit of paper okay. underneath there. I mean, you could actually move the whole thing yeah, out of the way. Good. Yeah, and Just have look, just the, the yeah, paper. Yeah, yeah. But there's nothing on the back, so you're not going to sort of lose no, ruin something what you're doing. Yeah. So you could colour this in the coloured pencils, the water colours, or I've mm -hmm. got some um, alcohol markers here. Okay. Alcohol yeah. markers, well, markers work brilliant. Okay. Absolutely brilliant on this. Yeah. So, um, yeah, and at the bottom mm -hmm. here, because this is made to fit on an 8x8 card. Yeah. So you've got space at the bottom that I would always suggest mm -hmm. you try your pens first. Okay. To make sure that you know. Look, I'm yes, getting reds yeah. again. It's mm -hmm. only because my sample is. <laughs> all right. So yeah. here we go. So I'm, I'm just trying them all. I love, I love the Copics because they've got that yeah. lovely brush. So I've got three colours there. Mm -hmm. Let's do, Let's go for a four. You see, one end's a chisel, look. Yes, one end's yeah, a brush. Yeah. So I've got four colours mm -hmm. there. Happy yeah, we did a great price on these the other day. Yeah. It was I know. a really good deal. I know. <laughs> got that set so I couldn't do it <laughs> so okay um if you're going to use alcohol markers on this mm -hmm. it works beautifully and it'll be nice and smooth but what I suggest you do is if you're going to tangle mm -hmm. color it with the alcohol markers first yeah. and then go over with your tangles okay, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah. because the the pens we use is sort of a bit alcohol based in it as yeah. well so yeah, they'll yeah. move yeah so you want to color first then tangle mm -hmm. if you're using colored pencils I would tangle then colour. Okay, yes. And if yeah, you're using yeah. watercolour, it don't matter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can go anywhere you yeah. like. There you are. So, okay, what I've, uh, mm -hmm. what I've done with this one is, let's go. Now, if you've never used alcohol markers yeah. before, I, I, I'm not here to sort of... No, it's good to know, isn't it? Done, yeah, yeah, it's true. Um, if you've never done it, start with a lighter colour. Yeah. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a quick level over the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Now, they will bleed. Okay. Uh, um, so if you put loads and loads on, it will move, but you don't, you don't need to worry about that, mm -hmm. see? And on the back, you are going to get an alley yeah. of it coming through. So what I've done then, I've put a base. I've started the alcohol mm -hmm. going, really. Yeah. So if I come in with a little bit of the darker one now, mm -hmm. okay, just little bits. Yeah. Then the next one down, go over the top with that. Mm -hmm. You see, because I'm not working purely on the uh, white paper, it's yeah. it's helping to blend because uh -huh. that yellow is already down there. Yeah, definitely. I always put yellow down if I'm doing a red anyway. Do you? Yeah. Yeah, always. Mm -hmm. It's a really good base. You see, I'm going over part mm -hmm. of the last colour yeah. and then over the sort of section I've got. Yeah. And again, I'm only working on one section at a time yeah. because the alcohol depends on where you are as well. So under studio lights, it's mm -hmm. going to go quicker. Yes. Yeah, yeah, You're going to lose your alcohol a lot yeah. quicker uh -huh. under lights. Yeah. So you've got to work a bit quicker. Mm -hmm. So you see, one at a time. I know it seems a bit of a, a time mm -hmm. thing, but you know, you, you're not in these to do little lots of it all no, at exactly. once. You're in mm -hmm. it to sort of enjoy the process. Yeah, yeah. See, so you've got that lovely blend going on. Mm -hmm. And then, if I find my pen, <laughs> it's like there it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, look, it's nice and smooth now. All done. Mm -hmm. So then I could come in with okay. my pen if I want to, and I could tangle away mm -hmm. over the top of it. Amazing and that works beautifully mm. if you're going to use your watercolor pencils on this it will mm -hmm. work but you don't want to put too much water on with them okay because it's not meant to take a lot of water mm -hmm. uh, but that's fine coloring pencils it looks amazing with so mm. that's that one if mm -hmm. i bring in my oh, I can't quite reach my reds. <laughs> if i bring in my reds again yeah. so if i do this section here look mm -hmm. again let's just bring in that lighter color and again you want to build up the colors okay Okay, so yeah. you don't want to be trying to put too much in all in one go. Mm. You want to build them up, mm -hmm. layer them, nice and gentle. And again, you, you get you get through this ever so quickly. Yeah. But it, it looks like I'm taking forever because I'm just doing one. But mm -hmm. it'll uh, mean that your pencils last longer. Yes, yeah, yeah. Because you're not pressing on so much. You'll yeah, keep the points. Like, just keep mm -hmm. turning them. You'll be fine. And you can sort of keep colouring them. But what I like to do with these, colour a little bit. You can use the tangly trails, roll the dice, mm -hmm. add a few tangles in. But then you want to make it into a card because that's what they're there for. Oh, you mm -hmm. can leave them in the book. Look at that. That's so lovely, yeah. isn't it? But yeah. um, remember the uh, the masquerade 
background stencil. Yes. Think, think that. Think cabochons. Yep, yep. Think this book. Think eight by eight card. Oh, I think they're all coming together. Look and here it that. is. Wow. That's amazing, yeah. isn't it? Mm -hmm. So yeah. brilliant. Yeah. From that to that. It's just brilliant. Just one out of the book. Mm -hmm. Yeah, super. Um, so you can see it is, it's an absolutely fabulous book. I mean, that's just one, like you said, but you've just got so, yeah. so much in there. So much inspiration, so many images, so many designs that you've got. Um, and all of this coming to you for 18.55 and such good quality as well, the paper that this actually comes on. Um, you just mentioned the tangly trails. So I'll just I know, quickly this bring this live. I know. I've not seen this before with your little dice. Have you not? No. Oh my God. Oh my God. Right, okay. This is oh, fun. To, yeah, have I got mine with <laughs> Now what I've done with my cards, because, yeah. Oh, let me explain it. I'll, I'll get those out. Okay. I'll, you've got your book there, yeah. and it's got nine pages where right. on every yeah. page you've mm -hmm. got 20 different patterns. Okay, yes. On the 10th page, it's blank, so you can fill your own oh, in. Oh, okay, you nice. You can photocopy it, yeah. so you can build up your library. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. You've also got some cards that come with it. So the cards yep. like this, which is on here, mm -hmm. and we've we've already given you, I think there's five cards, and they're numbered one to 20, yep. so you yep. can make your own little index cards. Okay. And then you've got the stencil at the top that you can mm -hmm. make more. More. So, many so yeah. what I do, and I've got two lots. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is you can do um, all the books. Uh, so I can okay. do book. I've got, there's book twelve. All the patterns out yeah, of book twelve. Yeah, yeah. And then uh, here we go. All the patterns out of book mm -hmm. eight. Yeah. Book nine. But then in here, look, I've actually done different coloured ones. Okay. And I've got. Oh, I've even foiled one. Oh yeah, yeah look, look, they are foiled. Look at this. But I've got look, the dragonfly stencil. All okay. the patterns out of the dragonfly yeah, stencil. Yeah. Yeah. Florals. Oh, so if I need something flowery, I can uh -huh. go to this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Roll the dice and it chooses. <gasps> now the thing with these is when oh, you've got so tangles, fun. you get so used to doing yeah. certain ones mm -hmm. and you use them all the time. Yes, I bet. So it's really hard to get off them and so do something it else. For you. So if you've got just realize how many numbers this dice has as well. Sides. I'm like, <laughs> it, it all matches, honestly. So if you sort of Brilliant. think, oh, I really don't know what to use, yeah, yeah. but you've got like, I've got my book 12 here uh -huh. and I've got my picture here. Yeah, yeah. I think, right, okay, you roll the dice. Go on then. So you've got what number? Six. Six. So number six. So you there go and do that. So I have oh, yes. to put that pattern. Uh huh. So here we go. That pattern, number six, has to go on here somewhere. Right. Brilliant. So it could be in here, it could be mm -hmm. out there. Yeah. So it would actually come. Uh, here and what it's actually doing is it's changing up your tangling okay. it's making you think a little bit more mm -hmm. it's yeah, encouraging definitely. you to do something a little bit different mm -hmm. so it's building your skills but it's also it's a little bit of fun yeah, it's it? very so fun isn't that it? wouldn't have necessarily been there unless you roll the dice uh -huh. that's it <laughs> but it's just so much fun it's so, just so much fun I, mean, I honestly think if my yeah. little boy saw this dice he would go like he'd go wild for this he'd be loving yeah. doing this I mean this. you could like, even start on a, just a you tile could, yeah. and you yeah. could look at those and you could create I mean so in the booklet fun. there's instructions well not instructions mm -hmm. as such but there's examples yes yeah, of yeah. what I've done so I've rolled the dice yeah. and then these are the, the, the sort of the tiles or the images I've created using whatever mm -hmm. I've rolled. I've even told you what numbers I've yes. rolled. Yeah, yeah, so if you wanted to create these same images, exactly. you could do that as well. Exactly, so you're getting something different and it really doesn't, it does not build your confidence. Yeah, definitely. You know, because you don't know what you're going no, to do. No, I, I love it. You don't it. know what the end result uh -huh. is. That's and great. it's all from the roll of a dice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Such good, super ex like you're playing exciting. a game while tangling. I mean, what so could be much better? Fun. I mean, yeah. I use them. I mean, they're all here in my yes. bag. Yeah, and yeah. You can tell they're... A little bit tatty around the edges, yeah. some of them, but uh, so absolutely a little bit of a. Um, 1965, and that's a great present for somebody, I have to say, as well. Oh, it's so much. A few of you have asked if we can bring the Copic pens live. Yes, we can. So if you want to um, you want to use them, then you can get them. Uh, we'll just bring the big set live to you, which is the big set of 36. That's the one you were uh, using, yeah, I think, yeah, wasn't it, anyway? Yeah, that one, yeah. Um, so it's got a bit of everything yeah. in it, actually. It's great a really mix of good colours, set. isn't it? Yeah, it's really, really good. good set. Um, so you've got them there. We'll get the price right down. They have been on at £207.99 before. We'll We'll take them significantly lower for you to 149.99 for you today and split pay will come in on those as well um, which means you can actually take them home for 29 pounds 99 if you want to because they're on a five-way split pay so it makes it as affordable as possible and they are they're just super duper quality um, and then well you can be Yes, that's a nice thing. So, so good, once, once you've brought the pens, mm. you, you just need yeah, refill. yeah, because certain colours you'll use more than others. Course, so you buy yes. the inks, yeah. and you re-ink them. Yeah. Better for the environment as well, isn't it? So. Yeah, and they're, they're really good. Yeah, <laughs> so, I wouldn't have them. I wouldn't have spent my money on them if they no, were good. No, really I good. think that's what we hear from everybody, and it's always 
yeah, good when you see other people sort of using different things, not just yeah. us saying it, it's actually seeing who uses it. So, right, what are we coming to next? Ovals. I stencil. thought we'd do ovals, yes. and I've, I'm going to mix it with the puzzles. Mm -hmm. because good idea. We yeah. talk about frames ever such a lot, and we have got um, a book mm. with them in later. Mm -hmm. But I think it's really nice that you see how I use them because yes. when you look, you think, well, it's just a no, it's just a frame. Mm -hmm. It's not just a frame. No. There's so many yeah. other things you can do with it. Mm -hmm. And of course, I'm going to mix the, the puzzles. Yes, with nice. It as well. Okay. So in here, you do get two sizes of puzzle. Yeah, these are great. Aren't That's they? macro tile size, okay. regular tile size. Uh -huh. So everything yep. works. Yes. So how how do we do it then? Because if we were just using this on its own, mm -hmm. looks great, but sometimes you want to switch it up. Yeah, a bit. definitely. So in comes my pencil and okay. my oval. So mm -hmm. when you first get one of these, you think, okay, loads of dots and lines. What's yeah, going yeah, on? Yeah. What I've actually done is I've given you every size oval about a centimetre difference okay. up from a two inch to an eight by eight mm -hmm. inch. Yep. So you can make cards with this. Yep, That's brilliant. the idea. So you might not want to use the whole outside. You might mm -hmm. think, well, I want to do a smaller version. Okay. So if I come in with that piece there, mm -hmm. that's my smaller version, but then I'm going to do a single frame. So I'm picking the line underneath. Mm -hmm. So I could choose if I wanted to have three, so I could have a really yep. thick frame or just one for a really fine mm -hmm. frame. And then I'm going to use the dots. Okay. The reason the dots are on every line is because the dots are no good up here if I'm only drawing it here. Yes, yeah, yeah. But you only need to draw one row of dots. Okay. So you don't need all of them. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm doing the dots that's in between my line. And again, yeah. you, you don't have to put the pointed in the middle because these will join up anyway. Okay. So you can see now, there's my frame. So you can do it to suit whatever card yeah, or whatever great, picture you're working sizes. on. Yeah. And then I'm going to join the lines so we've mm -hmm. got everything sort of contained and again yeah. you do this in pencil you do mm. it lightly because you're not going to necessarily keep all those shapes in afterwards yes okay? yeah, yeah depends on what you're going to do with it mm -hmm. okay and then the dots how do the dots work what you're going to do is each one's going to go to the center point okay uh -huh. all right so you could do it with a straight edge or you could do it by eye yeah so all that one is going to go to that one okay mm -hmm. and then this one here it's going to go cross look uh, into that one. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then this one, mm -hmm. cross. Yeah. Now, every single one of my frame shapes works in the same way. Okay. And you saw again earlier with the heart that we did. Yeah. It's a very similar thing. It's got the dots, it's got the frames around mm -hmm. it. Yeah. So you see how it all sort of comes in yeah, together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, if you think that those spaces are a little bit too wide, mm -hmm. you can split them in half. Oh, of course, yeah. So you could go smaller if mm -hmm. you wanted to. Well, that gives me a bit of a frame shape. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So let's have a look. I'm just going to put a little mark sort of in the middle of each, yeah. like so. Now, on the instructions, because, of course, everything that I do, in the, apart from background mm -hmm. stencils, comes with instructions. Yeah. So here, I'm sh I'll show you how to create this one yes, and yeah. how to create... This one, so mm -hmm. it's a little bit more like a mandala. Yeah. So there's your instructions. Amazing. And it shows you, it takes you through again every single step, all the patterns I've used. Mm -hmm. But once you've done one, you'll be yeah. doing your own thing. Tag yes. the trails yeah, comes yeah. in again, doesn't it? Yeah, of course. You can do that. So let's have mm -hmm. a look here. I'm going to put a curved line here. Yeah. And one that side. See? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that would go all the way around. Okay. And what I usually do is I'd probably do that line first. Mm hmm. Now, this is where you need a bit of focus because yeah. if you're talking at the same time, you might end up doing a different <laughs> pattern and then come around and do this side. Mm -hmm. And again, if you want to do it straight with pencil mm -hmm. or straight in with pen, it's up to you. Yeah, so I've got yeah. this kind of a shape yeah, going great, on. Yeah. Let's do the same on the bottom. Let's have a look. So I'm going to go, let's create that point again. Mm -hmm. Because see, I don't particularly need that mark anymore because yeah. I think I'm doing it by eye. I've probably got the shape. Mm -hmm. Works all right, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks great. So it's giving me something a bit different. I've yeah, got the yeah. structure, and I know when I get to the end, I'm not going to have one no, bigger or left. smaller yeah, yeah. or left or yeah. not sure. I mean, I do that all the way around, of yeah. course. Okay, so that's sort of where that goes. Mm -hmm. So where does the puzzle fit in? Well, we've yeah. got something in the middle now. We've got okay. space. Yes. So I could bring my puzzle in. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter which way. Yeah. And I can put some shapes in. So again, let's do this in pencil. And draw some in. I'm mm -hmm. only going to draw though inside the frame here. Okay. So it's sort of going underneath. Yeah. Kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you could even, uh, you could emboss these. They look nice mm, and emboss. They look amazing. And I think on my sample there I used a bit of the shrink plastic. Yeah, that's really cool. Shrunk it down. I'll just show you that where the shrink plastic 
has been used there on these little puzzle pieces. Isn't that great? It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah, it's really great. Look, there's shrink plastic and obviously the other puzzle pieces that you've got there. This is a really cute. Today you achieve the impossible. I'd use, really use nice. the bigger one for that. If you're going to use shrink plastic, mm -hmm. use the bigger one because yeah. otherwise you wouldn't see it. <laughs> so I'm, I'm a, a, a great mm -hmm. believer of not, not sticking within a frame. Yes, I yeah. like things to come out of the frame. Mm -hmm. So down this bottom edge here, I'm going to choose which shapes I want. Let's put that one in. And I'm going to sort of bring it so it's coming out a little bit at the bottom there. Yes, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's have a look at what we've got there. That kind of thing. Mm -hmm. That's well. So my, pens, my, my puzzle pieces, I have got to shape them. So yeah. they're sort of now separate. Mm -hmm. But, you know, you can, you can choose which way around to do that. You can go square, you can go yeah, round. Yeah. And again, it's all about you've, you've got something to work with, a mm -hmm. bit of structure, but then you're creating your own thing. Yes, yeah, so yeah. So there's yeah. My, my little sort of pattern. So yeah. my frame here, I perhaps wouldn't, fill all of that mm -hmm. in because this is coming out of it yeah yeah so let's put this in pen okay because that's what i would do next and that's where we are with Perfect. this bit of pen there yeah. so there's my puzzles my frame mm -hmm. around the outside so let's add a little bit to it mm -hmm. so in the in this here it's nice because they're sort mm -hmm. of solid let's yeah. let's sort of we are limited on the puzzle stencil, yeah, just to let frame. people know. We've got less than 20 chances available on this. Um, lots and lots of you looking at it. It's, it's a fabulous, fabulous one, isn't it? And that is where you're going to get those two stencils and, of course, your booklet as well. OK. So, see, what I've done here, yeah. I've drawn a frame. But if I actually thicken up mm -hmm. this side yeah. and a little bit round there, mm -hmm. a little bit round there. So, again, I'm, I'm doing this quite quickly. Yeah. But you take your time with it. See, it looks like it's going through now. Mm -hmm. Let's do another one. So let's pick this one here. So see, it's sort of yeah, drawing a yeah, little yeah. shape on the inside. Mm -hmm. These will be great as well. Like, you know, we were talking about Valentine's Day earlier, you know, to yeah. put initials on or on oh, wedding absolutely. cards and snipping into them. There's so much you could do of with this puzzle, you, couldn't you? You could just have the odd one or two just little brilliant. puzzle pieces Lovely. and things like that. So you see, there's that. But then what I could do, let's put um, a design, because this is quite sort of at the front, Yeah, it? it feels like it's popping out, doesn't so it? So let's put, let's make it happen even more. Kay. Let's put a grid on it. Now, when we did our little mask, no, it wasn't the mask, mm -hmm. we did the scarab beetle, didn't we? And we yes. did this kind of a design on it. Mm -hmm. But again, you know, you could roll the dice. Yes, yeah, yeah, of course you think, could. Okay, what's going to go on there? And then let's put some little sort of uh, mm -hmm. squares in there. So this one is definitely a solid puzzle piece. Yeah. And it's sitting at the front there. Mm -hmm where it's sort of going to be sort of pride mm -hmm. of place. And then we can decide what we're going to do with the others. Of course, these ones, they're coming out, so they've mm. got to be thickened up a little bit. Yeah. Okay, to there. Mm -hmm. Same with that one. And that one. So you see, we're starting to get a bit of dimension. Yeah, there. definitely. I would probably bring my pencil and torch on in as well, and mm -hmm. add a little bit. But you see how it's starting to look a bit more 3D. Yeah. Does. But the great thing about this is because we've got a couple here, actually, I'm going to mm -hmm. do that one as well, where we've got these little frames going on. Yeah. There we go. Around there. Did you know it's National Puzzle Day today? Is it, do you know what? I knew Best that all just along. Told us. You did, you did, didn't you? Not really. Yeah, that's why you brought it today. <laughs> you just know it's National no, Puzzle there Day. You go. <laughs> uh, so the nice thing about this now is you say, right, OK, um, I'm going to bring mm -hmm. let's have a, look, a bit of a... Um, curve in here this is yeah. where we can start getting quite organic and how it goes in and out and around okay. and it starts to build dimension yeah yeah so i've got one in there let's sort of take one up here mm -hmm. and have some um, leaves in there yeah so you you have got yeah. instructions mm -hmm. on how i actually created here we go look this one yeah. at the front yes, so it yeah, does yeah. show you how you yeah. can do this i'm I'm just playing with a few shapes so you get the idea yeah. of it and to what's going on and, and how we work so things lovely, together. So let's bring another one in there. So, you know, we've got some that are actually up in the front, some that are coming behind. So let's bring um, some flowers in here. So again, mm -hmm. we sort of did flowers with the tree earlier. Yes. So we can uh, mix them. So instead of doing four this time, I can do six, bringing those in. And uh, working it from sort of inside and outside and around and behind, it's mm -hmm. starting to sort of really bring on that uh, three-dimensional feel about it. Because it does, doesn't it? It's going in and out and behind and that kind of thing. Let's put some little stems on there. So little lines, some more little leaves, which we've already done. Mm -hmm. 
there again nothing too tricky yeah and then coming to the outside here mm -hmm. let's have a look see we did this earlier didn't we with again with the yes. masks, yeah, bubbles yeah. but instead of doing three this time we're mm -hmm. going to do four okay you see one there one there mm -hmm. one there one there another one that's so good one there one there mm -hmm. and then what if we put some lines in this one yeah and this one and of course, I'd do this all the way around. I yeah, wouldn't just do course. a few on, yeah, but yeah. You see how that works? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one, I, I love doing this one. It's like an infinity figure <laughs> of eight. Brilliant. Yeah. And the quicker you go, mm -hmm. the trickier it gets. A bit like a tongue twister. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then uh, <laughs> let's put a little shape in there. Mm -hmm. And put another little line around it. And uh, let's put some little loops in. See, start yeah. in the middle. Yeah, 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 definitely. Oh, see, I've done this before, you tell. <laughs> no, you haven't, have you? Let's just do another one of those, just because I like them. There you go. There you go. Loop. Amazing. And around. You see how it starts to build up ever so Isn't quickly? It? So yeah, what, lovely I mean, once you've done it, a bit of colour in there, yeah, and yeah. I think a really nice thing that we don't always think about doing with these is we've got a little stencil. Mm -hmm. Yes. So again, they would emboss beautifully yeah. if you wanted to. Um, but why not use it to create a bit of background? Yeah, of course you can. Yeah. So I'm not going to sort of use, um, again, all of it. Just going to use a few little bits. I have got one finished, which is why I'm only doing little bits of it. But it's sort of kind of nice that it all works together. Yeah, and it's nice seeing how it's building up before you see that final sample. Isn't yeah, it? so I'm trying to cover every element and yeah, every little yeah, yeah. aspect before uh, uh -huh. I show you the final piece. Because when you look at the final piece, hopefully now you look at them and you think, oh, I can do, yeah, I, I can know do how that. to do that. Yeah. So you see you've got those lovely tiny little pieces yeah, yeah. coming around. Mm -hmm. And of course you'd have a bit of shading in the back here, a little bit yes. of colour on certain things. Mm -hmm. And that, you know, you'd be making up a card. Are you ready? Yes, go on. Da -da. So amazing. Look at that. Yeah. So good. Yeah. You see the little puzzle pieces around. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. My oval frame, those little flowers mm -hmm. we've just done. I feel like you want to touch it because I feel like that's been stuck going, on. Yeah, you it does. It looks it's actually 3D. flat. Yeah. So perfect for in the post because it's completely yes, flat. Yes, exactly. Uh -huh. Of course, little cabochon. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, I've, I've sort of got carried away with my cabochons. Yeah, this I is probably it. why we don't have them on their own. Yeah, because I've used, used them all. Them all. <laughs> um, but they're, they're real good fun. They so are. you can mix and match them with your other dyes, yes. with your stamps. Yeah, 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 definitely. With your whatever you want to do it with. But actually that image is worth... Yeah, isn't it's it? worth it all. It's priceless, isn't it? Because it's totally unique. Yeah, it's great. You're uh, never going to see another one like No, that. exactly. We've got, I think, less than 10 chances left you now with it. that puzzle stencil, so if you want to get that. So fun. Um, and it would it would go really well with the wooden puzzle, wouldn't it, if you wanted to stick a little piece on it, or anything it is, like that yeah, as well? Absolutely, yeah. We have brought you the wooden puzzle back because I know mm -hmm. last time we didn't bring many. Um, okay. Uh, you all you all like them because, of course, draw you draw on it yes, and I've given you instructions you on how to do that. We don't take mm -hmm. it out of the packet because we can't get it back in. Oh, should I not take it out? I was just about to take it out. Good job. You said that. I'd literally open it. It'd have been like, out, Yeah, it's fine. It? It's fine. Um, I mean, look. <laughs> I'd have been like, oh, you'd have been like, oh, no. Yeah, you're, you're putting it back in. <laughs> Pardon? You're I'm, putting it back in. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to get it out. Don't you worry. It's, it's, it's um, a macro size. It's a frame. Yes, but you can see the sizes, you can't you? That you've got just and I think perfect, the, yeah. the beauty of this is you mm. can actually, you can draw on both sides. Yes. So yeah, you yeah, can yeah. create one image on one side. Mm -hmm. One image on the other, and then Brilliant. mix it all together, yeah. and you don't know which one. So it's like a double. That's so good. Look, you can just if I do that, you can see yeah, the sizes of them without me actually taking it out and not getting it back in. You just you'll never get it back in the bag. And that's the best way to do it, yeah, then, isn't yeah. it? It's got a nice little little sort of frame around it as well. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Which nice. you can see it's got the extra. And bit of course, as the well. instructions for how I've done it on the mm -hmm. front as well. So I've yeah. not left you uh, with perfect. That. But yeah, we are here both sides. Yeah, so very, yeah, very limited. On both sides. <laughs> the tire boards. Nine pounds eighty for you to be able to get all of that. No, but say you can draw all over that, and that'll be a fabulous yeah. extra. Just wanted to squeeze yeah. that we're in. Dice for out, you. we've had puzzles out. <laughs> yes, it's been chaos. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, we've had a question from Sue. Uh, Hi, Sue. Could you clarify the stencil offers, please? Yeah, of course. Um, which which one? Sorry, the. Oh, cards. Yeah, of course. Um, absolutely. Um, so we've got the, the two options with the cards. So you can either get um, the playing cards where you can get, obviously, this. So you've got all of the booklet that this comes with, all of the instructions, everything like that. And then it also comes with these. And I'll show you which stencils it comes with. So you've got all five of the images, of course, that you can create. So all five of those projects. Um, so one of each of these. And then on top of that, you will also get, which I love that it's separate, 
separate list, which you can then kind of work yeah. with these as well, um, as well as all of the instructions. That's 21.99. You then, if you want the background stencils, you will get both of these, which is great because you've got the mix and then you've got like the more devoted areas yeah, to each yeah. one, haven't you, as well? They're £12.49 if you want to, oh no, lower, sorry, 10 99 for you to be able to get these. Um, so a brilliant deal on that. But I know that most people are thinking we want all of it, which is exactly how I would be. Um, so if you want all of it, then we have got an extra discount and you can see the projects and the pieces that you can actually create from this as well if you put it all together or of course, if you follow the sort of step-by-step -step instructions that are within this as well. Um, as I say, we have um, restocked this, but two thirds of the stock of the restock um, have already gone as well. So you do need to be super duper quick if you want to take advantage of this as well. Uh, if there's anything else, Sue, if, if that wasn't answering your question, please do let me know. We've got 10 minutes left, so it'd be lovely. Um, if uh, Hopefully that has answered it, but if not, just, just, just ask if it was a different one that you wanted to know. Hiya, Dave, I can see you there, Hello. creeping in. Hello, ladies. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? Afternoon. Right. Yes, good. <laughs> You're keeping the seat warm for me for later. Yeah, 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 yeah. exactly. Right. <laughs> <laughs> like, absolutely. I just wanted to pop in to let you know what we've got coming up between mm -hmm. five and eight tonight. It's going to be a busy evening, great evening mm -hmm. to two hours of uh, Fantastic Crafters Companion with the lovely Debbie, who I've not seen for ages. We've got the Mojito Mini, uh, sorry, Midi Gem, mm -hmm. Gemini Machine coming up at five. Uh, also, we've got the Cosmic Collection, which I've not seen until today. It's amazing. Lovely, isn't nice. it? And we We've got our final offer from mm -hmm. the guys in Frankfurt, the terrace Ooh, offer, exciting. just before six o'clock. Okay. One item slashed in price until midnight tonight, okay. all while stocks last. Oh, and amazing. then after that, we're back together. We're back together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With a kind of round up of the day. Yeah, right? yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Lovely yeah. show. Bits isn't of everything. Yeah. yeah. It's going to be great. Be all right, I'll see you at five yeah. live. We'll see you in a few minutes. minutes. Yeah. Right, <laughs> okay, take care. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, super, super show um, that you have got, I said, all the way till eight o'clock. Should we quickly show the eye while we've got time? Do you want, you want to, yeah. to just, do you want me to just give it? I'm just going to say I just want to really quickly just give you a look at the masquerade. I don't even know if we've got any of these left, but I just wanted to show you because we did say we would look for extra sample and we found it, didn't we? Oh, it's there, yeah, we found it, then we lost it. So then we lost it again, but here we go. So if you do manage to get the masquerade, obviously this is what we were looking for in the earlier show and we can't not show it because it's just so amazing yeah, and you yeah. are going to learn how yeah. to do that and eight steps and oh, i threw it in three eight minutes steps yeah did it in three minutes and look at that eyes are so difficult to do and yet you've yeah. got that all brand new today but of course you are getting all of these images um, that you can actually create so all five of Upside these down. No, in. Is that upside down now? The other one was upside down, wasn't it? Yeah. It doesn't really matter, does it? You know, either way. Just making sure you were on it. Can you tell that I don't know my right and left or up and down? Honestly, I'm just... <laughs> coordination is not my strong point. Oh, <laughs> so all five of those, of course, you can get. We've sold so many of these, but they are still available. Um, I think the last one was very, very limited. Yeah, we've got less than 20 available. Remember, it comes with two of the background uh, stencils. It then comes, of course, with that fabulous book. You've got all of that large stencil numbers are on the back for you to be able to know how to follow all the instructions and all five of those that we can see as well so just wanted to just had to show that because I mean, we knew we'd found it after talking about it, it so we much we were gonna... yeah we we're like we have to find it <laughs> so um the the what you just want to quickly mention tangly illusions then oh the card. Tangly, is that all right fab samples of this yes yeah. um so somebody's just asked can we get this on of course we can we always can yeah, follow your lead yeah. that's never a problem at all um so you've got tangly illusions and you know once again that you are going to get everything that you will need with this so there's all of your stencils yeah. now these are they're all instructions drawn on paper mm -hmm. and well, it's all great, about the they? shading so that's Oh, look at that one. Wow. It's like, that one's uh, the first one, the introduction to Tangly Illusions, because I think they're all a bit mixed up, but I'll go through it with you. <laughs> uh, yeah, so this one, again, mm -hmm. if you tilt it backwards. That way, yeah. Look at that. Oh, wow, yeah. isn't that good? And that is completely flat. <gasps> yeah, yeah. Completely you, flat. You almost paper. can't believe yeah. that, can you? Absolutely. So. Oh, my. oh, look at this it's as well. Like, yeah, <gasps> and again, tilt it. Look at that. Oh. And it's all in the shading. Of course, you yeah. can draw it. But it's all you feel like you're going shading. into the actual thing. Well, almost, yeah, don't yeah. you, with that one? So this is the uh, original. Brilliant. And then it? again, tilt it backwards and that you oh, get wow. that movement in that's, it. Yeah, that's fabulous. So there's Tangly Illusions and Tangly yeah. Illusions 2. Both of them on the website yeah. for you. This, um, as this well. is Tangly Illusions This two. is Tangly Illusions 2, this one. Well, so if you turn oh. it side to side. Oh, my. I'm walking into it. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. It's just brilliant, isn't it? 
Don't look back. Very, don't very look. straightforward to draw. It's just okay. knowing where to put the yeah, lines. Yeah, absolutely. You know I mean? So all the uh, all the instructions come with this as yeah. well. Again, but we just wanted to make both of those available for you, um, just for the people who were asking about it. I've got about five minutes left. Right. Looking at yeah. the diamond. I thought the I'll, I'll do the diamond. Yeah. I'll show you uh, the middle bit of yes, the diamond. Yes, yeah, yeah, super. Uh, because mm -hmm. it, it looks really three dimensional, okay. and so uh, first thing you would do is I'm, I'm just going to draw the middle bit. Here we go. So drawing that and again it shows that if you wanted to you could use that as a shape all on its own right mm -hmm. if you wanted uh, you've got so many different sizes and that's what we wanted to sort yeah of, yeah so here we go so there's my shape and I'm doing this straight in pen okay so this is the okay. center yeah we'll show you the sample afterwards so you see what, what mm -hmm. I'm talking about of course. so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to create a line top to bottom mm -hmm. and then I'm going to do another line across there okay okay I'm doing it with a straight edge this time. Okay. Yeah, so yeah, then yeah. I'm going to gauge halfway mm -hmm. and gauge halfway again. You see? And then again, halfway. Now you can mm -hmm. see through the stencil. Mm. So it, it doesn't, you know, you oh, never mm -hmm. see it. You can actually see through it. Or you could put little marks to start yeah, with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And again. And see, now I've got this one's bigger than yes, the others. Yes, than the others, yeah. So Just let's do another again. one. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then if you, if you dare, <laughs> do it again. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Do it again. This is why we use fine liners. This is where they come into their own because you can get lots of detail in small spaces. Okay. I love you don't need a ruler or anything. Though. You just use your just, uh, stencil yeah, as well. Just <laughs> the edge of the stencil, that's what it's for, especially if you want to do, you know, curved lines. It's, mm -hmm. you know, and that kind of thing on the edge. But, um, this is a nice one because you'll sort of see a little bit of an illusion coming in here. Mm, absolutely. So lots and lots of lines. That's all yeah, I've done, yeah, lots yeah. and lots of lines. Okay. So if I bring my pencil in, mm -hmm. I'm going to add some. And again, look, I'm not colouring in, I'm mm -hmm. applying it. Okay. So I'm really going for it. All right? I want it quite dark. And you could, you could do this like I've done on the instructions mm. or actually on the the actual card, I've done yeah. this in uh, coloured pencils. Uh -huh. So this is where my darkest colour would go. See, S scribble a bit in the yes, middle. Yes, yeah, yeah. You see already where it's coming. Mm -hmm. So if I bring my tortillon in, what I want to do is, see I'm going in, in with swirls? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what that's doing is it's sort of dislodging that graphite and it's pulling it mm -hmm. in towards the middle. Tortians are just so great. They're just so, amazing, aren't they? Such a, a little extra, yeah. but they just really add yeah. something different. You can't don't do they? it without. No, you really no, no, can't no. do it without. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. So that one. Okay. The idea is I don't want to go too close into the middle. Mm. I'm just going to rub that bit out on the edge, mm -hmm. and then here, I'm going to pull it out. Okay. See, back and forth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back and forth. But again, I don't want them to meet. I mm. want to leave a highlight in the middle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Around there. Now, again, I'm doing this very quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's just break it. Because we're telly, aren't we? <laughs> You've always only yeah. got the time. <laughs> and then if I just bring my pen back in, mm. and I'm just going to add some more black into the middle there, okay. sort of following where the lines are. You're not going to get them all. Fab. Yeah. Yeah? Mm hmm Let's just bring a little bit more to there. Now, if you wanted it even darker, which is where the illusions come in, mm -hmm. then you would go in with black pencil. Okay. But let's just bring a little bit in outside as well. Yeah. And if you want to show the... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Diamond. So I've there done. Obviously, the original is in color, but that shows you mm, where you can get that three yeah. dimension. And shows how in. how you actually. That's yeah, it. And then that's the that. one in color. It's fantastic, isn't it? Wow, well, it has yeah. been so, so popular. So if you do want to get the final opportunities on the playing cards, then do get involved right now. Make sure that you are checking out your basket. That, the Masquerade, been super popular as the brand new collections, as is everything else as well. Um, and brilliant prices, once again. Just remember all of this you can create. Um, and I know loads of you have been waiting for this, to get the background stencils, to get all those stencils as well. So thank you, as always. Thank it's been you. so it's been lovely to see you yeah, again. <laughs> and I'm so glad I've introduced you to that dice. Oh, I, I know. It's a bit addictive. It really is. I'm excited <laughs> by that. Yeah.
Um, Where's it gone? <laughs> in my pocket. Um, it's just there. I haven't stolen it really. Um, so do stick with us all the way till eight. Obviously, um, you've got a two hours special now with Crafters Companion. Um, we've got some brilliant bits there. And then, of course, you're going to be back seven till eight yeah, yeah. as well. So you've got lots of different bits in that show and you'll be able to see any of these bits. If there's anything left, that's the only question, but we'll see. Um, there'll be something, won't they? Um, I'll be back tomorrow, same time, same place, one o'clock. We've got uh, some great shows from Hunky Dory tomorrow. Also, it can be quite a treat. I've actually got Dave on with me tomorrow for Carnation Crafts. So it'll be the first time that we've actually ever yeah. been together because yeah. you're always separate. So that's going to be lovely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's crafting. He's crafting, He's crafting yeah. that crafting man of the year. <laughs> so, yeah, so do join us from one o'clock tomorrow. But stay where you are. Debbie and Dave are up next. Registering for a Hobbymaker account on our website couldn't be easier. Head over to hobbymaker.co.uk and click on Register Now. Type in your preferred email address, create a password of your choice, and we just ask you for a few simple details. Click on Create Account and then away you go. Within your account setting, you can view your order history, address and card details and items in your basket. Shopping made easy with Hobbymaker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app.
Hi, uh, good afternoon. Thank you, Sherilyn. She'll be back, I think, tomorrow, actually. Yes, she will be, because we're together at 2 o'clock for Carnation. Uh, right, I'm back with you through until 8 o'clock this evening at Hobby Maker with some amazing shows. We've got a two-hour show with the lovely Debbie and Crafter's Companion. Uh, hello, my love. Hello. Again. It's been too long. I know. Uh, do you know, I said that. We weren't together loads before Christmas, and then I haven't seen you since. I know. So it's really nice to be together. Good to have you back. <laughs> Thank you. Now, um, some of the highlights to look forward to between now and eight, then, we've actually got uh, the Cosmic Collection, which I absolutely love. If you love things astrological and space, all that sort of thing, you're going to love that collection coming up a bit later on. First time I've seen it was today. Uh, we've also got some other deals going on here in front of us. You can see lots and lots of good deals going on, including the brand new exclusive Gemini Midi, no less, in this brand new colour. And then after that, we've got rounding off our day, a lovely hour of kind of uh, recapping some of the highlights of Santangle with Sandra at seven o'clock this evening. So I hope you're going to stick with us right the way through if you possibly can. Right. First things for all. Oh, and don't forget, we have our last live offer from the boys in Frankfurt. <laughs> yes, the boys are back in town in Frankfurt. The last night tonight, we're going to be joining them connection permitting, uh, at five to six with an announcement about one product that you can buy from Crafters Companion at a reduced price just for today, until midnight tonight. Okay, so that's going to be just before six o'clock this evening. Don't miss out on that. We have some amazing deals. Whether it's um, uh, drinking juice deals that they wake up the next morning and think, what did we do yesterday? Um, but no, no, some amazing offers that you're not going to want to miss. I mean, we've saved you £100 on a machine. We saved you £20 on some pens yesterday. What are we going to save you tonight with that deal live from Frankfurt just before six? OK, Debs, now the Gemini MIDI is a firm favourite machine for so many people. It is. It's our uh, manual machine. It's the biggest manual machine we do. Um, so our MIDI is part of that Gemini family. Yeah. Um, now, it's not the electronic, nope. so it is simplicity without electricity because it really is the most simplest, easiest machine to use. But because it's got the word Gemini in front of it, means it's got all the power that you can possibly get into a manual machine. I, I love what you said then, simplicity without the electricity. That, that's my TV hubster, Mr. Mosby, oh, yeah, who yeah, yeah. gave us that one. Nigel's extended it with craftability, craftability portability, accessibility, and everything else, other ability with it. You know what Nigel's like. Yeah, yeah. But this is a simple, easy to use machine. It's great for anybody, Dave, just starting out into the world of die cutting. We all know that electronic die cutting machines come with a bigger price tag. We mm -hmm. all know that. Um, that's just down to the, you know, for everything that's in there. These are nice, achievable machines for anybody who's starting into there into the world of die cutting but also for you that have been die cutting for a long time yep. a great one to have because of that portable nature because of the power of the gemini that you come to know and expect from our brand um this one and i'm going to put it through its pace as i'll show you all the amazing things i launched this this color um a week last friday it was you went nuts this for it. is exclusive to us even crafters companion themselves have not got this color this is called mojito now tv and lenses and light Lights can do funny things. This is not yellow. <laughs> this is the best way I can describe it. If you're thinking, oh, it looks a bit yellow in the studio, it's like a pistachio. But we're that's calling, a good one. That, yeah. is, that is the colour, isn't it? Yeah, I it's like, like that a, a one, lovely yeah. lime green without being too bright. It's just gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. It's now, fresh, it's fruity and zesty. It's just fabulous. Like yourself. Yeah, Debbie. thank you very much, Dave. Now, if you want the machine, normally it would be $69.99. Oh, look, it's $69.99. And it's on two split pays as well. But we're giving you an extra freebie, an extra free gift. You're going to get your Baroque fantastic embossing folder, and you're also going to get your border die there as well, the Elegant Lace border die included at no charge. They are bonuses, absolutely free bonuses. And remember, when something launches, you don't expect it to be on an offer. You expect to pay full price for it for a good few months before any offer comes along. So to get those two items absolutely free, it's fantastic. No interest and no fee split pay as well, okay? It's, what I love about it is, it can be the only die cutting machine you have and need because mm. it's got a lovely large mouth. It's got the Gemini guarantee of pressure, so you know it's gonna do a great job. You can do so much with it, you really, really can, but you don't have to plug it in. You're not restricted as to where the plug socket is. You haven't got to worry about if you're taking it on a caravan journey or a motorhome journey or taking it to a hotel, is there gonna be a plug point nearby? You don't need to worry about that. And you know, that's the thing. That's a great point because when I, um, I've lived, lived in and out of hotels- Me too. For the last five years that I've been on the, uh, the TV side of things. Um, and to take an electronic die cutting machine, A, 
heavy, hefty. I'm not lugging one of those things around with me into no. a, an into hotel room. The midi is the perfect one for me, that portability. And I know for a fact, and you put a, a great point there, um, the size of the mouth. It's a nine by six inch platform. Big mouth. Six inches the mouth, that's a big mouth. It's bigger than mine. Almost. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but it really is um, a great platform size for you to be able to get the majority of the dies and bossing folders that you already own and then what are going to be coming down the line in future. And not just for Crafters Companion products. We're talking people like Unky Dory with the dies. We're talking people like Carnation Crafts who do things. Everybody who comes here to the channel, they're, they're non exclusive. And all the other dies that you've got from all the other companies, we're not stupid. We know mm -hmm. crafters get from wherever they want to get. But you can be guaranteed for a manual machine, it's a fantastic. And I'll, I'll show you because I'm, I am going to show you exactly what this machine can do in terms of a manual machine. Great colour, exclusive colour. And I know, I did a Facebook Live last night, Dave, and people said to me, it looks lemon like a lemon sorbet. It's not lemon. It's not, it's not lemon. No. It's that beautiful lime green. When you get it in your hands, you will see just how gorgeous it is. Do you know, the big deal for me about this is not only the quality of it and how brilliant the mechanics of it are and everything else, but it's the simplicity of the plates. Absolutely. I, lots of people, myself included, get you really know, confused about it, what plates to use for what. You've banged that nail right in there, Dave, because it, see, it was, I think it was the expression I was looking for, nail on the head. <laughs> I think that was the expression I was looking for, but never engaged. They never engage. Let me just tell you, that is exactly it. And this is why that lovely little Ben Mosby of mine says, simplicity without the electricity, everything to do with a 2D embossing folder, you are just going to use your plastic shim. Anything else in terms of die cutting are going to go into your plastic folder. I want you to think about this folder as being two plates put together, nothing else needed. Right. But they're hinged. Right. So they've got a hinge fold in that end. Um, if you do a Debbie, and I have brought one or two in the past, let me tell you, don't worry, you just put them together. You don't need to worry about it because that is everywhere where you're going to put your dies. Four cutting plates as well. You think it's just a, a one cutting plate, but you've got a cut in, a cut in, and then you flip and reverse all the way through. So floor, four cutting services. Literally. And I'll tell you something else, 3D embossing folder. As I said when I first launched this one, this exclusive colour, blows your mind because you don't need anything. You simply put your 3D folder through the mouth of the machine and I'm going to show you exactly that in a few moments. It down. does not get any simpler. If you want simple but effective and you want a lovely good sized mouth for all those dies that you've got at home and your, uh, of course, your embossing folders, 2D and 3D, this is the machine for you. And it's also one of the most affordable machines out there as well at 69.99. And you're going to get about 15 to 20 pounds worth of extras with the yes. 2D embossing folder yeah. and that beautiful intricate lace border die as well included at no charge. Already in and checked out. Joyce in Dorset, Alison in Middlesex, Linda in County Durham, Samantha in North Yorkshire's in, Debbie in Lancashire's in as well. Now, before we get onto the demo, I know you want to see how easy it is to use. We've also got an extra spare folder. Now, it may well be that you've already got a MIDI and you need to change. I mean, these are consumables. You oh, yeah, will oh, yeah. need to change these with yeah, time. absolutely. And yeah. I'm going to tell you why you need an extra one when I, when I come to the multimedia dies why you need an extra one. Okay, yeah. 8 99 we've got them in stock. Sometimes they're not available, but they are at the moment, GE2036. If you just want to have another one in standby, so you've always got a spare, add that to your order or just buy this on its own if you want to. GE2036, 8 99 This is for the MIDI. And we've also got an extra purple plastic shim available for you as well. Now, this is exactly the same as the clear shim that, that you comes get with, your with the machine, yeah. uh, but it's purple. It, and again, it is. It's, like, it's a consumable part of it. It's for your 2D embossing, um, folders and at some point you will need to replace so please do make sure you get one while we've got it at that great price make sure you grab hold of one now this when it came on the other day flew so if you've already got a midi in a different color maybe the white one or whatever and you're thinking i need an extra uh, shim then there you go it's only four pounds and 99 pence for a spare one of these the one that you'll get with the machine is clear but it's exactly the same will do the same job but this is it in purple four pounds 99 qt2056 but back to the machine if you fancy that maybe you want to go for both of those as well as the machine so you've got a spare of each that's something that you might want to do but the machine itself exclusive to us at hobby maker you won't find it in any crafters companion stores nowhere else you won't find it on their channel or anything like that it's been made just for you just for us and it is 69.99 and you probably heard mm -hmm. that wasn't me it wasn't debbie no it's my little sucker cups it, yeah it was the sucker yeah. cups on the bottom of the machine 
That's what they're called. Sucker cup. They're yeah. sniggering in my ear. That is what they're called, little sucker cups. Can I just... Do you know I can hear, I can hear you all. Um, the four strongest suckers in the business, that's what these are. Um, I've had machines in the past, manual machines, where you've had to anchor it down with your arm wrestling dave will probably vouch for me when you've said yep. you've seen them and mm -hmm. um, these are super powerful sucker cups strong they are little strong. suckers that's what they are they are and literally can i just tell you as well it is light and portable but still sniggering light and portable look at that color oh my god i'm in so much in love with this color uh, light left-handed right-handed it doesn't matter if you're right-handed like me you'll just turn it to make it comfortable with yourself if you're left-handed like michelle you'll turn it around make it comfortable to yourself what you will do though is attach it now it's very simple when i say attach it any surface it could be a glass surface a worktop counter anything you want and all you do is put the pressure down onto the top for those suckers mm -hmm. to grab hold of your um your platform now they are super strong I and I, when strong. i say wobble you can wobble that as well um i know nigel stuck his head under debbie the other day and i'm like you don't want to be doing that under miss fisher let us know you <laughs> she's, she's more clumsy than me uh, but they really are strong now when you want to remove it when you want to take it around you know places with you all you do is gently rock it forward or backwards and you can hear and do you know what i love about it dave you probably know what I mean, but do you know some suckers you've got to lick? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those you don't. You, these you don't. I'm so sorry. I bet it's true. You have to wet them. Mm -hmm. you ha and I know, I, I, I've done it myself. You don't have to do it with this. This is super, super strong and it isn't going anywhere. Now, let me talk about the simplicity factor. You're going to get an in instruction booklet into this, Dave, but can I tell you? Go on. You're only going to look at one page. That one. that one. That's all you need. That's all you need. The rest is all in the different languages. I mean, why, it could why, not be any simpler. Why make life more difficult for yourself? Exactly. There is a system like this and a great machine like this that is simplicity itself. You can't go wrong with it. You Absolutely. Really you've even got a little note section on the other side, Dave, so that, you know, for things that you're not sure of your platform, you can write it down. But again, you've got that little user guide. It's a three-step si system, and I promise you, super, super easy to Debbie, use. Debbie, I've just got to let everyone know 10% of the stock is already gone, and that's within the first 10 minutes of the show this is a limited production run it's not been produced in its thousands for lots of other outlets and lots of other stores or whatever this is for us and us and for you alone so when it's gone that will be it when the stock of this that crafters companion have actually uh, commissioned for us has gone we can't get any more we've got two hours with debbie through until seven o'clock not just on this lots of other things in the show as well but that stock could well go before uh, seven o'clock this evening so if you know it's what you want maybe you've got um uh i don't know a, a, a voucher maybe you've got a, a hobby maker a gift card from Christmas and you haven't used it yet and that's what you want to put the money towards feel free to just give us a call on the free phone number 0800 001 4433 or order on the website which is hobbymaker.co.uk uh, and if you want to call the call centre to sort out your sp uh, split pay they will do that for you as well or you can also do that on the website or the app just tick that you want split pay VD2043 is the product code okay and it's a free phone number even from a mobile the guys are upstairs above our heads absolutely so let me show you just how easy easy is to work this now i'm going to use the dies that you are going to be getting let, let, let me just tell you normally midi machines 69.99 we retail them all over the country yeah. all over the world to be fair this is a global machine um and i promise when i say this the 99 percent of your dies that you own and your embossed folders will fit through here yep. apart from obviously your large one and we're talking your deep dish dies um however um it could not get any simpler to use and I will tell you, those freebies, $69.99, you go into a shop, you don't get freebies with it. You no. buy the machine at that price. Yeah. So to get two freebies with it as well, I just think it's fabulous. Get your, get your crafting journey on, onto the uh, right start. Now, all you're going to do with your folder is you're going to open it up. You're going to put your cardstock down. You're going to place your die over to the top, close your folder up and run it through the mouth of the machine. I can do that. And honestly, when I say anybody can do this, Anybody can do this. Now, let me ask you, yes. is it easy to turn the yes, handle? Yes, it is, is yes. It? You will feel with different dies, different kinds of pressures because depending on the die, now this is quite an intricate die, Dave, but when I open that up, and I'm just going to remove that from my die cut piece, where's my scissors? Let me grab my scissors because it's a lovely edgeable, this, mm -hmm. Dave. I, I love this die. Uh, but just to show you the power of that machine, one pass of the machine, and I didn't rewind it. You can rewind it. Mm -hmm. You can bring it back on itself as well. But if I just give that a little flick, oh, have that. a little look. We are talking all of that. And apart from, get rid, just to show you again, look at the incredible detail that and you have got you on that die. Cut through there, 
with one pass of the machine. And dies don't get much more intricate than that. No, so that's a really good test to yeah. the pressure that this machine will deliver without any power, no batteries, no plug. It's just basically turning the handle and it's a, a really, really smooth, very, very comfortable action. You don't have to put too much no, effort into it or anything absolutely. like that. No, you don't, absolutely. And also we'll tell you is, you saw me just die cut into this side. Then when I come to cut another one, I'll move to this side. Okay, then even. when you want to change it up again, turn it over, cut in, and then again, run and repeat that. If you're getting used to that habit, then I can promise you, your plates will last you a while. And I say plates, your fold will last you mm -hmm. a while. Um, but the other thing that I want to tell you is, whenever you're placing a die in, and this is just for me to give you a little tip, because I've done it, and I want to just share with you my knowledge, um, don't put your right to the top of your inch. Right. If you put it right to the top, you're putting pressure at the very top of there and the damage could be done with the way you snap your inches. Right. So just bear that in mind. So just bring it down a little bit, but look at the size of that die. That's a large die. Yeah. This is a nine inch platform here by that six inch mouth opening. But that, to get that die cut in one pass of the machine, for me is absolutely phenomenal. Now, very wisely, a lot of you are actually going for the extra folder. Okay, now bearing in mind, this is one of the consumable elements. Obviously the plastic shim is consumable, so is this. You will need to have a spare one in the future. Uh, 8 99 and 20% of the stock of this, this is exclusively for the MIDI machine, okay, which is why it's on there, so you won't get them confused with other plates you may have got for other machines that you may own. £8.99, 20% gone, it's on the, that side, there we are. Uh, 6 2, what was it, 6 2, I can't read the number. GE 2036, GE 2036 if you want that, okay, so that's the folder, and if you want the extra shim, in purple, same job as the clear one, but it it's is. just a different colour. That's it's all. exactly that's that. available at four ninety nine. Uh, yeah, it's exactly the same. So this is what you're getting in your uh, machine. This is your plastic folder. Now, just so that we clear this up, you don't run any dies through that. There's no way for it to. So you use your folder for the dies. This is for your two D embossing folder. And again. You're getting a free one in this mm -hmm. one. Yeah. So I thought, why not? Let's let's use it. So I'm going to pop that in now. I've put some cardstock in the middle of my embossing folder, and this could not get any simpler because all you're going to do now, Dave, is you're going to sit it onto the top of that plastic folder, and you're going to pop that through to the mouth of your machine, wind that through, and that is it. I just Seriously. love the simplicity of it. Yeah, uh, honestly, when I say it, it's, it's speedy as well, uh, but look at your beautiful embossing detail. There's no Absolutely scratching your head gorgeous. thinking, do I use that? Do I use that? Do I, oh. do I take that plate away? It's just simplicity itself. The first page of the booklet is all you need to look at to see exactly what plates you need to do what. And it couldn't be any, it, this is the simplest machine of all, I think. And it really is. And it gets even simpler. 3D embossing folders. You don't need anything. This is just, honestly, first time I remember, I remember launching the original MIDI with Leanne and I was like, what? You're not gonna put anything with it? And she was like, nope. And you literally pop your, now I've got one of my favorites here, Dave. Um, and I've got a 3D embossing folder with some nice Centura Pearl sandwiched into me uh, folder. And all you do is pop the folder into the mouth of your machine. And a 3D folder is slightly thicker than a 2D folder, so yep. you don't need the depth, plastic shim. Depth, dimension, sculpture, and everything else that you're getting with a 3D. Um, trust me, I've done it wrong way around. <laughs> but you'll, you'll get the gist. Um, but how gorgeous is that 3D embossing folder? And even on oh, the wow. deboss side, you can see just how incredible that is. Edge to edge technology with this one as well. Um, and seriously, it's, it's just an incredible machine, but it really is super, super simple. Now, have you got any questions? If you have, please do take advantage of Debbie's expertise and message in. You can do that via our website or via the app. It just says contact the studio, send a message. Ellie, who's sitting next door, actually, I haven't introduced you to the crew yet. Oh, no, I um, Okay, we've got Ellie and we've got Adam. Ellie's okay. in there. There she it's is, producer right, extraordinaire. Dave. There's Adam, director. <laughs> And Cap from the earlier shifts, he's still there as well. So yeah, send in a message, Ellie will see it, she'll put it through onto the screen and we can answer any questions. And in the studio, we've got Levi on camera too. There he is. Jimmy's around somewhere as well, our floor manager. And of course, Debbie and myself. Okay, loads of you checking out your baskets. A quick reminder of the deal, if you just got in, five o'clock's a funny hour, isn't it? Because lots of people are traveling, lots of people have just got home, putting the dinner on or whatever. Um, now, maybe you've just got paid. Maybe you got paid on Friday and you're thinking, okay, I can afford something now that January is almost <laughs> gone. Uh, here we go. You get the machine in this exclusive color. This is Mojito. If it looks yellow on your screen, I can assure you it is not. It's another word for it would be pistachio or lime green, that sort of color. It's a very, very beautiful, very classy color. And anywhere else, a machine, whether it's white or any other color, would be $69.99 on its own without any extra goodies. And this is exclusive to us. You can 
get with us today that 2D wonderful frame embossing folder and that intricate lace border die as well. Uh, worth about 15 to 20 pounds between the two things. You're getting it for 69.99 and we have it on two interest-free split pays as well. Now there may well be an opportunity for you to want to have a storage bag. Because if you are taking this around, and that's the beauty of this, it is portable. You can take it to hotels, you can take it to friends' houses. Um, this bag is the perfect size to put your MIDI in. It's Crafter's Companion Purple, obviously, and it's only 16 dollars So bearing in mind you're buying a machine that's costing you just under 70 pounds, for less than 17 pounds, you can, of course, protect your machine for longevity. It's padded on the sides. You can put your um, you can put your shims in there. You can put your plates in there, of course, as well. And this little pouch here, I think you can actually take this out. It it's is, a divider. Yeah. yeah. And you can put things in there. It's actually got a little kind of uh, elasticated gusset, one of my favorite words. Um, you can put pens in there. You can put all sorts in there if you want to as well, or rulers, it's up to you. So, and it's also got a, a mesh pocket in the top there as well. Crafters Companion branded with a handle. Uh, yeah, you can put a few naughty things like biscuits or chocolate in there. I know Debbie was talking about a picnic a picnic basket the other day with her, so she uses it to take a picnic around. Uh, just so you can see it, can we do the overhead, Adam, please? Just so you can see that it fits into there and you've got still lots of space. So people say, do you have to take the handle off? No, the handle does not remove, it stays in. You're just simply gonna fit that into there and then decide what you're gonna pop into it. Um, but it's got spaces for all your folders, for your manuals, for your embossing folders if you want to do Brilliant. that as well. There's tons of space. I mean, look how much space you've got in there. I've still got tons of space that you can absolutely use that with. Um, and port it's the, Again, it gives you that portability, um, being able to move it. Mine sits in there because I've got the original MIDI. So mine sits in there. Okay. Um, so absolutely perfect storage size. It was designed with the MIDI in mind. But of course, it is a great... I mean, I looked at... I, I have actually got one for cosmetics at home. Why not? So I've got one that stores... Because yeah. it, it can get a bit messy, can't it? So it's nice to have everything stored away. When did, this, so, when did this MIDI launch? So I launched that a week last Friday. Okay, so if yeah. you've already got yours, maybe you bought the machine and you're thinking, well, I've got that home safe and sound. I love it. It's great. It's working well. Um, I didn't even realise there was a case available for it. Maybe you just want to buy that today. That's fine. £16.99. 10% um, of the bag is now gone. If you check out your baskets, hello, Winifred, Margie, Crafter in Cheshire, Jane in the Channel Islands, Josie in Essex, all wanting the bag. If you're buying the machine today, get the bag with it at the same time for an extra, what, £16.99. It makes absolute sense. It's kind of protecting your investment because you probably will want to take it and move it around a bit. Oh, you will, definitely. And especially if you are on the go travelling and you want to take a machine with you to do your coating wherever it is that you want Canada I heard him here then Ellie if you're going to Canada absolutely take it abroad with you as well because there's no mechanics to it no. so it'll go through you because you know it will you yeah, take it on the train you take it wherever you want absolutely yeah. uh, do you want to see some more things though please so a cut and emboss folder now we as a company do a lot of cut and emboss folders and so do other companies as well now Normal cut and emboss folders are 2D. So if you think about this folder, it's got your embossing, but it's also got your metal die into there. Don't worry, that's not a bit of paper. It's a bit of sponge to release it. That's what obviously. I thought first time I saw one of those. Yeah, I, thought, Why is that I know, because people think it's a bit of cardstock that we've left in. Um, it isn't, I promise you. Um, put your cardstock into there. Bring back in that plastic singular folder. Rest it on the top run it through the mouth of your machine and then turn your handle to uh, get that released at the other end and then when it comes out of there Dave you have got your uh, cut and emboss folder now and if I just move that out of the way take that piece hey. out a cut and emboss folder that's embossed my cardstock beautifully and also die cut it out as well now when I came down a week last Friday I can't tell you how many messages I got through, not just in the show, but after the show, I had a lot of messages come through about things that you could uh, other do with it as well. And somebody asked me about stencils. Now, normally when we emboss a stencil, and I remember the first person that showed me how to emboss a stencil was the lovely Sandra. Because oh, right. I didn't know you could emboss stencils ah. until Sandra showed me um, way back when it was about seven about seven years ago, that eight years ago now. Um, that when she showed me, I was like blown away. Now, normally we would say you need an electronic die cutting machine. So when I got asked the question, I thought, I'm like one of them that puzzles about it. And I'm thinking, can you do it? Can you do it? And I'm like, hmm, I'm going to try it. And I know this because um, our lovely Michelle, she showed you on Monday, you can stencil. Um, I did a video, a little reel, and I put it, posted it on my Facebook and my Instagram page um, to show you how you're going to do it. So all you're going to do is take a stencil, 
take your piece of cardstock that's going to go over it. Now, normally, at this stage, we would be telling you how to do it in your electronic die cutting machine. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring back in that folder as if it's a die. Okay. And all we're going to do is place that into there. Now, I've gone with a really big one, Dave. I'm being brave. I've gone with a real big one. All you're going to need is a separate shim cardstock. So this okay. is multi-purpose cardstock that's 300 GSM. And I'm going to pop that over the top. And then we're going to treat it as though it's a die. So there's no other shims going there. Pop it into the folder, sorry, the mouth of your machine. And then you're going to turn that. And then simply, and I'll move the machine in a second to show you when we open it up. You could do it with um, mirror card. It looks lovely on mirror card. But just to show you that... Um, on your piece of cardstock, it's embossed, it's absolutely beautiful. And so can we do the overhead for this one, Adam, if that's okay? Just so you can oh, see. Oh, look at that. I, um, I worked it out the other week and I, 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 honestly, I, I was blown away because I thought I can only do an stencil through, um, through a, an electronic die cutting machine. And no, you can't, you can do it through these as well. So just to remind you of that combination, you put your stencil with your cardstock in there and then you want to shim on the top of it. So I always put my stencil face down, cardstock onto the top and then another shim and run it through. So in effect, the there is no compromise with this machine. No, if you were thinking of spending two or all. 300 pounds on an electronic electronic machine, you might think to yourself, oh, I can't really justify that, I can't afford that at the moment, but I can find 69.99 or half of it, 34.99. Um, it will do what your big machines will do, size permitting. Uh, the only die that it won't cope with is the big dies, the big cartridge dies. That's dice, right, okay? yeah. But apart from that, everything else, even the media and multimedia dies, you can use in there. I am, um, do you know what, when we, because when we, I'm going to have a little, two couple of minutes, I'm going to show you, because that was another thing that I got asked through there. Now, there is in your, in your instruction booklet, it tells you the thing, Things like uh, cotton, uh, vinyl, and things like that. I'm going to show you real leather, multiple uh, fabrics as well, and of course um, some aluminium there. So we'll uh, come back and show you how you're going to do this. But this is the important bit. This is when, and I did say at the beginning, Dave, get your extra folder. Yeah. And as you'll see on mine, <laughs> I've wrote on mine multimedia. <laughs> It's my, it's my multimedia plate. That's all I'm going to use. That's what I use. There's oh. this folder um, because if you think of a die with a multimedia, it's got a thicker ridge, yeah. so it cuts deeper, deeper. in. Mm -hmm. You want to remember this is still plastic, so it's a plastic fold. It's not like a, a toughened folders that you get with your electronics, but you absolutely can use your multimedia okay. dies through there, and I so, will show you in a moment. In other words, keep one of your folders for your multimedias and the other one for your standard thin dies, whatever the make may be. So if you do want an extra one, if multimedia dies are your thing, if you like cutting fabric and leather and that sort of thing, uh, it is GE2036. It's only £8.99. Pence. So just mark it. Mark one for multimedia dies and then the other for general uh, everyday thin dies. OK, £8.99. First message of the evening. Hello to uh, Josie in Essex. Hi, I placed uh, an order and forgot to order the extra folder. How do I correct my error? Josie, not a problem. Your order doesn't get processed until midnight. So if you call the call centre uh, 0800 001 4433 and just say that you've already purchased the machine, you'd like to go for an extra folder, please. They can add it into your order. We can do it on the website as well, but the call centre are there. They'll make sure that you've got exactly what you want in your order. OK, 0800 001 4433. If you're on the website, there's also a little area where you can actually correct an order. You can change any order up until midnight of the day that you've purchased it. OK, so just give the call centre a call if that's what you're happy with or just look on the website and it's all explained there too. Thanks for your thanks for your order. And if you want to add maybe the storage box or storage bag in as well, add an extra extra uh, extra folder, that would make sense. The storage bag is only £16.99, uh, but I've got to remind you of the big deal before we go back to Debbie with more demonstrations. This colour you will not find anywhere else. Even at uh, Crafters Companion HQ, even on their channel, in their stores around the country, this colour will not be available. It was manufactured just for us. When that quantity that was made has gone, you will not see it again. It is what we call mojito. We came up with a name for it. Think of it as pistachio. Think of it as a lime green. Um, and it's beautiful. It's very, very stylish. And you get with us, for 69 99 two extra freebies. You get the embossing folder, which is a five by seven embossing folder, and you get that intricate lace border die as well. So both of those are worth around about 15 to 20 pounds. You're not paying for those. They're a free gift from Crafters Companion and us to you, VD2043. But 
I, you know, it's lovely having a powerful electronic machine, don't get me wrong, but there are restrictions in the weight of them, the size of them, and you've got to have power. If you want something that's going to cope with your much bigger dies as well, up to six inches in width, there aren't many dies I'm sure that you've got in your collection that are bigger than that, then this is the machine for you. It can sit on your desk permanently. When you want to take it downstairs, it's easy to move it. When you want to take it maybe out into uh, the car, maybe take it to a friend's house, go on a long train journey, you want to put it on the table that's in front of you on the train, you can do that and you haven't got to think about where am I going to plug it in? You haven't got a problem. <laughs> it's literally just your your turning of the handle. That's all you have to do. And it couldn't be any easier. You really, it really couldn't be easier. $34.99 is your split pay price. And uh, you pay the same again, $34.99 in four weeks time. Okay, loads of you coming through. Uh, Gwyneth in Cornwall, Josie in Essex, Noel in Hertfordshire, hi to you. Arena in Surrey, Crafter, Jay in Essex as well, all putting this in your basket and checking out as well. $69.99, I don't know how many we've got left out of the main order order that we first received but it's going very well, very quickly. Our, our guys and your guys work together so lovely Scott, Liam and Andy work together with our team um, we stopped production of our own middies really? to do that yeah oh. we did we stopped production to get this uh, this commission done for you guys with this beautiful colour and I think it's one of those naughty boys that I keep seeing at the bottom of the screen. Um, <laughs> They, they know that. we're talking about them. <laughs> they're, they're getting ready I think for it's their... one of those naughty three uh, that nicknamed this. Look at her. Look how gorgeous they look. Oh, I love that, Dave. <laughs> they're getting oh ready for their, for their big announcement from Frankfurt. Yeah, the, I'm the latest offer from I'm looking forward to this one. I'm looking forward to it. It's yeah. our turn today. I'm looking Absolutely. forward to this one. Um, do you want to see the multimedia? Mm. So I will tell you that it will cut through your fabrics as well. Now, just so you get this into perspective, this is not an electronic die cutting machine. It's a manual. Yes. So there is a slight difference. What you've got with the powerful Gemini 2 is the most pressure we can put in an electronic die cutting machine. What you've got with the Gemini MIDI is the most pressure we could put into a manual machine. So you can still use your multimedia dies. So I've got a multimedia die here in my hand and I've got some fabric. Now this is four pieces all together, Dave. And this is when I say to you about having a separate folder joking aside you have a separate folder and you're going to pop it in there now when you pop that through the mouth of the machine you're just going to make exactly the same now all it will do is you'll feel a little bit of a resist can you see the difference so mm -hmm. you need to just take that until it goes through I promise you but you will get because of the deeper coach you will get what we call that little bit of a warping with your uh, platforms but again treat these the same way but just so we can clear this up Yes, right. is the answer. Are you ready? One, I'm going to try and line them up on top of the machine. Two, three, and four pieces of fabric that that will cut through there. So obviously with an electronic die cutting machine, we, we know you can get up to eight. You can't get up to eight with the, that. That's the maximum I find with 100% cotton because that's what this is. That's still it's impressive though. Cotton. It is impressive. Four pieces of cotton that that cuts through with a multimedia so die. if you're a quilter or you aspire yeah. to do quilting in the future and you want all of your quilted elements to be absolutely equally cut out perfectly, th th then you can use your multimedia dies. And of course, multimedia dies will do things like balsa wood, they'll mm -hmm. do leather, faux leather, uh, crafting tin, all sorts of wonderful, wonderful things. So this machine can do that as well. If you thought a manual machine wouldn't be able to, think again, this can. And absolutely, think think again. And it was because because of all the questions that we got asked on the day and the questions that came into me inbox afterwards. And I thought, I did a little video on my own page, but I know it doesn't reach everybody. Um, you guys have got a bigger following than I've got, so there's no way we're going to reach everybody. But I just wanted to show you as well and answer all those questions so I've got a bit of leather now so again I've still got a multimedia die I've got some real upholstery leather that um, I am fast running out of and I need to find a leather supplier Dave it's just to give me some scraps we're going to do exactly the same way we pop it into the folder talk to Carla Bagshaw Ish does let she Carla, does leather yeah does she yeah. Ah, oh, well, then I have other diaries and things like that. So. Well, I'm going to talk to our caller next time I see her then. Now, you'll see that I've reversed it because it's leather. It's a thicker material um, and I just want to give it a bit of a double cut. But can we also just appreciate that it cuts through real leather wow. as well with Look a multimedia clean die? Clean cut is too. Clean cut. 
Real leather, you can see the suede looking. I mean, if you come and do the sniff test, I know you can't through the screen, but it's proper leather, I assure you. Um, but it just shows you that you can cut through multiple layers of fabric and you can use it with your leather. And it's just to answer those questions that I got asked. And of course, if it's going to do leather, it's going to do things like my favourite drink. <clears throat> More heat, oh no. Favourite soft drink. Oh, okay. Nice bit of um, aluminium, whatever you've got. Yeah, it's my favourite. Um, and again, all I'm going to do is, because again, I'm cutting into like a, a mixed kind of media material, mm -hmm. I'm going to use my folder. Um, so I'm just going to pop that into there, run that through. And of course, you know, with it being um, these kind of things, I'll just fold it in place because I'm too lazy to get some uh, low tack tape on it. Um, just simply run that through and you can feel almost like a little bit of a resist. Mm -hmm. It's absolutely fine. If you hit a point where you can't turn the handle, stop because that means you've put too much into there. But of course you can then take, and do you know what it does, Dave? You would think that I would cut my finger because it's metal. No, it, it gives it that uh, burnished edge. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, you know, loads of you coming through for what we're calling the mojito. Uh, you can call it whatever colour you like, but it's more of a green than it is a yellow. If it's coming across yellow on your TV, I, I can assure you it's not going to be yellow when it arrives. It's a beautiful lime green. Pistachio maybe is another word for it. Very classy. With the two extra bonus freebies, you've got the embossing folder and you've got that intricate lace die as well. Worth around about 15 to 20 pounds, the two of them. You're getting that as a free gift from Crafters Companion and us here at Hobby Maker. Right now, oh, we're going over a bit earlier than we thoughts mm. oh they will be ready soon <laughs> okay we have signal <laughs> issues we will get back to the guys in Frankfurt very soon um, for our next deal from and our last deal from them as well now the plastic shim and the plastic folder that we talked about remember you're going to get with your machine one plastic shim in uh, a clear color well it's not a color but clear um, but this is exactly the same but it's in purple 20 percent of the stock of this is gone it's only 4.99 remind me again when would you use the plastic shim uh, for all of your 2d embossing 2d embossing yeah, 2D folders embossing. that's why you'd yeah. need this if you need another one a spare one they will wear out with time you will need to change them uh, that's just four pounds and 99 pence and it's qt205 six QT 2056 and really well recommended is to go for an extra folder because obviously these a bit like anything um, with die cutting will need to be replaced from time to time um, certainly a top tip from Debbie being really honest about it if you're using multimedia dies that have got deeper blades they will of course cut in more so good to have one that's for your multimedia dies and the other one maybe for your standard thin dies uh, or and equally if you just want to have a spare in the background so that as and when you need to change it you can do 40 percent of our stock of this is now gone it's the simplest die cutting system that's out there as far as i'm aware because you just literally put your thin dies in there nothing else is needed it couldn't be simpler ge2036 ge2036 and don't forget when you've spent you know your money on a machine it's nice to keep it in pristine condition now if you if you're anything like me my boot is like a wardrobe because <laughs> I, 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 move, I go between home and here consistently I've got stuff everywhere so to put this in the boot would not be a good idea it will get damaged it will get scratched so to have it in something like this so it's nicely protected when you're in transit or if you don't use it all the time at home and you don't maybe have all your equipment out on the table all the time at home maybe you craft on the dining room table you have to clear it away of an evening I know most of you have got craft rooms but it's just a nice beautiful case that's padded to protect your machine uh, and of course, you've got, of course, the removable Velcro strip element there as well. Um, and you've got the elasticated pouches, okay? So QT2041, that's the product code, QT2041, 16.99. Okay, now, the, 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 the story is, we were hoping to link up with um, Scott, Andy, and Liam. Um, but we've got an issue with the signal. If you've been watching yesterday and the day before, it, the signal wasn't great there on the terrace. It was a little bit kind of jittery and a little bit kind of dropping out from time to time. And we've got that same issue now. So rather than going live with them, you saw them a few minutes ago, they're, they're happy, they're well. Uh, it's their last day there. We have got for you a Frankfurt Terrace deal. Now, do you like jigsaws? Look well, Dave, it's International Puzzle Day today. It is. I didn't know that until you told me. I know, me. I told you, yeah. International Puzzle Day. And I swear, they, they, this is a fluke. I, honestly, this is a fluke. No fluke. Now, I didn't know what the price was going to be. Ellie, my producer, didn't know what the price was going to be. But it looks like we've lost the link. So we've done uh, a little phone call with Scott, our MD. 
and he's told Ellie the price that he wants this to go to. This is a Frankfurt only deal. At midnight tonight, the price will no longer be what it's going to be. It should be £20.98. So you're going to get, to start off with, this is a multimedia die. So that's what we were talking about. This is a die that will cut through much more thicker elements. On its own, it's £12.99, okay? So you can see you can make, bearing in mind Valentine's Day is only a few days away now, you can make your own love heart jigsaw. How cool is that? So you can actually have all the pieces apart and you can just pop them into a letter or into an envelope, send them to your nearest, your dearest, your other half, your mum, your dad, whoever you want to send it to, and they can put the puzzle together. So that is worth £12.99. We're also going to give you 20 sheets of mount boards to make your puzzles. I reckon you could make at least 40 puzzles out of that with that heart die. Should be over 20 pounds. Look at the Frankfurt deal. Until midnight tonight, you're gonna get both for 12 pounds 99. Thank you, Scott. Thank you, Liam. Thank you, Andy. 12 99 to make your own romantic jigsaw cards. Oh, that isn't the price. I, I don't know I'm being led by Ellie. Okay, they're in Frankfurt, we're here, and we're being told by Scott the boss where he wants to go with this. Karen in the West Midlands is in already. Sharon in Cambridgeshire, Janice in Fife, Sue in Devon, Michaela in North Yorkshire, Judy in Murray. 12 99 is that the price normally for the die? So you're getting the mount board free at the moment, and that's worth about a tenner. Three, two, one. I didn't know that we were gonna go and do a do a second double dip, I didn't know that. £9.99 for £3 less than what you should be paying for the die alone. You get 20 sheets of mount board as well. If you want to use cardstock with that die and use the mount board for your journaling, for covers, fronts and backs, for your, uh, your thermal cinch and all that sort of thing, of course you can. But it's perfect to make or put a picture, literally glue a picture onto the mount board, cut it out with the die, and you've then made your own personal romantic die card. How cool is that? Under a tenner, Debbie. Honestly, it's fabulous, it really is. A Frankfurt deal. Over 10% of the stock has gone on. We've got a big stock of this. Honestly, when I, when I said this to you, um, I'm blown away, I'm not gonna lie, I'm blown away by the price of the screen. Yeah, I am. Because I know how much the mount board is mm -hmm. on its own mm -hmm. and how much the jigsaw is on its own. So I just think, honestly, it's an incredible deal. And like you've just said, whichever way you look at I've got them, I pinched them out. You've, I know you I know did. when you went I looking, I pinched them out. I just realised you can get two hearts out of each of, of those can, sheets. Yeah. Yeah. So that is 40 potential heart Hearts, jigsaws yeah, you can from make from the mount pack, board. Yeah. Absolutely incredible. That really is fabulous. 20% gone. Ooh, now... Busy, busy reaction. Um, honestly, this, this is a sensational deal. When you want to personalise something and Valentine's Day is around the corner, we're talking just over a couple of weeks, mm. but this is a die that you're going to be able to use for a baby being born. A, a wedding, when a baby's born, oh, yeah. a love heart. You can put a picture of a love heart. Um, it could be for absolutely any occasion. You're getting married, you're getting engaged, it's an anniversary. Could be a new animal in the family. A new animal, yeah. Or just simply someone you love mm -hmm. that you want to send some love to. And it's a personalised little jigsaw. So I did one of my um, kiddies for my grandkids. I keep calling them my kiddies, my daughters. Good job she's not watching. My grandkids. <laughs> I, know, I feel like they're my babies. My grandkids. Um, I put a little picture of them. I did one for Safi and one for Ezra. Yeah. And then I gave them, put them in a little box with a picture on top. And then the, the joy on the faces yeah. when they had to start putting together I mean Ezra chucked them up in air Safi sat there and did them both that's the kind of thing you could be making little bespoke gifts for someone I mean when the actual jigsaw's put together it, it it's obvious that it is a jigsaw the way the die cuts it you yeah. can see the pieces even though they're all together but if you put them just in an envelope loose and get the person to actually put the picture together when it arrives it's just great and you know they'll be amazed you can do your own make your own jigsaws how do you do that and for under a tenner you've got 20 of the mount board and the die, which is reusable again and again and again and again. Lots of you are coming in for more than one of these. Janice has come for two. Nice one, Janice. So is Crafter. Yeah, two brand new crafters coming through, wanting two. I've got a screen full of names. It's never been this price before. Every single Frankfurt price crash that we've done with Scott and Liam and Andy has been incredible. That machine that went down by £100, those pens that went down by £20. I mean, Scott's got the power to say, yeah, do it. He's the boss. I can't. I'm told what to, you know, show it to you at. I can't pick these prices out of the air. We'd love to say, wouldn't we? I know. <laughs> JC2047, whichever way you look at it, you're getting that mount board for free. 
or you're paying for the mount board and you're not paying for the dive, whichever way you look at it. You know, it's you, incredible. And you normally would have to buy these separately. We've put a bundle together and we've got hundreds and hundreds and hundreds available, but that stock is going very quickly. The call center is very busy, as you can expect. So if you're in a queue, please stay there. It's a free phone number. It's only the time it's costing you, not money. 0800 001 4433. Also, of course, if you're on the mobile, it's free as well. Or go online, go to our app. Either way, you'll see it on the screen now. It's 9.99, you can order it that way as well. Uh, we'll take a breather break. Check out your baskets during this, and then we'll come back and show you how the dies work and how you can be making your own amazing personal jigsaws. UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Registering for a Hobbymaker account on our website couldn't be easier. Head over to hobbymaker.co.uk and click on Register Now. Type in your preferred email address, create a password of your choice, and we just ask you for a few simple details. Click on Create Account and then away you go. Within your account setting, you can view your order history, address and card details and items in your basket. Shopping made easy with Hobbymaker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Welcome back. 30% of a massive stock of this <laughs> Frankfurt deal from Scott, Liam and Andy has gone. I'm not at all surprised. It's a multimedia die, so this is going to allow you to cut through things like hardboard and fabric and leather. You can make leather jigsaws. Ooh, leather that? jigsaws, that sounds good. Bit posh, isn't it? Yeah. But normally you buy this separately and you buy this separately, the mount board. You've got 20 sheets of mount board and there's enough mount board to cut this heart jigsaw out twice. Do one one way and then flip it round and do one the other way and you'll get two out of each. So you can make 40 heart jigsaws. Many of you are buying more than one. Uh, Jane in Essex has gone for three of these, maybe for yourself and members of the family or friends, crafting friends. 9.99, a tenner for a gift is not much these days, but look at what you're gifting. You're gifting a die that will last you a lifetime and 20 mount boards to make 40 heart shaped puzzles, which is incredible. Uh, JC2047, what picture are you thinking of putting on that first heart jigsaw? Is it going to be you and your partner? Is it going to be your other half, your brother, your valentine? Is it going to be a grandma, your granddad, your favourite animal, your putty cat, little kitten, dog, whatever? Uh, favourite image, maybe favourite spot where you met, went on your first date, and you've got a picture of it and you want to put it onto, hey, how about that? First date, 
get a picture off the internet, print it off wherever you went for your first date, make it into a jigsaw, send it to your loved one on Valentine's Day. That's lovely. Remember this? Oh, that's sweet. Oh, got a bit of romantic. Your first date. Blending Palace. Oh, really? Yeah. I like how you remember that. To a concert. Oh. Yeah. Great. Um, 9.99 is the Frankfurt deal. Remember, only while stocks last or until midnight tonight, whichever goes first. And I think the stock is going so fast at the moment. But let's show you how to use it and how it works. It's yeah, and because we didn't know about this deal, I haven't been able to print out a photo or anything like that. All I will tell you is um, there's lots of photo papers that are out there. You'll get the best results, Dave, mm. especially if you're going to use it for a jigsaw for a, a loved one or if you're just going to simply take it into your card making or your home decor, scrapbooking, whatever it is. Photo paper, best quality to get you prints out on of course you can do things like you could stamp images or you could tangle images and pop them onto Good there idea. and then you've got yeah puzzle. sand tangle puddle puddle <laughs> puzzle puzzle i know what i meant I Dave. Know but you absolutely could and then you could turn your pieces into some real work of art and um, so honestly you can do anything with this now so i haven't got a picture so i'm just going to cut it out into the mount board okay now can i just address this if we must if i can Multimedia die, if I was to put mount board and then stick it into the folder of a manual machine, could get slightly tricky. And I don't want to try that because I know mount board is thicker. Mm -hmm. So if I'm asking it to cut through thicker material with a multimedia die into a folder, I think I, I think it might just struggle a little bit. So I'm going to use it onto a, a, an electronic die cutting machine just to get a cleaner cut. That's okay. the way I'm looking at this yep. one. Um, so I've got my um, Gemini 2 plate. I've popped my cutting plate down. I'm bringing in my metal shim because I want you to to think about this it's thicker to cut through so I feel like a little bit like where we talk about scissors metal to metal we want it to cut and get that nice clean cut so I'm just going to pop that onto uh, there and like Dave said you can absolutely get two hearts out of there um, if you want but I'm just going to stick mine uh, just into the center and um, pop my plastic shim on and then the other cutting plate onto the top you don't need with a multimedia die you do not, repeat, do not need a magnetic shim. Okay. Just so you're clear, so you know, because I don't want you to think, oh my God, I've got to put a magnetic shim into there to make it cut. No. Um, a multimedia die is thicker. It's a lot thicker. We've changed ours. So when you saw me earlier with the multimedia dies, we used to have them silver, but everybody got confused. Yeah. So we changed the colour. Changed the colour. Yeah. Proper colour. Yeah, just to give it um, that clear indication of the difference between the two. Um, so it's got like a copper colour. Now, if I just remove my piece out of there, and I'm just going to... Um, Pop out. And just to let you know, the Gemini 2 that um, Debbie just used is not 229.99 anymore. It's still under 200 pounds. 199.99, that's what we just used to do this. If you want that, rather than a manual machine, there's something for everybody in the show. <laughs> QW2058, and four-way split means it's only 50 pounds to pay today, or 49.99 plus your PMP. And the, the latest electronic Gemini will be on its way to you. Absolutely, so I'm just gonna get rid of all my little pieces. Look how cleanly that's going. Hey, look. Honestly, and it is a working jigsaw. This is me. I'm glad I ain't got a picture of it, Dave, because I would struggle to get. I would struggle to get it back together again. <laughs> Our staffy just literally did it in seconds. But honestly, they're absolutely fabulous. And just so you can see, every single piece clean cut. Wow. No fraying. Absolutely. And that's the difference. What you get between a multimedia die to a regular die. A nice clean. Oh, it looks like a little um, in my head. That's a head. Arms, legs. Oh, okay. I was, th I, was thinking, I was thinking swags on curtains. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The, honestly, how, cl how cool is this? And then, you, of course, you'll put that all back together. Please don't ask me to do that. Uh, put it all back together again, because um, I'm not very good at jigsaws. I know there's <laughs> lots of people out there that are good at jigsaws, but I'm not one of them. Uh, but seriously, I love this. I can't believe that Scott has allowed to get that sort of a deal well, with all your mount board into there and and the die included. I mean, the entertainment value in itself, you know, someone receiving pieces of a jigsaw in the post will probably look at and go, oh, OK, let's just see what this says. It could be a hidden message. It could be a picture of a place that you are taking someone for a weekend away or a show that you're buying, buying tickets for or a, a pop show or a pop star that you've bought tickets to see or something like that. You know, print that oh, image right, off, right. put it onto the heart and then die cut it. And that can be the surprise. Surprise. Happy Valentine's Day. Absolutely. I like that. That's really clever. Uh, but look how fabulous. Then putting it back together. 
Do you know, Ellie, she cracked me up. <laughs> Ellie... Honestly, <laughs> if you just heard what Ellie said Ellie, in my Ellie, ear. Ellie was just saying... I mean, in the spirit of love... It could be I want a divorce. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> she cracks me up, that girl, she is. But, yeah, seriously, it's a fabulous deal, a fabulous... To get, to get both of those items for less than £10 is just phenomenal. I'm so pleased I've seen all those names bouncing through the screen, all the people that have got it. You've got yourself a stellar deal there Honestly, at a great price. I mean, the mount board alone should be what exactly. you're paying for this. Uh, yeah. And it's like you're getting the die for nothing. And it's a die that you'll use again and again and again. And if you do sell your cards, the fact that you've got jigsaw cards or can offer a service to people, I can make a jigsaw card for you. People go, wow, really? How can you do that? You can't buy that in the shops. I don't think you can anyway. Uh, now, Sally in West Yorkshire has got in touch. Hello, Sally. Good evening. Um, hi, lovely Debbie and Dave. Can you use proper photos on these dice? Yeah. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Sally, I use them all the time. I, I, I've said about printing your own out onto photo paper. <laughs> I don't do that. I've got to one of those little machines. In and the there's actually some haps, apps that give you 49 or so prints free a oh, month. Okay. You probably know which one I'm talking about. There's lots of free apps that allow you to have and print out. Because I'm a believer, everything's modern technology these days. Yeah. Everything's stored on a phone in the cloud. I want a physical photo. So I use my monthly mm -hmm. allowance and some to print out pictures. So I've used real photos onto that mount board and die cut them. Um, it, Cause it, that just takes it onto a whole new level when you use real photos mm. um, on good quality paper. So yeah, absolutely. It could, could also be baby reveals as well, couldn't yes. it? You know, if you know that you're having a baby, you've just found out what the sex of it's gonna be. Um, you could uh, obviously, a surprise, put, print it, print what the sex is going to be, print the colour, maybe blue or pink or something like that, and cut that into the jigsaw, and then that could go to the grandparents. That's it? nice. This is what's coming, like you know. That. Love these ideas. Yeah. yeah. OK, Nine ninety nine for both. Uh, Julia's got in touch, um, and, of course, you can get in touch with us via our website or via the app, just where it says, contact the studio, send the message. Uh, Julia in Midlothian says, do you glue the photo to mount board first? Yes. Then run through the die-cutting machine, please. Yeah. What a great question. Yeah. Julia, seriously, that's a fabulous question because I never even touched on that. Um, uh, you can use things like uh, tacky glue, um, all-purpose glue, tape pens with a dry glue. You're going to have to make sure you just cover the whole area of the photo. So me personally, I use stick and stay. A red can spray, spray, which is the permanent glue. I spray the back of the photo, then leave it 30 seconds, attach it to my mount board, and then I let it dry. With a spray like that, it only takes a couple, it, it, I'm talking minutes, not a long time. If you're using like a wet glue, you need to give it a bit of time to dry. So that would be with a tacky glue and the all-purpose glue. If you've got a glue um, stick, would that be a, all right? A glue stick, so you're talking um, like a spritz stick kind of thing, mm -hmm, one of those, mm -hmm. you can do, but in all honesty, the photo's probably going to drop off at some point. Okay. So just make sure you've got a permanent glue that's going to hold it in place. So stick so and stay stick in the and aerosol. Stay is the aerosol can. It will be on the website. It's a red tin. You can't miss it. Use that one or use a wet glue to attach it, but do let it dry because if you don't let it dry, and it's a gr great question, Julia, but if you don't let it dry, what will happen with the pressure with wet glue? <laughs> it's yeah. going to go everywhere. It's so don't squirt do out. That. Yeah. yeah. Um, can we get stick and stay? Are we going to get that on the show? Can we do that? <laughs> we'll have a little look for it. If it's in stock, we'll put it on the screen and then you can uh, order that if you want to, because that is your perfect, perfect companion to go with uh, this particular die and the mount board as well. Uh, we have got some stock, I think. Permanent <laughs> adhesive, here it is. It's $7.99. There it is, look, it's on our website right now. That's what you need, stick and stay. Uh, yeah, and that should last you a long, long time. There's other cans available. Stick Away is another one. Um, uh, what was the other one? There's the temporary adhesive. That's, oh, that's called stick and spray. Stick and spray. That's in a purple so can. That's repositional. Stick and stay is the permanent. Okay, so that's perfect to use with this. No kind of mess. No squidging of PVA or anything like that. JC uh, two. Is it JC two? No. It's, what's the item number on that one? QC. 2008, QC 2008, if you want stick and stay. We'll add it into the show, so it'll be there on the website when you have a little look. So what a fantastic Frankfurt deal that is. Um, we're here until seven with Debbie and myself. Then, of course, lovely Sandra is back with more Santangle to take us through on our last live hour of the day. And it's like a roundup of the best of the day with Sandra coming up at seven. So if you've been at work or been out all day or whatever, um, we will be showing you what you otherwise would have missed. Okay, now, quickly remind you of it. 
There it is. That's the deal. That's the uh, jigsaw die, multimedia die. So it will go through even the mount board that it comes with and things like fabric and leather and all sorts. 9.99 JC2047. JC2047. Okay, we're going to take a little breather just for a minute or two. And then we're going to go back to and talk about our Cosmic Collection, which uh, I've not seen until today, but whatever you do. If you want to go for, remember, the MIDI, the Gemini MIDI, in this wonderful mojito colour, which is like um, a pistachio. It's a lime green, very, very stylish. It's not bright yellow or anything like that. Very popular tonight, it's been as well. And remember, this is a go anywhere, no electrical point needed manual die cutting machine that will emboss your 2D and your 3D embossing folders, dies for die cutting, of course, as well. It's got the most simple plate formation ever, and it comes with all the plates you need, but we do have the extra plates if you want them. Now, um, we've got the stick and stay. Lots of you want it. We've put it into the show, okay? So here it is. That's perfect to attach your photographs onto your mount board if you want it. £7.99, JC2008. We've got 20 available, and that is it, just 20 of them. So Vivian's in already uh, in the Highlands. So, uh, yeah, fully boots with that. Okay, cosmic. If you love things that are kind of intergalactic, that are kind of um, quite zodiac-y, I suppose, as well, quite myth and magic and wizardy, you are not going to be disappointed with what we've got coming up in just a second. See you after a short break. <laughs> Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobbymaker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects, and we feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to crafting or a seasoned pro, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 1pm to 8pm, and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Registering for a Hobbymaker account on our website couldn't be easier. Head over to hobbymaker.co.uk and click on register now. Type in your preferred email address, create a password of your choice and we just ask you for a few simple details. Click on create account and then away you go. Within your account setting, you can view your order history, address and card details and items in your basket. Shopping made easy with Hobbymaker.
Welcome back. <laughs> this. Uh, I've just realised. What? I've told you. <laughs> I looked at that screen. I thought, "Oh my God! <laughs> I look like a, I look like a little shorty." It's... Not at all. We don't get to stand next to each other very often. That's no, I why. know. That's the thing. Yeah. That's the thing. Now I've got one word to say for this, for this collection. It's right up my street. Um, cosmic. It is absolutely brilliant. If you love like. Um, if you love your star signs and love yeah. astrology, that sort of thing, if you, love, um, if you love outer space, if you love myth and magic, if you love wizards, anything like that, this is absolutely brilliant. And that's why it's been uh, one of the most popular collections of recent months, and maybe even years. Uh, it's only just under 200 pounds, but what you get for that money is phenomenal. And the artwork in the pads and the design of the dies, uh, the embossing folders as well, intergalactic. It is, it really is out of this world. Mm. It's an absolutely fabulous collection. Now we said earlier on, and we'll say it again, there are different deals for different pockets. The one we're gonna show you is the whole is ultimate everything. collection. Yeah. It's absolutely everything. And but we'll break it down for you a little bit more. It is on for interest-free split payments as well. So it's only going to be, if you want this whole collection delivered to your door in the next couple of days, it's that first split payment of... £49.75. £49.75 today, plus your PMP, unless you've already paid it. And then the next payment in four weeks, eight weeks, and the last one in 12 weeks. Firstly, look at the colour palette. It's the gorgeous. purples, the blues, the yeah, light blues. Yeah, those, those, when you look into the midnight sky, yeah. the dark skies, those beautiful... And, and if you do love your, tele, you know, your telescopic, um, where you're looking through and you can see all those colours, this is, this is absolutely stunning. There's embossing folders, there's dyes, there's stencils. Um, the papers are literally out of this world. I can't wait to show them you, Dave. We've got ombre glitter cardstock in this as well. Mm -hmm. Pearlescent cardstock. We've got um, embellishments in there. You've got glitter paste. You've got metallic uh, pens in there. You've got a lovely gilding flake kit in there. And then the biggest tub of uh, mixed sequins I've ever seen, all those gorgeous colours. But it's absolutely everything you want to bring a collection, collection together to make absolutely. it work together. Now, this bundle is 20% gone, okay? And on four split pays, that is the opportunity to go for and get absolutely everything in probably one of the most versatile themes you could ever possibly invest in. Everyone's intrigued with their star signs, if they believe it or not. Everyone's, in, I'm sure, interested in what's going on out there, what space. Maybe you love certain wizard films, that sort of thing, and, and that's kind of appropriate as well. Um, You've got the whole lot there. Now, if you just want the top layer, which is basically all your dies and your embossing folders, that sort of thing, that's going to come up on the screen just over here. Um, if you want the main collection, that was just on the screen a few seconds ago. So here we go. If you want that collection on the top, that's all the dies and the um, embossing folders as well, and your stamps too. Uh, that is $79.99. So everything that Levi on camera two is showing you now, that's going to be coming in that bundle for $79.99. That's on two split pays. So that will be just under £40 today, $39.99, and then $39.99 in four weeks' time. But do remember, for a couple of pounds more each month, I know it's over four payments, you can go for the big bundle if you want to. Now, if it's the paper, that really, really inspire you. Um, you've got Rob on foil elements on there, which we're going to show you a little bit more about in a second. You've then got your six by six. Uh, the foil papers you can only get in this bundle, okay, or in the big bundle. And then you've got three 12 by 12 pads. Yeah, oh, wow. pearlescent. You've got the patterns, you've got the mirror and glitter card pack. And they've got the A4. And then the A4 ombre glitter card pack as well in that bundle. So, um, yeah. They, I, call that I call that the consumable collection. Yeah. That's the bit that's going to make it work together. So if you love your 12 by 12s and your papers and your cardstock, that's for you, that middle one. That is $79.99 as well. Uh, you can only get the foil transfers in that bundle or the entire collection, okay? That's sold out on its own. And if you just want the embellishment collection, which is down the bottom, that's available as a separate little bundle as well. Remind me what's in there again, Debbie. So you've got your um, sequins, you've got your shimmer sprays, you've got your metallic markers, you've got a gilding wax kit, and you've also got the glitter paste as okay. well. And that is $44.50 if that's the bundle you'd like on its own. Uh, and that's PI2038. And that's no split pay because it's under £50, but it's just one payment and it's done. Okay. The main collection, though, is where you save the most money. That's always the case. You get everything. Everything on the top shelf, middle shelf and bottom shelf. And when you see exactly what you get with Debbie going through the boards in a second, it'll blow you away. Should be £230.77. Under £200 with four-way split pay means you only have to pay that first payment of, what was it, 40... 
Was it 47? No, not 47.50. It's 49.50, wasn't it? No, 49.75. 49.75, that first split payment. GX2040. GX2040. You can use split pay. It's there for everybody. It doesn't go through a finance house or an outside company. It's something we just do as a business here. Uh, yeah, you just pay that first split payment of four, and it locks that price as well. So when the price goes back up, you're not paying split pay over the higher price. You're paying it still on that 199. 49.75. There you go. That's the price. GX2040. And this is what you're going to get. So I'm going to take you through the essentials collection if you just go for the essentials but obviously everything I'm going to show you in the next few minutes and let me tell you it'll take me a few minutes to get through it all um that's the ultimate collection the essentials is what I call the hardware so this is where you have got all of your uh, dies and stencils and stamps and embossing folds in there now we'll tell you the singles this has gone the only way you can get hold of it and you can't even get hold of this one at head office no. it's gone it's I'm not surprised, gone. it's gorgeous. It's absolutely beautiful. It's called the Cosmic Die. It's just stunning. All of those die cut elements as well, when you run it through your cardstock, they cut into your cardstock. You've got all of those, the bits that drop out are the bits you're going to be able to use yep. as well to decorate your cards. It's in. like someone's made a wish. Yes. Isn't it? It's like a... Yes. Yeah. Like a, a wish With a wand, wand or whatever. Wand, yeah, yeah. yeah, absolutely stunning. And is it no wonder that one has gone and why well, it was the first to go today as well in the individual items. We've got Over the Moon, which is a stamp and die set. This is beautiful. The detail on that moon is stunning. The die will fit over, so it enables you to cut it out as well. And then, of course, you've got your half crescent moon there as well. I'm telling you, it reminds me of Jaffa cakes. Yeah. Every time I see it, half moon. A half eaten one. one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> also, uh, how, how brilliant would that be? Rather than sending a congratulations card, which is, is lovely, but it's a different way of saying congratulations. Yeah, isn't it? yeah. So Over my daughter's taking a driving test soon, and I've got a plan of over the moon if she does fingers crossed because honestly fingers crossed yeah absolutely um one of my favorites in this collection is the superstar dies so this is your superstar dies that creates all of those lovely stars i absolutely adore this one um and use it a heck of a lot and i there's elements in this one you're going to be able to use outside of this cosmic collection the next one is the planet shaker so the oh. planet shaker love that one with your little uh What's the what, technical? What's the technical thing that goes right? The Hobbit. Um, is it the Hobbit? Is it yeah, the Hobbit? Yeah, I think it is. I think it is, isn't yeah, it? That's what and I was then thinking. again, more stars, and none of these stars as well are duplicates of the ones that you've already seen. I know a star's a star. I know you're thinking, God, Debbie, that sounds bizarre, but it's just so you know that they're all individual uh, ones as well. Now it makes it look like Saturn. Oh, it does. Mm. Absolutely, isn't that incredible? Um, I've got a nice stamp set here. Love is in the stars. This is beautiful. Where you've got this lovely stamp that won't sit on there, so I'm going to take it off, Dave. Drive me mad you can stamp into it of course you've got your gilding flakes you could be stamping with your gilding flakes as well and then a die to cut that out but look at that die it's a hard die yeah you could use that on its own if you absolutely. want absolutely um so that's a fabulous one in itself mm -hmm. i adore this stamp the Milky Way. Wow. Isn't that just Look divine. at the movement in that. That's it's swirl, just that whoosh. stunning, yeah. And that's a beautiful stamp in itself. Take all your colours, stamp it in different colours. You're going to be able to do so much with that. 30% of that. the available stock for this hour has now gone. Congratulations, one and all. Uh, another stamp set, Orbit Collection. This yep. is a beautiful one again. I will just point out, this is all separate stamps. There's not, it's not a joined plate stamp. It's all separate stamps. So it enables you to get really creative in terms of how you position things, your moons in there, your sentence in there, and then create that lovely orbit um, around there. Sentiment-wise, we've got some beauties. Reach for the stars, this one's called. You are a superstar. You are out of this world. I love that one. Uh, make a wish. Um, there's a lot on there, Dave, and all lovely ones that you can use just to finish your sentiment off or use for a little verse inside Do as well. Do you know what? When you're making a card, is it for an older person, a younger person, a male, a female? It doesn't matter with this collection. Everyone will appreciate it. They will, absolutely. It's not one of those generic ones that's like... Do you know what I said? What's refreshing? And I love butterflies and flowers. I will tell you right now, you'll not find a crafter who loves them more than I do. But it's refreshing. Mm -hmm. It's something new. And it's why everyone's taken it to the heart and have absolutely fallen in love with it. Everyone and relates to it. Why. Yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, Mystical Moon. Now, this comes in two parts. So this is a die set that's got two die pieces. The inner die cuts into the cardstock. Using the outer die creates the frame element to it. But it comes with a stencil. So the stencil enables you to create this beautiful... Now, I love this. 
I did Me a Facebook too. Live last night with this, and a lot of the giggles that were had from the comments that were coming through was they could see more than just mystical clouds. They could see the stashes. I, one lady I was thinking said, that as well. One lady said she could see, put that in orange and green. Is it green with the umpa lumpers? Yes. Yeah. Yes. And then you could do little umpa lumpa ones as well. I love it, that. It, I, I saw like a genie as well. Yeah. Possibly. Genie coming yeah. out of the bottle or something oh, like that. Oh, I like that I, as well. Just got to let you know, I know we're no, nowhere near through all of the boards to show you what's in here, but we've had a massive jump and 50% of the wow. available stock on this collection has now gone. Everybody that's got it in their basket now needs to check out, please, because 50% has gone. We're here till seven o'clock. Will the stock last of this? It's just kind of hit. I think everyone can relate to it. It's, exactly, it's exactly. Hit the nail on the head. Um, I've got a couple of stencils for you next. So these come together. It's called the Star, the Cosmic Starry Night. So it's Cosmic and Starry Night together. And it's two stencil sets. So I'll show you this one first. Absolutely beautiful, that Starry Night. Put your inks through there, your paste through there. Of course, you're getting glitter paste in this collection. You could be using that through there. And then, of course, you've got your lovely um, Cosmic one as well. Um, so that's a two-part set. And again... They're just, it's just phenomenal. Use little elements of it. Um, really play around with this one and um, create some really beautiful uh, pieces. Now, we've got some embossing folders in the uh, Essential Collection. I'll start with a 2D, um, the regular, mm -hmm. uh, which is this beautiful cosmic constellation. Isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely beautiful. Don't think it does it justice on that colour, but you can get to see all that beautiful detail in there as well. And it is gorgeous. Do you often look up at the sky and try and pick out the shapes and all and that? And shapes, there, yeah. yeah, yeah. And when you look at the, because these things, cut, well, I can't, I, I'll tell you right now, nothing stays in here. They're just pretty stars in the sky, but there are people out there that stargaze and, and can name all of those. You absolutely can. Uh, moving on to the last element of the um, essential collection. This one's a two for the price of one because it's a, a 3D embossing folder with a metal die. Now you can use that on its own, but you can also then die cut a piece out, pop it back into there, and then you can create. And I, just so I can show you, because the board doesn't show it off properly. Not for me, anyway. Um, so I'm going to show you how it would look when you use that together. Oh, look at it that. It is simply... <laughs> Thank you very much, Levi. <laughs> He's going upside down, Debbie. Uh, look how beautiful. Thank you, Jimmy, as well. Is that you, Jimmy and Maria? Yeah, thank you. Because, um, seriously, that looks absolutely sensational. Can you get in close, Levi? Ah, there we go. All that background detail comes from the embossing folder. The die cut piece, you're then going to run through your embossing folder and then you're going to ink up and colour to your heart's content. It is a masterpiece. That, that is so bright and cheerful it. and yeah. happy, isn't it? Well, well, I did one, my demonstration this morning, so I can put them side by side. This was one that I did. As I keep saying this morning, the first show of the day. That was the one that I did. Look at the two different ways you can use it mm. because it's a separate piece and you absolutely can. Uh, and again, angle it. look at all that detail. Thank you very much. My goodness, it's a good job I didn't miss because look how close we're getting in there. 60% now gone, Debbie, 60%. I'm not surprised. It is really a beautiful collection. Now that's the essential collection. Do you want to see some more? Because Go if on. you are going for that ultimate bundle, there are elements in there that you are only going to get if you're getting the ultimate bundle or the essential one. It's entirely up to you. One of them being this. OK, you can only get this yeah. in either the paper essential bundle or the overall big bundle, which yes, is what's on the screen Yes, you can't get it now. anymore individually. No, no. Now, this is your transfers, and it's, a nice, it's nice to do this in there. Now, this is the bit that you can uh, snip into. Mm -hmm. You can use segments of it. You don't have to use it all. But you are getting, in total, I'm going to read this, six designs... So basically two of each, so yep. you're getting 12 of the transfer sheets, eight by eight transfer sheets. And then you're getting 12 silver foil, cold foils that you're going to use over the top. So that's one of the designs. I'm just going to show you the other. So do you oh. rub these with like the lollipop sticks? Lollipop right. sticks, yeah. I actually did one this um, afternoon, that first show. I showed you how you can use your die cutting machine. Um, I struggle sometimes to get an even contact with the foil transfer. So me, I cheat and I put it through the machine. Okay. And you'll work your way out. Look at that one. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely beautiful. The now, we're, we're nearly in single-figure stock, so uh, 10 at the moment, I think, we have available at 199. And remember, with four... No fee, no interest, split payments. So for less than £50 today, 49 75 you can get this home and just enjoy it. When you see these pads, 
If you're not tempted yet, you will be, believe me. These are, you're in, <coughs> you're in another world with these. Absolutely. So I'm going to start with the pearlescent card pack. And I say card pack, it's, it's, it's literally the most beautiful, vibrant colours that match. And it's pearlescent. Um, so you are getting six colours, four of each. So you're getting 24 in total. The most beautiful colourway of pearlescent pad that I think we've ever done. Um, look at that gorgeous teal coloured compared to that purple. I keep flicking that last bit over. Dave, I mean, seriously, I don't know what's up with me today. <laughs> navy, that beautiful navy colour. This lighter pink. And I say mm -hmm. lighter pink. I wouldn't consider that to be pink pink. I would call that like a lovely cosmic pink. Yeah. And then that beautiful, like a wine kind of plummy coloured, berry coloured. I mean, they're, um, they're unlike any other colours in yeah. pads from Crafters Companion that I've seen before. We've got nine oh my left. Days. Next nine of you to check out your baskets will be lucky on this. And it is for the entire collection. Um, seriously, you're getting yourself a real deal here. Um, I'm going to move on to the mixed uh, paper pad now. And I say paper, this is cardstock. It's all 250 GSM. But look at the gorgeous mirror card. And if you've noticed what you've just seen with the colourways, these all match. Oh, wow. Everything matches. So this is your mirror card. So you're getting the blue, the silver, and the pink. And then we're moving on to 12 by 12 encapsulated glitter card stock in the blue. In this pewter colour, look at that. I mean, in the blue, it looked like a starry sky, didn't Seriously, it? Seriously, this is this is what it's been done. It's colour swatched to match. One of my favourites, I'm not going to lie. I know if Jan Brown is watching right now, she will be screaming at the screen because she loves that colour. Well, Ellie, um, it is absolutely stunning. Our producer, it's Ellie, has just said this is my favourite collection she's seen since she's been at Hobby Maker. I'm not surprised. Oh, it, it you know, that lovely. The colours are gorgeous. The theme is something that everyone relates to. Yeah. Um, and now we've got the ombre glitter card as well. Oh, this excited me the most, I think. I got so excited when I saw this. Finally, we've got our own ombre glitter card stock um, encapsulated. I've had to buy ombre glitter card stock elsewhere. Not anymore because we've got it. And it's in the A4. And look at the... Shall I do it that way again? Because um, I know Levi um, saw it earlier and showed it me that way. You are going to get... Now, let me get this right. Five designs, five of each, 25 sheets of A4 ombre encapsulated glitter card stock and I'm, oh. I mean that's the that's like a, a sunset Seriously. the earth the sky absolutely all together kind of pink of a sunset. isn't it the most divine um excuse me hello Ooh. Look how beautiful that looks as well. Um, I seriously adore this. The ombre running through there that you would only be able to achieve like with your inks. Well, you can do it now with this beautiful encapsulated glitter cardstock. And then seriously, look at that one. Isn't that absolutely stunning? We're only about halfway through the entire collection and we have eight left. <sighs> Eight chances to get this, the Cosmic Collection. By the time we get to the end of the preview, I think it'll be sold out. So, now, now what's next? Oh, hang on. Now, you, you are going to love this, mm -hmm. Dave. This you will absolutely adore. Right up my street. This is our Cosmic 12x12 patterned cardstock. Um, just, shall we do it over here or in the camera? Thank you very much, Jimmy. Um, look at this. This is like, look, and, uh, do you know, Ellie? I'll tell you a little story. Our lovely Leanne told us from our team, they took photos, imagery of the galaxy yeah. and the stars yeah. and took that and put it into a pad. Oh, so you're actually looking at, um, and I know, I know Ellie, I know that's what you're thinking. It isn't a real photo. It's been worked with our team. Our fabulous designers up at head office have taken those images and popped them into this beautiful pearlescent cardstock. So they've tweaked now, it. Yeah. yeah. And there's no such thing as an A side and a B side. This is a double A side. You'll get that reference, double A side, because every single one of these is a work oh, of art. I and it's it. all pearl pearlescent. It is the most beautiful paper pad. I'm telling you now, if you love this, this is the consumable part of the collection. If you love these, get hold of them. Ellie, do we have these as a separate as well? Or is it just in the bundle? I'll let Ellie do that. Look at that work, Dave. Stunning. The re Honestly, it blew me away, this, when I saw this. I genuinely was so impressed when I saw how our guys were able to achieve this look in a pearlized, pearlescent, beautiful 12 by 12 finish. And like I said, there is no way you can decide which side to use because they are all beautiful. I'm going to take you through each one so you're getting... 12 designs, two of each, 24 pearlized 
pleasant, beautiful cardstock. And, and it is card. -based. They're loose leaf, aren't they? This is what? Loose leaf? No, you take them out. I've you took mine out. out. Okay, I wanted right. to show you just this imagery. Okay. You've got to just take them out. You, now, it's literally the easiest thing to take away. But just so you can see all of these beautiful, beautiful designs. Now, Dave, if you want this, gorgeous. we've got a couple of hundred of them on their own. Okay. How many sheets was it again? So it's 24, 24. sheets. It'll come to you like this, Dave. Okay. You'll get it in this pad. It'll come to you like this. You're getting 12 designs, two of each. So okay. everyone I've just shown you you are going to get two of each of them. Obviously, you're going to get that in the main collection if you're going for it. We've only got, I think, eight left now of the main collection. If you want that pad or you love it so much you want an extra one, VB2017 is the product code. It's only $15.99 for all 24 sheets. You're coming in thick and fast for this. Hello, Andrew in Merseyside, Anne in Tynan Weir, Crafter, Jane in the Channel Islands has checked out. If you're going for the main collection or you bought it earlier on maybe, and you're thinking, I know that's gonna be my favorite part of the collection. I'm gonna use that more than anything else. Get an extra pad while we've got the stock a bit for 15.99. You won't pay any more PMP if you bought something today from us, just 3.95, but it's available. Now the main bundle is looking like it's gonna sell out. Just to give you a heads up, oh, there are seven wow. left now. Now, I will tell you, I've not finished yet because okay. I've still got one more paper pad to show you. You love the 12 by 12? Six by six, scaled to size. So I'm just gonna lift this off so it's exactly the same, but you are not missing a single bit of detail on that glorious artwork on the AA side sheets. These are beautiful. They've been scaled to size. It's the same quality. It's the same pearl card, pearlescent cardstock, and those same gorgeous designs running all the way through. So you are getting 12, sorry, 12 designs, two of each, 24 and a six by six. Now the as six well. by six, just like the 12 by 12, is also available on its own, I believe. Uh, again, we have 200 available of those. So bearing in mind how many of you have bought the main collection, think about it. If the 12 by 12 and six by six are going to be your favorite go-to pads, you'll run out of those first. So I would go for an extra 12 by 12 and an extra six by six if it were me. Um, six pounds 99 pence is all it is for an extra one, okay? And bear in mind they are consumable. I mean, certain parts of the collection are never going to run out, like your embossing folders. Well, yeah, and the, 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 if you would, it, it's like the essential collection, basically. That's not the one. That's the hardware. Yeah. That's the things that's going to last you forever. Six ninety nine. If yeah. you fancy another one of those, and who wouldn't? They're lovely. Um, Anne in Thailand and Weir. Uh, also, hello to Jackie in the Isle of Anglesey. Jane in the Channel Islands. If that's your budget and that's all you want, but you love the artwork, or you've gone either for the paper collection, or you've gone for the entire collection, at just under two hundred pounds. Um, then maybe go for a couple of extra pads because you'll be gutted if you run out and you can't get any more. So mm. don't miss out on it. And shall we finish off with the rest of the collection? Go on then. So this is the embellishment part. I love these. We've got this gorgeous chunky glitter paste, which is absolutely divine. You're going to add texture and sparkle to any of your projects and look at that beautiful colour that's going to match the rest of your collection uh, and of course go through all of your stencils that you have um, and you can take it out of that if you wanted to so it's a nice pot of um, that beautiful glitter paste in this gorgeous color. look at that chunky design and that would look great on black card as well wouldn't it not just white card. absolutely we've got a couple of shimmer sprays in here so you'll know we've had shimmer sprays um, in our recent closures um, and we've put two in here as well for you which is these now it never does it justice on this board it's absolutely exquisite when you add the shimmer spray you've got that mica now whenever you're using these this shimmer spray with this um beautiful and it really is magical mica you give it a shake okay you mix it all up and then you just spritz um shake and those two colors yeah shake to wake uh, but absolutely stunning so you've got the shimmer in there as well um then you've got Oh, gilding flakes. Gilding flakes. With a nice little kit to boot as well. Um, we do our kits really well. We've done them for a long time now. You can see mine. Yours won't look like that. Yours will be in a nice plastic container. Mine have just shoved in a box. Um, you get in two pots of gilding flakes in these two glorious colours of that gold and that blue, that skylit blue. You've got an ink pad in there, which is your dry ink pad, which means you can turn any stamp you own and gild with it. You've got your two sponges to do the buffing. I like yep. to buff it up, yep. give it a nice little buff. And then um, you're gonna go be you're gonna go gilding, you're gonna go gilding flake crazy. Mm -hmm. So I absolutely love that one. We have also popped in here um, two of our metallic um, paint markers in there. You get silver and, these, and gold. Yeah, these are our four mil nibs, and I'm just bringing the boards because you can see the effect, that beautiful metallic effect that you're getting. Um, and again, 
absolutely stunning. I love these two. I love all of our metallic paint markers. Um, so we've popped two of those in there with the four mil nib now, um, in there for you as well. Okay, that is the entire Cosmic collection. No, it's, it's not. Oh. <laughs> There's more. No, one more. One more. Yeah, I'm going to try and be careful because, Dave, when I did this this uh, afternoon, I dropped it everywhere. <laughs> it's uh, a big, giant pot of, of sequins. Beautiful sequins. I'll hold it there so I love it because he's, he knows what I'm like. Uh, thank you very much. So, you are going to get all of these cosmic, beautiful sequins as well. Have they got look like at the a, size of the pot. Have they got an AB coating on them or something like that? Oh, seriously, Dave, they're gorgeous. They're absolutely beautiful. The shaker and cards. The shaker cards. These are going to match as well because every single colour that's in there matches the colours of right. the collection. Everything ties absolutely in. Absolutely ties in together. Beautiful. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Now I've finished it. Okay. So that is the entire <laughs> Cosmic collection. In its entirety, you get the whole lot, okay? <laughs> we'll let you okay. off, Jimmy. We'll let you off. It's been a long day. <laughs> Levi got in really close to see the sequins and then you know, in front of the camera, it doesn't matter. Okay, now um, all of those things, apart from the Robon stickers, Robon transfers, are still available separately. Importantly, I've got to let you know, if you want the entire collection, you're looking at under £200, £199.99. And we got it on interest-free, interest free even, no fee, split pay. $49.75 today is all you need to give us, plus your PMP if you've not paid it already, and it's on its way. This will come through in the next few days from Crafter's Companion direct to your door. That's going to be one big box, one big box of excitement and joy. And everyone loves the galaxy. Everyone looks up to the stars and maybe daydreams or night dreams or whatever. Um, everyone can relate to it. If you're into your star signs, if you're into astrology, if you just love uh, space, J, no, it's GX2040. GX2040 will get you the whole thing. But remember, we do have healthy stocks of the 12 by 12 pads and the six by six. So if you want to go for the six by six, an extra one of those, that's 699. If you want the 12 by 12s, we've got a couple of hundred of those, but they're going very, very, very quickly. We've got five of the main deal left. Five left, you've seen everything. Debbie's been very comprehensive and gone through absolutely everything. You're saving £30 by buying it as a collection, and we only ask you for a quarter of the cost of it today, and it will be dispatched straight away. GX2040. We're on the air for 24 minutes with this show, then it's Santangle. I think this is going to go in the next five, 10 minutes, by the way, it's going at the moment. So please call the call centre if you want one, 0800 001 4433. If it's in your basket on our app or on the website, just check out that basket and pay that first split payment. And don't forget, think about maybe going for an extra pad. It makes sense because um, if you love them like I do, you're going to use those pretty quickly. And they're not much money if you want to get an extra 12 by 12 or an extra 6 by 6. And you can be making cards as beautiful as this. They're stunning. Oh, thank you very much. Um, I did this last night on a Facebook Live, Dave. Um, so absolutely use this gorgeous collection. I use that lovely mystical moon with that stencil set and the stars and some of the most beautiful papers in the background. You could be using your glitter paste. This is the thing about this or your um not just your glitter list, you could use your um cardstock as well yep. there's lots of things you're going to be able to do to create this i love another one like this i'll just show you this how gorgeous is also that? kids cards kids Seriously? love space and rockets yeah and yeah absolutely julia's whapped loads on there she's used the orbits she's used that lovely um cosmic um uh, shimmer spray sparkle you know the shaker dies there's all sorts on there julia's gone to town with that one Have you got any alien dies you can incorporate those into it as well. Yeah, absolutely. Kerry's done the embossing folder with this one. Oh, and then using the metallic marker, picked out all of those gorgeous stars. How stunning does that look? Absolutely sensational. This one um, has got the glitter paste on there where you've used the glitter paste through that stencil so that you can create that lovely effect. And if I just hold that there, how beautiful are these? This is another lovely one Kerry's done, simple clean and simple and it looks absolutely exquisite it really really does of course i mean i do love that i'm not gonna lie that is a stunning sample to show you the kind of things that you can be doing with it and of course if you did catch the one o'clock show this afternoon you'll have seen me create this using those foil transfers as well and i showed you how to do a very simplistic way of using that rub on transfer Brilliant. Can I just check? I don't know if you know, if you just got in, turned the TV on or maybe just turned on this evening to watch what we're up to. Um, 
about half past five, just after half past five, we launched our last Frankfurt deal. If you've not been watching over the last few days, you won't know this, but basically Scott, our MD, uh, Andy and Liam have been over in Frankfurt at this huge, huge craft event, um, showcasing, of course, all the new craft goodies and new craft suppliers that hopefully we're going to have on Hobby Maker in the weeks and months to come. And every evening at around about half five, they've done a price slash. Um, and today is the last one, okay? At half past five, Scott, Andy and Liam decided that they wanted to offer you the jigsaw die. Now the jigsaw die is a multimedia die, which means it will cut through things like mount boards. So what did they decide to do? They decided to give you 20 sheets of mount board as well. So you get 20 sheets of mount board and you get this multimedia die that will turn your heart into a heart jigsaw. It should be over 20 pounds you're gonna get one of these elements free because it's only 9.99 and with Valentine's Day around the corner, if you're getting orders for Valentine's cards, if you can all offer your friends or your relatives the opportunity of being able to make a Valentine's or a heart-shaped jigsaw is quite incredible. Nearly half the stock of a big stock is gone. It could be that you want to put a photograph onto the mount board. We recommend use Stick and Stay, which is the permanent spray adhesive that we had on the show. Lots of people have ordered that. I think we may have even got quite close to selling that out. I think we've got one left of the stick and stay, so check that out your basket quickly. Uh, but yeah, for 9 99 if you weren't with us at half past five, check it out. You can make anything into a jigsaw now. You've got the mount board and you've got uh, the heart die. And remember, you can actually get two of the heart jigsaws out of one of these sheets of mount board. So from the 20, you can make 40 heart jigsaws. It could be your new pet that you want to send to friends and relatives to show off. It could be that you've just got engaged or it's an anniversary coming up. You've got a favorite photograph of the first place you went on a date or your first anniversary holiday or whatever it might be. Anything can be made into a jigsaw heart shape now, whether you keep it all put together or whether you separate all the pieces, put them in an envelope and let the person who receives it put it together. It's a great idea, a great concept. Half the stock went when we launched this at half past five, that should be, price-wise, that die should be $12.99. So for two pounds, three pounds less, you're getting that die and you're getting the 20 sheets of mount board, which normally doesn't come with it, but today it does. Make a 10-piece puzzle. Won't take you long to solve it, but you know what? It's a bit unusual. And you can play around with the pieces. You can take one piece out and maybe have it stuck further down the card. You can um, have certain pieces risen and others not. Uh, you can have it complete. I mean, it's a great, great idea. Very novel, very different. And it's something that you can enjoy working with and offer to your friends and family and to customers if you do sell what you make. Um, yeah, it's very unique. JC2047. Okay, let's go back to our Cosmic then. Just wanted to update you on that in case you weren't watching at half past five. Single figure stock. Now we've literally got, I think, four left of the Cosmic. It is going to sell out any minute now. So good luck. I hope you get it. Right, Debs. You know what? I'm going to switch round because I've realised I've lost my plate combination. So let's bring back in our oh, MIDI. Why not? Why not? Because I can't find all my plates. So let's come in. Um, and I'm going to use the uh, mystical frame one. Now, I'm not going to use the stencil. I am just going to use the fabulous uh, die cut element to it. And let's run that through our die cutting machine. I love this machine. All of these will go through, actually. I, I promise you, it will go through all of the um, things that you're seeing, including all your embossing folders mm -hmm. um, as well. So I'll just give that a little tap. We will remind you of this Gemini MIDI deal before the end of the show at seven, because it's the unique, uh, exclusive machine to us. You won't find this anywhere else, this color. And it's, we're calling it Mojito, but also think of it as pistachio. It's a green, like a lime green rather than a yellow. If it looks a yellow on your screen, I can assure you it's not. Absolutely, it's got that gorgeous, honestly, it's absolutely stunning. When you see it, when you get it home, you'll understand what we mean. Now, I'm just going to run through uh, using some of the cardstock because I'm going to create a little bit of a background with this one as well, Dave. Move all this out of the way because I've already got a few bits cut out ready. Um, just because I knew we'd got so much to get through, I knew it was going to take a bit of time to yep. get through it all. Um, embossing folder-wise, let me just push that down there. I'll bring in the Cosmic um, Constellation. 
Yeah, it gets me too. gorgeous. Um, and I'm going to run that through now, my embossing folder. So this is a 2D embossing folder. You are going to bring in your plastic shim, yeah. the one shim, not the folder, and run that through. And that's so all you need? All you need, simply. It's, it's the simple, simplest simple, plate simple. formations with the MIDI. Yes, it, really is. it is. It really is incredibly simple to do. And you get this lovely embossed detail design. And I'm going to pop that over the top to create that lovely um, piece at the back, just to give it a nice solid and also that constellation. It's just decoration to be fair, but mm. how beautiful does that look? Beautiful. Um, star wise, get your stars out, run your stars through your machine. Now, of course, if it's a die cutting machine, you're going to pop it back into the folder system. So you're going to bring back in your folders. Now I've remembered that I cut on the other side, so I'm going to turn it back over. I'm going to be trying to do this balancing because there we go. I knew that was going to happen. I'll just cut a few out, Dave. I'll <laughs> cut a few out. Um, and I'm just going to pop that in. Now, if you want to hold it down with some low tack tape, you absolutely can do. But the lovely thing about the folder, because it's so simple, you can just hold that down, hold the dice together when it, you're running it through. It kind of grabs it, doesn't it? Yeah, and it almost like, so you don't always have to use things like your tape. If you don't feel comfortable doing that though, by all means, absolutely do that. I've just run through those three of those stars through there and I'm just going to, don't make me laugh, Ellie. <laughs> um, I've got my stars through there as well. The things you hear, I, I, honestly, the things you hear in our ears, Dave, the things that I swear they try and put us off. <laughs> I, I feel like they're doing it on a purpose. <laughs> I think but, that's been the case for years. I know. <laughs> yeah. He's always been the same, that shimmy Jimmy. As long as I've known him, he's always been the same. Yeah. Uh, right, so you've got all your stars there. And again, I've got my few pieces. Um, what I've done, I'll just move that out of the way for a second, um, is I've got myself a little TP card done. Now, I've already put mine together, so I'll just show you how I did it, Dave, for, for a bit of speed. Um, I took three pieces of cardstock. They all measure at six by six. Yep. And then I turned it on that diamond shape and put a score line top to bottom diagonal. And I did that on all three pieces. To create this style of card, and it's one of my favourites, I absolutely love this, um, is very, very simple. You are going to have this one in the diamond shape mm -hmm. and these two in the square and use your glue to glue those pieces together. So you've got like this almost diamond oh, and that's okay. what folds it through. Now I didn't want to, I wanted to speed it up so I stuck it all down together but that's as simple as it goes and you can do small, medium, large, you can go as big as you want. If you just remember that rule of thumb, three of them, diagonal fold, just pop that in the diamond shape and then square them off. And that creates that TP fold. Or it could be a pyramid or whatever. Pyramid yeah. card, yeah, you'll hear it often referred to as that. Um, I've already stuck mine down, so mine's already been glued together. And I've also done a, a little bit of a hook and loop to connect it together as well. I'm just going to lay it flat because what I'm going to do is bring in my mats and my layers. So I've already, I'm very frugal, let me tell you, paper trimmer, extracting the middle. Yep. That's a new word we're coming up with. Um, better than gutting. Oh, it is. I've never liked it's that. It's awful. Yeah. It last, I kept saying it last night and somebody came up with the word extraction and I thought, oh my God, I'm using that. Um, this one I've actually stenciled through using the glitter paste. I took one of the stencils, popped it through. Because of the fact that it, it obviously doing it here would be leave it to be wet, I had to let that dry because um, it does dry. And if you can hear, really, really fabulous. It's absolutely stunning. So I'm going to pop that onto that side and these two I'm going to have... Um, coming down the centre here. So I'll bring in my glue and um, I'm going to just glue those panels in. There I go. I love this collection and I'm just so glad you do as well. Um, we don't have many left at all. What, what are we down to now, Ellie? Oh, still five. Okay, that's a big bundle. But I tell you what, lots of you going for the 12 by 12s and the 6 by 6s uh, A few of you are talking to the call centre right now. So as soon as you confirm your order, that will then go down to 43210. It's not going to be available later on tonight, that's for sure. Well, no, because you do your repeat shows through the night because that's when I tend to watch. Exactly, um, yeah. I have it um, on at night time. So, yeah, and I know that because people work at different hours, different times, mm -hmm. don't they come in at different... If they're you know, not busy with kids, they do it at the night time because it's, it's quieter for them. Yep. They can do the but shopping so often piece. our offers can sell out during the live shows they and can, I know that's yeah. frustrating for you but uh. yeah absolutely so I'm just sticking all of these panels down Dave um, and again I'm just making sure I've got a little bit of wet glue to be able to do that because when you fold this in now we fold that up and I'll just do it I know you should let it dry but you get the gist 
you get this gorgeous. Well, it looks like a rocket taking off now. Yeah, I think I think that's what I was drawn to. Yeah. Um, using that, I'm going to keep that on the back, and I think what I'm going to do is put this onto the front. So I'm just going to. Oh. Do you know what else it's reminded me of? Together. Star Trek badge. The shape of the Star Trek. Badge I like that, love isn't it? that. Very similar. Yeah. Absolutely. Don't you run out of me now, dotty tape pen. Do not run out of me now. I bet you any money I ain't got another one. I've got one here. Oh, I've got, have you got a dotty? I've got, yeah. Oh, it's all right. Let me try this one, right. Dave. Let me try this one. Oh, typical, isn't it? Pull one out of your bag. Stop. It's not going to work. <laughs> um, dotty tape pen's going to be your best friend for these, actually, Dave. This is um, a lovely in intricate die set. And just attach that onto the front. And then I'm going to pop that onto the front part of my card. So deciding, I'll have that as my front. I'm going to hold that into there. And I'm going to put my sentiment running through the center of it as well. Friends are like stars. You can't always see them, but they are always there. Mm -hmm. Isn't that a lovely, lovely. sentiment? Yeah. Absolutely. Um, I'm going to use my straight um, I can tape. can see the glitter paste that you put through the stencil. Wow, that's picking up the light. It is, yeah. And I'll, I'll show you that in a second because it really is absolutely beautiful um i'm going to anchor that a little bit there we go um make sure i've got all my bits down um i would normally use foam pads at this point but i can see time is it's running away with us again dave and got it's 10 minutes away. left i know and i've seen our lovely sandra dashing back yep in. Um, I'm just going to put that there and then I'm going to add all of my stars. I've popped myself a little moon. So I've been die cutting. I did say earlier on today, I never know when to stop with the stars. So I always cut loads out. Well, They're absolutely you can't overdo phenomenal. it with the stars. Of course you can't. Absolutely. They, you know, they really are. Oh, they just... I can see me using this out of the whole collection and the more star, often than not. And the stars are great because if someone's achieved something, you know, at school when you used to get gold stars, if you've done a good essay or whatever, a, a star is associated with positivity and congratulations. Yeah, you've absolutely. And I'm just going to, I have put foam pads on these, so I'm just going to take off my foam pads and add them around onto her places. So one Did down you get there. many gold stars at school? Uh, yeah, I was a good girl at school, Dave. Oh, yeah. I was. I was a very good girl. Yeah. Uh, only at school. Since only then. at school. Since then, <laughs> it's all gone downhill. Uh, yeah, so at, at school, I was a very good girl. <laughs> Behaved myself, got my head down, uh, knuckled down to all my exams. And uh, yeah, um, yeah, I, I, I was not teacher's pet, but I, were, I, I wasn't one of the naughty ones. <laughs> mm -hmm. I remember those well. Although I know all of them still now, some of my school friends, they... And they're still the same. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so what I'm doing is just literally adding this as a little bit of a design all the way around. So I'm going to just continue to do that, Dave. I saw someone in um, a shopping centre car park where I live down on the south coast. Yeah. From my class at school. Hadn't seen him for 35 years. 30 really? Yeah. yeah. He just oh, called my God. name out. Is that Dave? Didn't oh. Really pretty sweet. Have you ever heard of the school reunions? They, no, our school doesn't exist anymore. So they oh, don't does do it, it not? No. Oh, no. I didn't realise that, Dave. Yeah. It's a block of flats now, I think. <laughs> As most things are. <laughs> well, yeah, that old car parks. Yep. That been, they've literally been popped down. Um, I'm going to put a few of these smaller ones on, so I'm just going to um, bring in my tacky glue for this. Um, just, and I've got a little picky-up pen just to add a few little extras um, onto there as well. And I've got one of these. These are from, uh, is it Sticks 2, I think it is. Uh, people always often ask me. On oh, the pickup. But pen. I know that the pickup, I know that Ailey does one, doesn't she? We do, um, yes, the Pearl pickup tool from Dreamies. Yeah, That's yeah, because I keep saying I need to get hold of one, but they keep selling out ones. Have you got some in stock? Yes. Oh, wow. I think so. I know what I'm going to be getting. Yeah, because oh, I, I, I yeah, they're, I think the five ninety nine. It's what I use for my model making. It's brilliant. Really yeah, good. definitely. Dreamies. Is she looking for it now? She's gonna yeah. have a little peek, isn't she? Gonna have a rummage. Yeah. See if you find it. Pick a pick rummage. You you could be rummaging a while. That website of yours is absolutely massive. There is a lot on there. It's like going down a little rabbit hole, isn't mm -hmm. it? When you get on there. Oh yeah. Um, I, do you know what? I'm going to stop. I'll, I'll pop a few more on, but I'm just going to stop because if you literally can the get carried tool. away. We found uh, it. Five ninety nine. <laughs> Reserve one for Debbie, please. Thank yes, you please. Uh, but there you go. A lovely little uh, TP, almost like a little rocket card, actually. Um, and just showing you what you can be doing with this fabulous, fabulous collection. 
I love it. I love the collection. Um, we are down to single figure stock. We, if we don't sell out completely in the show before seven, it's not going to be available later on. It's pretty obvious. We've got four left now. The next four of you to check out your baskets at 199. If you don't want split pay, you can, of course, uh, split it into four interest free payments if you want to. Okay, 49.75 your first payment of four, or you can pay in full on debit or credit card. Choice is yours. Free phone number. So uh, it's free to phone the call center. The call center isn't in a far flung part of the world. It's just out outside Birmingham, uh, Redditch, and it's upstairs. And they're 24 hours a day. And remember, if ever you make an order and you've done something uh, incorrect or you want to change your order, you want to add something to it, we had a question about that earlier on, just call the call centre because all your orders don't get charged until midnight. So all of the orders, the computer system puts the orders together that you've made during the day. Make sure you only pay one PMP of 395. If you bought something from Sandra, Sandra will dispatch it to you. If you bought something from Debbie, then Crafters Companion will dispatch it to you. So they will arrive in separate parcels, but your PMP always only ever stays one PMP of three pound ninety-five. <coughs> JC two oh four seven is the item number, and that is the oh the jigsaw one. Ah, right, right, right. Yeah. Okay. So this is your Frankfurt deal. Remember. <laughs> Yeah, Frankfurt deal. The guys have been in Frankfurt uh, getting new suppliers and new um, fantastic um, goodies for us to play with and to show you during the year. Uh, it's a three or four day event. Today was the last day and this is the last special reduction that Scott, Andy and Liam wanted to do for you. We tried to link up with them, but the signal wasn't that great. So we just decided to go with it. And Scott said, OK, take it to 9.99. And that's what we've done. And this is a jigsaw die. It's that, that. It's a multimedia die, so it will cut through multiple layers of all sorts of things, including you can cut through your mount board. Now, with the size of the die, you can actually get two heart jigsaws out of that size of mount board. So you can actually make 40 heart jigsaws for $9.99. And then you've still got the die that will just keep on cutting jigsaws again and again and again. This jigsaw die on its own is normally $12.99. So you're getting a discount on the die and you're getting the mount board free. And yes, you can easily stick pictures and make them into your own handmade jigsaws. Just use stick and stay. That's what uh, uh, Debbie was recommending. So JC2047 is the item number. Now we've got four minutes to remind you of the brilliant Gemini MIDI. Now this is a portable go anywhere, non-electric, hand-operated die cutting and embossing machine. This you will not get anywhere else. You can find it elsewhere in different colors. This color has been manufactured by Crafters Companion just for us. It is the brilliant mojito. It's like a pistachio. It's a lime green. It's not, it's not yellow, okay? $69.99. It's an incredibly easy machine to use and it's got the simplest plate system that Debbie will show you again in a second. But the deal today is you're gonna get your embossing folder and you're gonna get your really intricate lace border die included as well, all for the price of just the machine. So those two things there are free. You're not paying for them. Love that. $69.99 and it's on two split payments as well. VD2043. You can buy the machine on its own as well on our website, but why would you do that? Because it's $69.99 without the embossing folder and the die. But if you go for that item code, VD2043, it will come with the free gifts. And I'm just going to remind you of the things that you can cut, because this yeah. is what we did at the start of the show. Um, you're going to be able to cut out intricate dies one pass of your machine in your um, die cutting folder, which is very, very easy to do. Um, we've done uh, regular embossing with the plastic shim that comes in there. So you can do your regular embossing. You can do your 3D embossing. I've just changed the color, Dave, because I went happy with the white one, so I've changed the color. 3D, you can do your cutting embossing through there as well. You can actually emboss stencils through. That was an embossed stencil. We've cut through metal. We've cut through real leather with the multimedia dies and we cut through not one, not two, not three, but four pieces of material at the same time because you can absolutely do that. But the thing I would recommend, if that's what you're going to do, make sure you purchase an extra, yeah. extra folder for your multimedia dies. Um, it is simplicity without the electricity. It's the, it's the most pressure pressure we can put into a manual machine and you've got this gorgeous glorious fruity zesty color that you simply can't get anywhere else it's gonna it add just for here it's gonna add a splash of spring to your craft room definitely and of course you can take it with you on the train you can use it on the tables in the train if you want to if you've got like a motorhome or a caravan now if you do want an extra plate i mean the, this is the great thing about these folders um you will need extras going forward they will need to be replaced eventually but we've got these in stock right now if you want it on 
its own. Half the stock has gone and it's only 8 99 8.99 for an extra folder, but if you are using multimedia dies, of which, of course, the, um, the heart-shaped uh, jigsaw die is a multimedia die, make sure you use one folder for multimedia and just multimedia, and then use the other folder that you've got for your standard thin dies. It'll just make them last that much longer. Have one for your multimedia, have another one for your ultimate thin dies, and you should be absolutely fine. Uh, 8.99 for that, and we have also got the purple plastic shim as well which of course, again, is a replaceable, is a consumable. Uh, we've got that for 4 dollars It's exactly the same, although it's purple. The one you get with your machine will be clear, but it's exactly the same and does the same thing. That's what you'll add and use with two-dimensional embossing folders. Absolutely, okay? yeah. Uh, 4 for that, if you know you need an extra one of those, uh, and that is QT2056 is the product code for that, okay? Thanks, Debs. Thank you very much. Just star. Uh, Thank you, and I'll see you in February. Oh, not until then. Oh, well, it's nearly oh, February. It's only now, nearly it? February. It's a couple of days away. Days so, away. yeah, February. I'll see you in February. Yeah, we've got a nice message quickly before we say Jurio to this show. Uh, this is for Debbie. Sally oh. in West Yorkshire says, I've got this machine and it's changed my crafting, i.e. I can craft anywhere. Love it. Thanks, Debbie, for your wonderful demos. Just oh, love watching you. Oh, thank you, Sally. That's really sweet. Thank you very much. Big crafty hugs and the little heart shake there. you to go uh, home thank with you. a smile on your face. Uh, but absolutely. I'll be, I'll be driving up there, despite the traffic and road closures, with a great big smile. <laughs> Thank you very much, Sally. That's very kind. Okay, what a wonderful way to end our evening as well. Coming up next, we've got Sandra and Santangle, and we were going to show you uh, kind of a roundup of some of the highlights of the day from Sandra. So don't go anywhere. Back in about two minutes. UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Here at Hobbymaker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and checkout and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24-7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Head over to your app store now and search Hobbymaker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today's button to shop all of the products that are featured in today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking here for our social media pages. So never miss a show by watching On The Go with our brand new Hobbymaker app. Shopping with Hobbymaker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.hobbymaker.co.uk where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your craft room essentials to paper, tools, cutting machines and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Hobbymaker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Hobbymaker. Alternatively, you can call our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 001 4433. Shopping made easy at Hobbymaker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, 
along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. What a lovely way to end the evening. We've got a great hour ahead of ourselves with lovely Sandra and a bit of sand tangling. I know thousands and thousands of you have got bitten by the bug, myself included. It is a bit addictive, isn't it? It's not just <laughs> in a, a good way. In oh, a good yeah, absolutely. Way. <laughs> it's the best addiction to have. Believe me, it really, really is. Now, something that you may or may not be aware of, um, the sand tangle badges. That, did you bring these out at Christmas? Christmas, yeah, Christmas. Yeah, we still have some. So everybody that orders, well, we've still got them. Okay. We still put them in. I mean, um, you, there is a code on the back, so you can only actually use the code once. So right. if you already got a badge, you've already code. used it. Yeah. yeah. So anyway. if you order in this show or if you've ordered today, as long yeah. as there is stock available, Sandra is very generously going to put this pin mm. in with your order with anything that you order. There it is. There it is. Look at that. Making the impossible art possible. And the discount code will be on the back of the packaging. So don't throw the packaging no, away. Yeah. And you can use that on one day only, right the way through. Uh, choose a day when you want to buy something. Yeah, maybe you've got till June. Yeah, so fantastic. Loads of time. Yeah. So, yeah, just thought I'd let you know that. Right, now, we're talking book two, first of all. Right, okay. now, book two. Getting creative with your frames, book two, is here. Tell us about this, Sandra. This is it's just one of those books that work. You know, we, we, we see everything that's been done in classes and people love it because they don't know what they're going to do until they get there. This is almost like um, each project is like a class in okay. its own right. So we use the frames. Now, when you see me use an oval frame, for example, today, all these images are created with frames. Yeah. And the special thing about book two is you've got four unique frames that we don't sell anywhere else. We don't sell as separate. Well, they come with the book? They only come with the book. Okay. So they're all a little bit different. And so you can see that all the artwork. I mean, if you flick to the back, Dave, it does show you um, the artwork when they're finished. And I say these are just from oh, frames. Oh, my word. So you word. get an outline and you also get a coloured version. So you can see how I've done it. Look. Oh. And then you can actually see how it's been coloured. So I mean, that one's got... The dragonfly in it of course you'll already have the dragonfly stencil but it shows how you can integrate other things but you you get instructions for drawing all of those i mean you wouldn't think looking at the finished pieces that a, a frame was involved really on some no. of them no um, and you are going to get the frames included so yep. these are the frames that will be included inside the book they are. as well so imagine that as a mandala mm. i mean that is just lovely you can go again from a two inch all the way up to about an eight inch that kind of thing so you could use them as you is your frames for cards. You don't have to use them as the artwork. You can mix and match. They're just fantastic, aren't they? Yes. How many are there? Four. Four. Yeah, four. That one as well. Yeah, there we go. four frames. John calls that the racetrack. Yeah, I can see why. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> but, but they yeah. make great chain links, they do. And how much are uh, stencils normally like this? Uh, stencils are the frames are 15 99 I think, something okay. like that. So, so you get four. Yeah. Plus so that be, would be about £60 worth of stencils. Yeah, yeah. Plus you've got the book... For forty three sixty five, yeah. What a deal! Yeah. Do you know it, it's a really nice way if you're a little bit unsure of frames or you think I've got some frames, don't know what to do with them. These give you that sort of instruction into creating your own unique pieces of artwork. Now I, I, I know we're talking to an awful lot of people who know exactly what Sandra is about and what Santangle is about. But for those of you that have never seen Sandra before or Santangle before, don't know what we're talking about. It's basically posh. Doodling yeah. is the best way of describing it. And what these frames are going to give you um, are the building blocks to start your wonderful picture, your wonderful uh, work of art. So, and, and, and what I love about you is that you take it right from step one. Absolutely, yeah. So if you've never done it before, no. you look at the first picture, you look at the words, and the words are not technical at all. It gives you black and white, really. This is how you do it. This is what you do. But... Don't think you have to do it exactly the same as me if you don't want to. You no. can change things out. You can mix things up a little bit. And that's what I've noticed over the years that I've known you is that a lot of people start copying exactly what you've yeah. done word yeah. for word and line for line, which is fine. Yeah. But then when their confidence suddenly goes through the roof because they've I know. done a, a, yeah, an amazing... Yeah, you see that light bulb yeah, yeah. come on and they're like, oh my God, look I what I can do. And suddenly you, you've got frames and tangles going on everywhere. It's really exciting. So this, this is that. the best of both worlds because you've yeah. got the book for all the tutorials but you've also...
also got the stencils as well. So she, Sandra gives you everything you need to get started and then just follow step by step by step by step all those individual images. And before you know it, you've actually then got a finished work of art. So spectacular value for money. When you consider the stencils themselves should be over 60 pounds. Get all four of them, plus you get the book, 43 pounds and 65 pence. BF1298 is your item number. Now, this was brand new today. The stencil set on its own. Okay, so we're talking about this first, is that what you mean? Uh, that one. That one first, okay. Yeah. Is it the bundle, Ellie? Just the set, all right, that's you, so it's that so one, just yeah. Just the book? Yeah, just the book. Okay, just the book, no just stencils. Just the book, yeah. Okay, so the plain card book on its own. We'll give you details of this if you want it. And um, so many people, my, my other half included, just spends, whenever we have relatives come to stay, first thing, get the playing cards out. Yeah, it's one of those things that we, we all know in one form or another, even if we've only ever used them to play snap. It says playing card stencil set. Yeah, it's just, yeah because so, you get a set of stencils. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hang on. So you get these as well? So you get those, or not, not those, you get those? These, right. Yeah, so you get five stencils with it. That's what confused me. Yeah. Okay, so you get, <laughs> yeah, here you get your numbers. We'll show you the stencils first. You're then going to get your ace. You're then going to get your diamonds. You're then going to get your clubs. And you're then going to get your hearts as well. So those are coming with this at $21.99. Uh, now, Rebecca in Merseyside, uh, hang on just a sec, because we have got the background stencils coming up as well. And we're doing a bundle with those as well, aren't we? So let's just open this up to show you. If you love playing cards, if that's your favorite family pastime or someone in the family is always sitting down playing poker, whatever, patience. It would be amazing it. doing a whole deck, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be great? Yeah. I mean, that would, that would time, be dedication. It. Yeah, it would, but you know what? It would look amazing. But to you know, do maybe someone's birthday, yeah. to do a two and a eight for someone's 28th birthday or milestone birthdays, anniversary, like yeah, that, milestone. Yeah, dates and stuff. How cool is this? Well, we were talking about this earlier as well, Dave, because you've got, I've, I've done each of the four sort of cards, but I've done them in a different style. Right. So what you could do, so say you like the pattern for the diamonds, you could take that pattern and transfer it over to the hearts ah, or the you. spades. So okay. you've got lots more information in there that you could mix and match them all together. And then, of course, you've got one of them that shows you all the different little ones together. So they are the, they are the samples if you want to. Let's just have a look through these. That's all the originals, what I drew to sort of create the, the instructions with. Look at that. They are, they are really nice. I really had fun with these. It's so different. Look at that and one, it's all again, the different shapes. It's yeah. just lovely, isn't it? Taking your sand tangle journey to a totally different area, into entertainment, into car playing, absolutely, absolutely. beautiful. Look at those. We were saying you know, that could be like a key going into Lockett Lane, couldn't it? It that could one? be, yeah, absolutely it could. It's really sort of a bit different, isn't it? Okay, so twenty-one ninety-nine for the book and of course the stencils for the actual uh, fantastic cards. But then we've got two background stencils as well. So if you fancy these, again, full of all the shapes that you associate with all the suits. Now they are £12.49 for the background stencils on their own, not today. They're gonna to be for both of them, just 10.99. VB1202 is the product code for that. And again, you can do all sorts with them. You can obviously draw through them. You can ink through them, use your uh, fantastic distress inks and that sort of thing, or your oxides. You can even use them as like a, an emboss as well. But we're telling you not to put this in your basket yet because we had a bundle that nearly sold out earlier on and we've had to restock it. That's what we do. That's what we do with St. Angle shows. Sorry. <laughs> Don't apologize. It should be £35.70. So you're going to get the background stencils. You're going to get the main stencils for the suits. You're going to get the book with all the inspiration. The whole lot, £27.49. LA1259 is the item. But how exciting, how much fun is this going to be? And you're saving basically about eight pounds, eight pounds fifty off the price today. And this did sell out earlier on. Yeah, it's, it's so much fun. I've mm. really, really enjoyed this one. Um, I've wanted to do it for a long time, and it's always been at the back of my head. And I, I, okay, I'm going to do this. How am I going to work it? Sure. And it just light bulb goes on. You're like, yeah, that's what we're going to do. But also, if you struggle sometimes, I'm not saying that card 
playing is for men, um, but if you do struggle with cards for teenagers, for gentlemen, and, and certain ladies too, someone that you know that loves playing cards, even if it's just patience or whatever, poker, um, 21, whatever your game, have you got, do you play cards? No, I, not really, uh, now I draw. All oh, the time. Yeah, that, that's your pastime. <laughs> I must admit, whenever I go on holiday, my other half always plays cards with people that are on holiday with us. But yeah. I, I'm not interested. Yeah. I love, I love the yeah, shape of yeah. these and the design of them. Yeah, the design's just lovely. That's, yeah, that's where my thing is. I, I draw all the time. Yeah, exactly. Twenty-seven forty-nine. Brand new today. Restocked after a sellout earlier on this afternoon. If you're at work or you just couldn't watch earlier today, I know lots of you do watch. Uh, all of Sandra's shows. Uh, get in touch, say hello if you want to. Message in via our website at uh, hobbymaker.co.uk and get involved in the show. It'd be lovely. I think lots of people take coffee breaks when, you, when you're on in the afternoon. I know. <laughs> watch on their phones. Yes. Things like that. So, 2749, yeah. hello, Christine in Shropshire, Rebecca in Merseyside, Anna in Highland, Tracy in Cornwall, Sarah in Hampshire coming through. Hi there. Think, That's going to be perfect for whoever in the family because you know that they love their playing cards. 2749, and it's yours. Okay, so we're going to do a demo from book two, yeah. yeah? I'm going to use the book two, but I'm going to use the playing cards as well. Okay. Because, again, it, it's, it's nice to mix things up, and you've got instructions for, for everything in here, but it's just nice to sort of have a look at the bow. So we've got this one, this lovely shape here, this five-sided. So I thought I'd mix this up, and uh, let's see where it goes, shall okay. we? Yeah, okay. right. So what have, I, uh, what have I done then? I've drawn it. Now, I haven't used the outer edge. I've used a smaller version of it. So I've drawn it in, got the, the little frame. I've put all my dots in. See, dots are on all of them. That's just because it depends what size you want to work to. Right. So you only need to put one lot of dots in it. And what I've done there is I've actually used it just to sort of give me a little bit of a break up around the outside. So, so I know the dots are there to kind of give you the construction different lines. Sections. And it yeah. sorts out the perspective kind of thing. Mm -hmm. So if you put it on, you put your little dot in the middle, all the lines go to the dot. You find that as you work your way around, you've got a nice sort of shape. And but just from my point of view, what made sense to me when I started to draw, and it was Sandra that gave me the confidence to do it, it made me really, really appreciate, rather than looking at the big... Yeah. picture look so, at the small section as a small picture at a time and then exactly. those little small pictures develop into becoming a big picture uh, then that's all it is so by breaking this up we've taken a shape and we've got little shapes within it so i've got my flat at the bottom and i've got my point at the top mm -hmm. but what i'm going to do is turn it round a little bit i've put my mark in the middle there line it up again and this time i've turned it round see so i've got my flat at the top and my point at the bottom and i'm going to bring one in here now what i'm going to do is bring this side out of that original frame and then this one is going to go inside let's Ooh. have a look there you know that restocking we did a oh right yeah cards. yeah quarter of the stock gone oh gosh okay the playing cards okay all right it, they are they are lovely they're, they're really, great they're something really different nice. for you as well yeah, and I, I like to do that. I don't, I don't like to be predictable. I like to do something different. Uh, and this is the nice thing with these. You can look at it and you think, well, do you know what? I'm going to do it my way. Mm -hmm. I don't need to worry about what other people are doing or anything else. See, I would put the dots in this normally as well, but I've just done it without so you can see. You see, this side's coming out. Yep. And that side's... Tucked under. Tucking under. Mm -hmm. uh, really simple when you think about it. Just going to get rid of those little lines there as well, so you can actually see what I've got going on there. Okay, let's just. I was just thinking get today, actually, when I was talking to you outside in between uh -huh. shows, I was thinking I don't know a single person that hasn't been able to do sandtangle. I know. I mean, some people you think, okay, they they might um, struggle with a certain element of it, but everybody has one that's like their nemesis, mm -hmm. and we all have a pattern. And we think, oh, just give me another ten hours, and I could probably do this. Uh, but then. On the other hand, some of them come real easy. Mm. And I think it's not, don't beat yourself up about it, you know, just go with the flow. And if you're trying something that doesn't quite work, draw it bigger, mm. draw it smaller, split your space up a bit more. But do you know what? Do it in pencil. A plain sheet of white paper or cardstock is incredibly daunting. Yeah. You're thinking, well, what do I do first? Where do I begin? That's where the stencils come in. Exactly. And that's what starts you off, even if it's a basic one and you use a, a pencil and a bit of rough paper mm. and you sort of s sketch out the shape, so to speak. Because that's the toughest thing. Where do I start? That's yeah. why the stencils are there. Yeah, exactly. See what I've done? Like I've put a curve yep. in each one, missed one, then a curve, missed one, then a curve. Yep. And I can come back down and do the same again. See? 
Okay. You're doing pencil. Normally you do pen straight away. I do normally do pen straight away. But sometimes it's it's nice. I, I want to do this, then I'll do the, the, the space, the spade that I'm going to do in pencil, pen so you can see it. There you go. Playing cards, yeah. restocked, 30% plus yeah. now gone. So you can see that I'm creating these new shapes. So I've got something different going around the outside. Mm. And as you sort of create it, you see here we start to add more and more detail in and it starts to create something a little bit different. So I do the same in here. I mean, for now, I'll just sort of draw some lines there because I want to show you how you could integrate something else. So we've got a frame, slightly unusual. So let's bring in the spade. Okay. okay? Like, mm -hmm. How does this work? So no normally, and this is again why I don't like to be predictable, you'd put something in the middle of a frame, wouldn't you? Yeah. I like things to come out and, and interconnect. So what I'm going to do is, let's have a look here. I'm going to choose, you see, I've actually got three sizes. So this works a little bit like a frame as well. It's so good that you've got that option, large, yeah, medium, small. Exactly. It's, it's nice to sort of mix and, mix and match, isn't it? So here we go. Let's put this one. I'm going to put it in. Just use that smaller one and then this one and put it behind what's going on here. I need to sharpen my pencil a bit. Let's put that one in as well. And then here, I'm going to just show the bottom there. So let's see what I've done here. You see, so I've got part of it sitting yeah. on the inside there. Let's just sketch that little bit in. And then here at the bottom, I've got the actual stand coming in, so I can then remove that. So you see, it's, it's almost like... Um, Illusions again, isn't it? Because things are going in and out and around each other. And we talked about this being a little bit locket lane like mm -hmm. earlier. Just going to put that extra line in there. You could put like a little keyhole here. So it's a little bubble look. Because it fits in with that shape beautifully. Look at that. Let's just fill that in. Perfect. Yeah. So yeah. again, that's come over the top. So illusion wise, you're like, whoa, what's going on here? How's this work? So let's bring a few more in. I'm going to bring the pen in now. Let's have. This one here, come in here. and let's draw that one in there. We have got um, lots of you watching us abroad as well. If you are watching us in oh, the USA, hi. you too can order. Sandra does ship to the USA. Um, we've got a crafter in Massachusetts. Hi there. Us. Hello to you. Hi. Okay, see, so I can put that shape in there as well. Now we did um, a bit of a shape early with the club and we've got sort of like some lines coming around here. Mm -hmm. Come there. Oh, drew a new pen here. And then what we did, we drew a little bubble, put a line and a line, and then down and down, you see? Mm -hmm. And then if I come around and create little sort of triangles in each one, okay? A couple of little lines in there. And you create little little flowers, you see? So it's so easy it, yeah. when you see how to do it. Yeah, and if I just look at the club card, there you go, see? See, they're all sort of sitting in there. Yeah. So you can uh, you can bring that pattern into one of those shapes if you want to. Beautiful. But let's look at this one a little bit more. And what if I, I'm going to draw that in with pen. I said I wanted to draw one in pencil, one in pen, so you can see where one's working in. So you've got the idea. Let's put that one in. Again, I'm drawing this very quickly, so um, there we go, and that one. So that's the shape we've got going on there. So if I do a double line, there you go, one there. The stock of the playing cards, by the way, is going very fast. I'm not one surprised. 27.49 for the stencils, the background stencils oh, as well. There you go. So I've got a bit of a line going around. It's a nice little frame shape. And again, this is on some of the instructions. I think it's on the heart one, actually, that you do this little frame and put lots of sort of curls in it. But I'm going to leave that one as is. And I'm going to focus on this little shape in the middle here. Because what we can actually do with this, let's go and around. You know, sometimes I'll go around a shape. Yeah. So let's, let's go around the shape and create a bit of a curve here. Did, um, I meant to ask you, curvy. did Dobby um, return from his Well, he did. Uh, he's supposed to have been, yeah, tomorrow, coming in with Pauline tomorrow, but Pauline dropped him off this morning, and I think he'd been abandoned. Oh, really? But then she did come in and say, here he is, because, I don't know, he got no trousers on this morning when he arrived. 
But he's, he, he has now, but he's a little bit tired now. <laughs> he's a little bit he's tired. He's been on his cruise. He yeah. stayed away in Pauline's case. He shouldn't have been on a cruise. You know, we ha he had a bit of a tantrum when we told him he wasn't going. And then I said, you can come to the studio and you can wave her off and say goodbye. And, he jumped and then the suddenly he disappeared. And there he's gone. What's he like? I know. Oh, Joanne's oh, got hi, in touch. Joanne. Hello, Joanne. Um, she says, hi, Sandra and Dave. Hi. Love the masquerade. Oh, we're getting to that in a minute, actually. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're going and back the to playing that. cards. Sandra, can you just do one great item at a time? The bank balance can't go. I'm sorry. Love your work. I have Thank so you, many Joanne. ideas. They just come out. Prices are good, though, aren't they, Joanne? Yeah. Yeah. Another message. Who else is coming through today? Uh, this is from... Jen. Uh, Jen, good evening, Sandra Hi, and Dave and the Hobby Maker crew. Hiya. Uh, fantastic temptations again. Can't wait to get mine. Thanks for my badge. I've used the discount. Oh, Jenny excellent. There you go. Yeah. Excellent. If you order and there's enough available, um, when they run out, well, they run out. But if you order something today, if there's room, you will get this badge in your order. No charge, free gift from Sandra, basically. Uh, and you'll also have a discount code on the back that you can use only on one day. Yeah, and okay. if you've already used the discount code, you won't be able to use no, it again. No, it's a one-off. It's a one-off, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you get another badge. Anyway, oh, anyway. Brilliant. So, um, done a little bit of drawing on here. I, I, I want to show you other things. I could spend the whole time on this, but you can see how it's sort of shaping up. Mm. I've got some little spades here. I've got this one in the background, but it's mixed in with the frame. Makes it for a real interesting sort of piece. So, if I had a bit of colour, if I had a bit of the background stencil, bit of glitter, yep. bit of... You could be making that. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? It's beautiful. Yeah. So you can see now where the frames interconnect and you've got that spade in the background. So don't think that just basically by buying the playing cards, that's all you can do. Go for book two, uh, getting creative with your frames. It you get, remember, mixes. the four frames included, 60 pounds worth, but you can incorporate frames from that with this and interlink things and make a unique piece of, of, of art. Now, if you want book two, that's going very fast. What's the update, Ali? Over 10% of the entire stock of book two has now gone. So you're gonna get all of these frames, of course, different sizes, and the dots are there so that you can actually kind of section off all of your frames to obviously make it that much easier to do your tangling in those smaller sections. And uh, if you want it, it's 43.65 today for all four of those frame stencils and you get the book with loads of inspiration. And remember, if you go to the back of the book, that's where you'll see lots of finished, beautiful yeah, works Yeah, so I've given art. you the outline so you could see how it looks, and then I've given you one coloured, so again, you've got an idea. But sure. do, you, do your own thing with it. I'm just giving you ideas there. That that's how I've created them, so it's nice. Half the stock on the playing cards now gone. There's step one. So you just literally choose the frame you want and then section it off. That's why the little dots are in the frame. Um, and then step two, step three, and it just continues until you take a break maybe an hour later and you think, wow, I've done uh, that. Look at that, how did yeah. I do that? I, I love that it. bit because it's like, my goodness, I didn't think I could draw. No. And, and that's what you can do. Now. Yeah, you can do this, you've got it. Okay, now we're going to move on to, we talked about Locket Lane. Well, let's move on to um, vintage keys and locks. Yeah, this is, I mean, we saw it's a Valentine's picture of this Day, one so. earlier. Absolutely, yeah. So it's just a really nice one to sort of add to your collection if you've not got it. This is, it's got so many things in it, mm. so many different possibilities. And also so many reasons why you want to do it. Key to the door, could be a new house, it could be a new relationship. Um, it's £16.38 pence for both of these stencils that give you all the outlines. And of course, the most important thing are yeah. the inspiration booklet. And again, it starts off just literally with the first simple step. That's given to you by the... Um, by the stencil and then of course Sandra then shows you how you just add a few more shapes bit by bit by bit until eventually you end up with a key that looks very much like that. Now we haven't got massive stock of this. You've got the key and you've got the lock as well but lots of images on the stencil that you can of course cherry pick and make it your own. I'll show you some finished cards. Oh they're just beautiful these are. We, we, we like this one. We keep coming back to this yes, one. Yes, yes. Look at that. Absolutely. It's just so sweet isn't it? Look at that. Yeah. And it means a lot, doesn't it? A key and a lock. It does, yeah. You can do a, a little key if you want to. There's lots of different sizes. This, I'll, I'll dem I'm going to demonstrate this one. Looks really difficult. 
And if you do want anything from Sandra when she's not here, always go to our website because there is a Santangle brand shop. Yeah. Things like the tiles, the pencils, the tortillons, all that sort of thing um, will be there if they're in stock. And you can order them at any time. Do you get lots of orders in between when you're here? Yeah, we do, yeah. Every it's, day? Uh, yeah, every, every day. Yeah. yeah, keeps us busy. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> But now it's lovely and it's nice we get a lot we get people to call calling us up and, and talking about things and we you know we we get um questions and, and all that kind of thing it's great it's great yeah right vintage key you've got so much on this it's, it's a real cool one to do and what i've done i've given you all the components so rather than say this is your key mm -hmm. you choose so i'll do a, a, a quick draw up of this and then you can sort of see how it's how it works so let's draw the first section there we go. Into there. Okay. Now on the instructions here, I actually also I do list what the separate parts are called. So this bit I'm drawing is the shank. Mm -hmm. The top bit look is the bow, and then the actual key thing is called the bit. Okay. I didn't so know that. So there we go. There's our shank, and then you can choose. I can do this one, which is what I did in the instructions. You could use this piece, you could use this one, you could use this one. So you can choose basically what shape you're going to create. So there's the bow shape. And then on my, my pieces here somewhere, do you have, there you go. Well, you said before roof. we don't have many of these and 10% of that stock over the 10% is gone already actually okay. for locks and keys. And then I can choose, see I've got different sizes. I've got little ones. These are the bits mm -hmm. and I've got a large one there. Let's put the large one on. So, you know, depending on what size card you've got, you can then create something that's going to work for you. So you've got a couple of those to choose from. And then we could put in any of the little keyholes. Let's put that one in. See, everybody buying this could do a totally unique key. Completely, totally, 100% unique. So that's how you start it. OK, I'm going to sort of slip over a few, a few more stages. Okay. So you can see I've drawn my line. I've got some little curls going in there. I've added some little sort of leaf shapes in there. But then the, the fun bit is actually creating the, the flourish around it. So if I come in here, look, I'm going to go underneath there. And I'm going to go over there, underneath. I love that technique. Yeah, and then I'm going to come out the keyhole. Yeah? Why not? Yeah. Why not? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So everyone's going to be different. So we'll put some um, curls on it. Here we go. So let's curl on the top. I know it's tempting to sit and watch Sandra. Uh, the stock of this is going quickly. And this one on the top there. Is this a good place to start if you've not done Sandra? Do you know, before? if you haven't, yeah, because there's so many different ways to do it, but I do take you step by step through mm -hmm. a few different projects. This one being uh, the one, as you can see, like you've got all the instructions showing you how I've drawn it up, how I've added the bits and pieces in place. A key it's, isn't it's daunting size-wise, is it? Really? No, it isn't. Oh. Well, you could go for this one. You yeah. could go this size. Yeah, small one. Do a small one if you wanted to. But you know, once you've tried it, and again, now I'm coming in with curls, you could put these anywhere. And you see, I'm thickening up the curls on the end. And because I'm going over the top, I've already blacked all that out. I can go over the top with it, see? Now, I love on social there. media seeing when people share what they've done. Oh, you, it's you amazing. Can, you can almost hear in their, in their message yeah. how excited they are. I know, it's lovely. And it's like, oh, this is my first post, and look what I've done. Mm. And it's just lovely. You see, I'm not particularly worried about where I'm putting these shapes. They, they're just sort of going in. And let's do one this side as well. So they don't have to be the same size, things like that. You see? And then we've got these sort of flowers and things coming off. So how do we create those? Dead easy. You look for a little V-shape. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to put a curve in between. Okay. One. Let's do two. Let's do three curves. Mm -hmm. And then on the top of that, you could colour them in. Let's colour them in so we've got a bit of a stripey effect going in there. I'm just thinking, how many times maybe have you been tempted to take up a hobby and you've been promised the earth or whatever and it's just not worked for you? With Santangle, I don't know of anyone that hasn't really benefited from doing it and hasn't achieved what they set out to achieve. If you can draw a line or a curve, yeah. you can Santangle. There's it's always a way, absolutely. And we do mention that you know, what, mine's going to be completely different to yours because we're different people. So mm. it stands to reason whatever you put on paper is going to be your version. So don't look at mine and think it will never, it will never be right. It's not right. It's not wrong. It's your version. Half stock gone on the locks and keys. It happens every time. Whenever Sandra's here, 
we struggle to keep the stock in and we keep asking for more and more and more but I know it's hard always to get those figures and because we make it ourselves yeah. you know it, it's we can remake things but it that takes time doesn't it look I've got a flower yeah That's amazing so let's put a leaf with it let's put a leaf with it here we go so we've got this line and look it shows you the steps of me actually drawing this leaf Okay. Now, if people are tempted by this and it's the first thing they've ever bought from you, first time they've ever thought about yep. doing Santangle, how do they get involved on social <gasps> media? And oh, Santangle Facebook page. Right. That's the main thing. Loop, loop the loops. That's all I'm doing here. So if you actually go on to uh, Facebook or YouTube mm -hmm. and type in Santangle, it will come up. And on there, I've got there's over 400 little tiles. The tiles, it's a little square of paper or cardstock. That's kind of your signature, isn't it? It is, tiles? and we draw these twice a week still, every every week, Tuesdays and um, Fridays at 2 o'clock. Um, we have actually got the tiles on the show if you want some. Uh, so they are available there on our website right now if you have a little yeah, look. Yeah, we've brought some blush back, I think, and a few other colours. Yeah. And, yeah, look. Look. Yeah. <laughs> And let's do another one. So the loop on the top and then loops. And each one gets a little bit bigger. Yeah. A little bit bigger. And don't worry if you've got like unsteady hands. I've got shaky hands. Yeah. Always have had. Um, but it just adds more character. It does. It doesn't look and, and out of place. Do you know, some people that can draw straight lines can't draw wavy lines. And they get really jealous of people that can. They're like, I can't do that. And so you just have to go for it. Look, leaves. So and then, of that. course, you can take it many stages further. You could go to workshops. I know there are yeah. workshops being set up around the country. You could go to Sandra's own workshop at Santangle HQ if you yeah. wanted to. Uh, there's all sorts of ways of getting involved and feeling part of the, the brilliant community. There that absolutely is, yeah. It's a lovely group. If you go on there and say, hi, I'm new to this, where do I start? You'll get loads of people that yeah. will give you hints and tips and things. And, of course, if, if you think, oh, I'm not so sure, the videos are all completely free. I mean, you go and click on one. Not now. Not now, not but while we're on the telly. Go, yeah, <laughs> you know, and, and go and go and try one and see what you think. But you see how that's starting to build. Mm -hmm. And have you have you got the key there, Dave, on the samples? If I could just show that. In the actual. Here we go. Big that, key there. This one. Yeah, the big key. Oh, the big key. Ah, that one. That one. That, that one. one. That's it. Sorry. So there we go. So it's all right. So you can see here, like a different version of it. We didn't put the leaves on, but we've actually added some colour mm -hmm. using the coloured pencils in the middle. So. Where you've seen me start, actually, if you go back to the very beginning, so where you saw the original key, mm -hmm. yeah, come in, there you go, where you've seen the original key, to what I, I've drawn or started to draw, you see how it's building? Yes. And then before you know it, you've got this key. It's and stunning, that's just one of the sets of instructions. You see here, look, it's showing you how I actually did it, how I put some shading in, and then it goes into padlocks. It holds your hand. Mixing them all the way through. It doesn't assume that you know anything. It goes right from the very first yeah. line through to the finish of the project. That's why I love your instructions so much. Because yeah. so often in art, you get shown a finished thing and you say, OK, go ahead and do it. And you, kind of, you haven't got a clue where you're going. Whereas Sandra takes you step by step. Mm -hmm. So if you want the key and the locks, 16.38 the price, 16, uh, 60 percent, I think now, of the sock of that has gone, KA1281. If you want the keys and locks, 60% gone. And if I show you the finished samples yeah. that I showed you earlier on, there we go, look. There you go, look at that. If you just want the lock and a small key, something small. If you want something slightly bigger, you can take it a lot further. There we go. And again, if you are a beginner, start off with a small key. Something that's not going to daunt you. Not masses of empty white space or whatever. Just do one thing and think, oh, that looks all right, you know. I'll do something a bit, bit, bit bigger next time. And before you know it, you're, you're hooked and you're in there. I, I can't think of a more rewarding hobby than Santangle. And um, as I said before, it's not a case of only Sandra can do it or only certain, only certain you know, talented few people can do it. Um, quite simply, anyone can do this, provided you can hold a pencil or a pen and draw a line or a curve you can santangle, it's as simple as that. But it's the books and the stencils, the combination of those two things and the inspiration live on the shows that Sandra yeah. does that gives you the confidence. It's crazy, isn't it? Yeah, crazy. Book two, 30% yeah. of the stock of book two has gone, remember? And it comes with, don't forget, this is in, in the getting creative with your frames. So there's loads and loads of projects in there. There we go, look, if I just flick through that, you can see there's lots and lots of different projects yeah, in there. I like to write my books, don't I? You do. <laughs> and it's printed beautifully in-house at Santangle HQ on gorgeous quality paper. So all the finished inspiration at the back. You know, you might start off at the back 
and think, can I really do that? Yeah. Yes. And you know, feel free to use it as a workbook and put notes in it. And exactly. If you, if you found a pattern you like, add it to the instructions or go to the back where you've got the outlines and try something. Put a bit of colour on there. Don't, don't sort of look at it as precious. No. Use it and then when you actually go back to it, you've got your notes there of things that you made. Now, the heart of it, obviously, is the frame itself. And that's why Sandra brilliantly has put these frames in the book for you as well. Each one normally about £15. You've got about £60 worth of frames. You get that shape, this shape, which your John calls the waist track. Yeah. I can see why. <laughs> um, then how many... Seven? That's a dodeca, isn't it? Is it 12 sides? Dodeca. Dodeca. Do 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 Sounds about right. Yeah. Yeah. Dodecahedron. And the other oval that you've got there as well. So you get all yeah. four, and they are all relative to the projects that are in the book. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And think about it, you can mix the frames in with the playing cards as well, as we showed you with yeah, that yeah. demo. So mix and match all the... This is the lovely thing. When you buy books and you buy pamphlets from Santangle and Sandra and the stencils, they're not just one-trick ponies. You can use them across... In yeah, yeah, they all mix in with each other. They all do different things. So don't think it's ever just for one. You can mix and match anything that I bring, and ev you know, everything just works beautifully. I love the playing cards, but I absolutely adore oh, I the masquerade this. Oh, this is... Do you know, I, I can't sort of put my finger on which I like best because I've had so much fun with both. And I could have actually gone on another couple of weeks writing more instructions because there's so many things you can do with okay. it. It's crazy. So you get this stencil with the book. Yes. Yes. So you've got the face, you've got the masks, you've got the eyes. And again, proportion, getting that perfectly right is important. That's what the stencil allows you to do. Um, and it's AZ1225. But don't buy it because we've got a deal coming up. But I just want to show you. What does it make you think of? If you've ever, if you've ever been to Venice, have you ever been to Venice? I haven't. No, I haven't. It's quite funny. We went there in December, so it was virtually no one there. Yeah. yeah. But all the shops sell the same thing. They all yeah. sell the masks. Yeah. Identical. There's about 50 shops selling exactly <laughs> yeah, the same, same thing. thing. Yeah. It's crazy, isn't it? It's really ridiculous, but yeah. it's beautiful. Yeah. But look. This is it. But this one, you're gonna, every time you draw this, it's going to look different. Absolutely. Never, ever going to be exactly the same. It makes me think about Masquerade in uh, Phantom yeah. of the Opera. It does. Well, do you know, we, we talk the about masks thing. and it can go quite deep, can't it? It's not just pretty. No. Some of them can be really dark and gothic or some of them you, you can sort of think, well, why are you wearing a mask and what, what does that depict? So there's mm -hmm. a lot of different sort of things that come into this. It's quite a, a deep sort of conversation, this one. OK, so don't buy that because it's £21.99. Um, you can buy it if you want to, but... We've got the backgrounds as well. Now, there are two backgrounds. Yep. Now, these are £10.99. pence. You've got a lovely flourish background. And then you've also got, how would you describe that? Quite geometric. Really, it is. It's, it's, it's almost like cathedral-ish. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that's one I've used, Dave. Uh, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I use them a lot. But actually, um, we talked about these earlier, that the um, these have all been taken from the artwork. Mm -hmm. So if you look at the one on the bottom there, or the top there, yep. that one, look at the closer at the eye. Oh. In the middle, you can see like the little sort of cross square shapes, and then you've got the little cathedral sort of window over the top of it. So it's all come from the artwork. Okay, so they all gonna, they're all going to match basically. So just look at the inspiration on the front of this book. So if you want to go for the masquerade book with, <coughs> excuse me, the full A4 stencil. You've got the masks and you've got the faces and different sizes as well. And if you want the background stencils as well that lend themselves to go well with this collection, we can do a deal on this one for you today as well. That's why we said don't buy the first item we showed you. £35.70, but today you're going to get it for £27.49. And there's no rules with masks. You can make them as flamboyant as you want. You can go wherever you want with it, can't mm. you? And because you've got a full face mm. and you've got a part mask and you've got one on the side slightly, you can take it wherever you want, mix it in with all sorts of things. We did talk earlier about mixing that with the playing cards. Right. You know, and having designs across it and yeah. things like that. You could you could do anything you want. There's so many designs. Let me just show you so some of the finished um, samples oh, here. No. Angie These, Young's done yeah. this. Look at this one. Oh, look at this. Yeah, so this is a, a great example of just doing your own thing with it. You can start from the basic shape, and then once you're sort of confident you're used to it, you can go a little bit uh, different if you want to. It's like a, a tree person, isn't it? It is. Yeah, it's really quite, it. yeah, absolutely. But then, you know, you can go fancy and uh, colourful with it. Very carnival. Absolutely. Carnival, ball, Venice, Venetian, yeah, all those maybe. things spring to mind. You could put what, you could put these on the cards, actually, on the, on the playing cards. Oh, okay. 
Well, I know, because do you know what? A lot of people, when, when you're in class, they love drawing eyes. Mm -hmm. And then people see it when it's then posted. They go, oh, I wish I could do that. So I've actually included the instructions for how to draw book. an eye. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. That's in there too. We did a demo in the first show, and I did it eight steps, three minutes. Oh, really? Uh, yeah, it's eight steps. So that was the one, one o'clock show? That was the one o'clock show. One o'clock show. show. Yeah. So you can watch that back after we yeah, end right at, at the very tonight. end I did that. Yeah. Okay. Don't forget, all our shows, if you can't watch us during the afternoon for whatever reason, you can only watch after like nine o'clock, um, you can quite simply uh, watch them back. Provided we've got stock, you can still order it as well. Beverly in Cardiff says, I Hi, think Beverly. the Musgrave book and stencils would go well with the Day of the Dead book and stencils. Yes, and the backgrounds with that. Yeah. Yes, they would. Very you, good point. You could use elements from both yeah. together to get something a bit different. Very Mexico. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Of course, Day of the Dead isn't morbid. It's celebration. No, it's all life. celebration of life. Yeah, it's exactly. as much colour as you can throw in. Absolutely. Yeah. Which one? Oh. Yeah, look at that. There's, there's you know, the things yeah, that you is can good, do. You just Stop my change eye the shapes you. up a little bit and do your own thing with it. Yeah, love it. Yeah. Twenty-seven forty-nine. Then, if you want the masquerade bundle with the background stencils as well, OG one two two six. Lots of you coming through. Sarah in Hampshire, Ruth in Derbyshire, uh, Alison in Torf Farm. I think that's right. Torfane. Oh. T O R F A E N. Oh, never heard of that. Right. Is that in Wales? Maybe. I don't know. We have to Google that. <laughs> <laughs> if I could spell it. <laughs> But yeah. Right, back right. to you then. Yeah, I thought I'd bring the mask in and we'll just go a little bit freestyle and yeah, see what right. happens. I've actually drawn in one of the playing card shapes because just to sort of show you, you can actually do one in, in there if you want. Mm -hmm. So we could put like the Joker in. You could yep. do a little mask and stuff like that for the Joker. So let's use this. Now I did sort of mention that you've got two sizes. So I'm using the smaller size here. The larger size, you just get the mask in, but not right. much else. So let's, let's do that. By the way, those of you that want the tiles from Sandra and Santangle, they're on the website right now for you in different colourways, but they're great. And again, also because they're quite small, they're yeah, not daunting. Yeah, they're not daunting at all. And you could actually fit this on a, a small tile mm -hmm. as well. So let's draw that. But again, I have actually got a different lip shape, but it's nice that you come in and draw your own if you want to. So let's just put that in. So we've, we've got the starting point. There you go. And so if I come in now and I'm going to add like a little letter M on the top, you see, changes mm -hmm. the, the lips kind of thing. Come back and sort that in see, a little bit. that's the bit. toughest thing to do is to get the eyes and the mouth in the right place. It is, yeah, exactly. So all the proportions done mm. for you. If you want to put the nose in, it's it's here, look. Yeah, a little nod there, a little nod there. Yep. Nose done. You don't need to keep that line in then, but it's done proportionally. And of course, if you wanted to do full head, you could bring that over the top a little bit. Mm -hmm. But let's, let's bring a couple of uh, different bits and pieces in here. So I'm going to... Looks a bit like me when I'm wearing a face mask. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody always knocks on the door, though, don't they, when you've got a face mask going? Mm. You're like, why did you do that? OK, so you can see any, any lines that I don't want, I can rub them out whilst I've got the stencil in place. Let's have a few flowers on. Would these faces fit on the playing card? Can, well, this is, it? Yeah, this is the playing card. Oh, hang on, let me move my rub a bit. So that's the outside shape. Oh, right. And I've actually put so it on there. So that is the playing card that we're putting it on. It yeah. is, yeah, yeah. And the smaller ones, because you've got all smaller, will fit on there. Mm -hmm. So um, let's have a look. Let's put some, you think oh, this is a leaf now? Let's, we could have it a leaf. Let's have it as a feather. How on earth would you change that into a feather? Make it look a bit like a feather at the moment. It doesn't quite, does it? But let's put one going along there, yeah? So if I come in with my pen, and um, let's put a line up the middle there, okay? And then what I could do is I can create a little curve and come back. Curve, come back, curve, come back, curve. Same again, like curve and back, curve and back. See, when you see curve the process, curve. without being told how to do it, you think, I can't do that. But yeah. when you see it, oh yeah, I can do that. That's it. So, I mean, I, I do do a stencil on feathers, but, you know, for, for something like this, it's quite small, so create your own little shapes. They, mm. look, they look really cool. Not everybody, but so many people, when Sandra's here in the green room, meeting other crafters from Sewing Street, from yeah. um, Hobby Maker, Jewelry Maker, so many people do Santangle now. I, I know, I've met a few today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I did sit in the, the green room with Adam for quite a while from Sewing Street, mm -hmm. he was on today. He, last time he was here, I actually gave him a pen and a pencil and I, my sketchbook, I went, let's do this. And he's like, oh, <laughs> and he did it. And we still got, he loves it. And he was like, I can't believe when we did that. That was amazing. 
so yeah, we do that because uh, yeah. Debbie comes to HQ Debbie Robinson now yeah. and again. Yeah, so I've been once yeah, as you've well, been. which was great. I know. Um, but it's, it is that sense of achievement that you've actually done something from scratch because that's what you're doing. Yes. Sandra's giving you the guidance. Um, but I think an awful lot of people, maybe even at school, were intimidated by art, were made to think that they couldn't do it. Maybe their teacher told them that you're rubbish at art. Um, I was told that, Dave. You were told that? Mm. Really? Mm. No, 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 no. Yeah, no. yes. <laughs> do you know what? They wouldn't even have me in an art class. Really? Yeah, they're like, don't take art, you're no good. But do you know what? I actually took textiles, and at the time, it's at the time, back in the day, textiles, but it wasn't, it wasn't like um, sewing clothes like it can be today. Um, we used to walk into class and the teacher would have like a, a, a setup of a few glasses and things. Mm -hmm. I always remember the glass with water and spoons in it. She was like, go and have a go at drawing that. And we're like, we can't draw. She's like, well, it won't, doesn't matter then, does it? Just draw something that looks like it. And we used to draw that image, um, which is where I suppose my drawing started to come because my dad could, so I'd got a bit of something. And then we used to um, split it up in, into different colours and then cut out the paper right. and actually create little patterns. And we used to print them onto fabric. Oh, wow. And we had so much of a better time than art did. We didn't have to write the history of art or anything like that. We just used to play. And that's what I think really started my bug and my love of drawing. Don't let anyone tell you you can't do something. No, that's don't. Don't. Say. Don't. Everyone can do this. Yeah. If you can hold a pen, even if you've got a shaky, wobbly hand or whatever, exactly. doesn't matter. Exactly. Exactly. I was taught, again, at school, just play the recorder because you're no good for anything else. <laughs> now, but that's something I could never thing. do, play the recorder. Yeah. Yeah. The only thing I wish I'd kept up was um, piano lessons. Yeah. Oh, I did, I did piano up to yeah. grade six. Uh, a claim to fame, I played the organ at Truro Cathedral. They let me on that. It was good. And grade eight saxophone. Oh, yeah, I forget you play the saxophone. Yeah. Don't, don't tell me I can't do something. I, know. I think that's the thing. You see, I'm, I'm, making, I'm making things go in here, but what I'm doing, I'm taking elements from the instructions and I'm creating something different mm -hmm. from what the instructions tell me. So I've got rubber somewhere. Let's see, let's take those sort of lips away. So this is my version of something different. We did this flower earlier, this rose, watch this for a rose. See my little circle there? Yeah. Let's bring that curve in there, a curve in there, and then a curl. Oh, wow. Curve. Instant rosebud. Curve. A swirl. Curve. Didn't see that coming. Curve. Swirl. There you go. Put a couple of little lines in. So I've got some feathers. I've got some swirly lines coming again in here. So again, drawing these sort of lines in and then bring it back. So again, you could draw this in pencil first. You don't have to do it in pen straight away. Mm -hmm. But then we think, right, what are we going to do with this? How's this going to be different? So I've just put the little nostrils in there. Again, yeah. don't have to. Now this one in particular, it shows that I've got extra curls and things, and this creates the whole shape. So let's let's see if we can add a little bit of this this hair, this side. So the fringe for this one's going that way. So let's let's do that. We've got a little bit of hair sort of coming down here. Mm -hmm. So let's bring that in and add it in with those curls there. You see, it's one of those sort of. I suppose also, if you wanted to, you could actually curls. make it look quite portrait-like. If you didn't you could, want to go too far, of course, with it. if you wanted to, you, you you can do that because you've got the proportions here. You can then come in and you can take the instructions for the eye yeah. and, and work on that. So let's put this sweeping line across here. Look, okay. I love those rosebuds. They're so great, yeah. aren't they? They're so simple and easy, though. And of course, you know, putting a little bit of watercolor on there. Is, uh, okay, so there you go, see? A little bit of a line there. And then it sort of says, well, I'll bring another one down here. So let's bring another one down here. I reckon we should get um, our producer, Ellie, to go to one of your workshops. I think we should, yeah. I think there should be, yeah. Uh, now, Leslie, hello, Leslie. Hi, Leslie. Leslie Elf in Lincolnshire. Hi, Sandra and Dave. Love doing those roses. They're very Art Deco. Absolutely, they yeah, are. Yeah, they're really nice, like really nice to Morris do. Inspired, maybe? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. A little bit of that kind of uh, era, certainly mm. up, up there in Scotland. Uh, Charles Rennie. Yes, oh, that's it, Rennie Macintosh. Mm. Yeah, Charles yeah. Rennie Macintosh. Yeah, absolutely. See, we've got little, little curls going on there. So I'm creating my own thing. Mm. So 
let's just put this in here. And of course, if you wanted to sort of bring in a bit of a neck, there you go. But then, do you want to draw the eyes? Let's put an eye in. So let's go into there. You see, I've just sort of uh, marked that off either side. Let's give it a little bit of um, an eyelid. Let's, uh, so how many projects have we actually got in the Masquerade book? Do we oh, know? If you have a look on the front cover, Dave. Oh, it's all of these? One, two, three, four, okay. five. Five. Mm -hmm. So all those projects, including the eye, are in the book. And you get the stencil, and you get the background stencils as well for £27.49. It's really cool, isn't it? Um, there's one other that we've not talked about in this show so far that we do Hello. have available is the triangle frame for tangling uh, stencil and little booklet too. So there's your triangle. So if you've gone for maybe the um, frames book two that come with the dodecahedron, was it? Um, yeah, yeah. We've Pentagon. actually, yeah, there's a lovely sample there, Dave, using the racetrack <laughs> <laughs> and the triangle frame together. That this one, one. Yeah. yeah. So it shows that you can mix them all up if you want to, do something a bit different. So if you're going for the frame book two yeah. with that stencil included, the racetrack, then yeah, link yeah, look those Look how it's linked and you've got those lovely flowers. You could do those roses at the bottom if you wanted. That's a good idea. So it's nice to sort of mix and match. It's lovely, isn't it? It's really gorgeous. But of course, if you use the star, turn it round, you end up with the, so the triangle, you end up with the star. Of course. So you sort of get two frames in one, really. So if you want to do yeah. something a bit different. Like and on the instructions, I do show you how to, yeah, there you go, create the star shape. Mm. Yeah. So do a triangle one way, flip yep. it over so it's pointing down, and then you've got your fire. Uh, is it six point star? Yeah, six point star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there we go. Absolutely. So you've got everything step by step from the single triangle right the way through to something more very elaborate and beautiful. I mean, Sandra is there every step of the way. Yeah, there's YouTube, of course, as well. And yep. there's, of course, Facebook as well. They're all there to kind of give you encouragement um, if you are just wanting to kind of dip your toe in and try it. Um, what you'll realise, I think, is mm -hmm. if, you don't, if you don't pick up a pen and don't get some paper, you'll, you'll never do it. No. But just do that first stenciled shape. And you look at that and think, yep. OK, I know where I'm going now because it's not a blank sheet anymore. That's it. That's, That's it. all you need to yeah. do. So I, I'm just <laughs> still sort of playing. It's just uh, a quick sort of version. Let's just put a little bit of shade on those eyes so they don't look a little bit. Okay. And there well, you go. We're nearly there. Let me just remind you of what's coming up tomorrow. Um, the guys are back from Frankfurt tomorrow. So I know I'm going to be doing a show with Andy at uh, six or five o'clock, I think. Yeah, we've got, of course, Carnation Crafts. We've got the Clean and Simple Florals tomorrow at six o'clock and also at two o'clock. I'll be with Sherilyn for that at two. Uh, brand new uh, Hunky Dory for you, the Butterfly Dance at one. Um, deck out large coming with hunky dory and pauline back from her travels complete with dobby um <laughs> she, she wants dobby i think i'm going to take him home with me four o'clock we got uh tailor-made journals rue de la memoir uh then we've got brand new from hunky dory with the butterfly dance again clean and simple from carnation at six and amy dodd the lovely amy with a brand new usb full of lots of cutting files for your cutting machines that you will not want to miss with like an easter come spring feel to it so that's uh, tomorrow evening and tomorrow afternoon mm -hmm. so i've just added just a little bit of shading around i mean you could you know this is more like a portrait sort of thing isn't it than a mask yeah but you can see where it can start to sort of form different things and then of course adding extra details on there bringing some color in it's it's just uh, it's, it's crazy when you think that we've just picked a few bits off the stencil yeah used exactly. a little bit of an instruction in there added in the the eyes, job done. Well, let me just show you again the masquerade quickly. It's a full-size A4 booklet, this, but those are the projects that you can do in, on the inside. Now, I'm a big fan of monochrome, but also um, we, we did some colour, didn't we, when I came to your workshop? Yes, we and did. And it's the first time I'd actually used colour I know, in yeah, Santa, yeah, and I'm yeah. a fan of that now Scared as well. rabbits, but you were fine. <laughs> <laughs> but here we go, look. For every page, lots and lots of inspiration. I love the fact you've included the eye demonstration. Yeah, I think that's there. really important just to sort of give you that option if you want to do the mask but with somebody wearing it. Yes. You need to know how to do that. Absolutely. Uh, and of course, the stencil's got all the facial shapes, the eye shape, everything that you need. So proportionally, you can get everything in the right place, which is half the battle won. And then you've got, of course, the masquerade masks that you can do in there too. Uh, but you don't just get the main A4 stencil you also get these background stencils as well uh we've just got the flourishes and you've also of course got that geometric cross yeah. there as I, well i did ink through them at the one o'clock show so if you want to see them a little bit closer and how they ink through that i did actually do that at sure. one o'clock so well one three and of course this show at uh, seven o'clock that was your 
three, is it three shows or four shows? I've done today? three shows Three today. shows today, yeah, so one, three and, yeah. and seven. So you can watch back one yeah. and three if you want to. All friends um, together. Please do check out your baskets. These are restocked items. They were, most of them sold out this afternoon. So we've been able to get more stock back of the book frames two. Uh, or Frames Book 2, sorry. Um, the Masquerade we've got back as well. And don't forget the playing cards. How much fun to I do Santangle playing cards. Yeah, it's like my craft room looking at you. <laughs> Everything's everywhere. Everything's it's everywhere. Fun. That's me. Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> if you want the playing card background stencils as well, they're going to come with it too. But a bit of fun from Sandra and Santangle. You're back soon, hopefully. Uh, yeah, next week. Next week? <laughs> yeah, next week. Fantastic. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we'll see you soon well, then. Yeah, see you soon. Brilliant. And I'll see you tomorrow at two o'clock for Carnation. And Sherilyn will be back opening things up at one tomorrow afternoon. No, mate. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker.